चालू झालं का माझा आवाज पण येतोय का अजून नाही एक मिनिट बगीचे हा बगीचे अटॅकिंग फेरू या Guys, how did you like the song?
Hello, hello, hello. Welcome everyone for the 13th round of Candidates 2024. How are you all in the chat? We have a vote there. Check that out. And we also have here Harshit Raja. After a long time, Harshit. Hello, hello, hello guys. Welcome to the penultimate round. I am so excited to join you, Amruta. Because... These two rounds is going to basically decide who we will see in the World Championship match against Ding Liren. So, super excited for especially today's game of Gukesh against Firuja. That's the game that we will be most excited about. And guys, we have a very special news that we might have the camera of Gukesh live from Toronto. Yes, absolutely, Harshit. It's right there. Uh, a big, big shout out to Fide for, you know, considering this and giving us uh, Gukesh's camera for the last two rounds. It's brilliant. Also, guys, big thanks to you all because, you know, you have been watching the videos. We've got so many views. We've got a great response and support for Gukesh. So that definitely helps. So everything is like all of it together. Yeah, it's like a whole sphere there and every this kindness. Yes, but... One second, Harshit. Uh, people are saying Harshit in a professional attire today. Kya baat hai? And also, there is a wardrobe there, Harshit. Ekdam hi badiya yeah. wala. <laughs> One second, let me just. Uh, Kaha gaye tum? Yaha pe. We have are a. Are are Haan, matlab, a mess every in my half an hour, Harshit is going to wear a new blazer, it seems. <laughs> how, how is that idea, Harshit? If Gukesh finds a good move. Then you uh, then change, change your, your attire. <laughs> <laughs> yes, absolutely. And also, I'll take you quickly to the pairings because I think you wanted to talk about that. So, just yeah. showing everyone that here we have the last two, two days, third, round number 13 and round number 14. These are the pairings, Harshit. Yeah. And uh, we have the three players currently tied for the first place. Hikaru, Nepo and Gukesh. And closely chasing them is Fabiano Caruana who is playing with the black pieces against Caruana today. And here we see the standings. Gukesh, Nakamura and Hikaru all tied at 7.5. And, and Nepo Mnyashi is playing with the white pieces against Hikaru. So another big, big match for the standings. Amruta, it's like... Uh, we are in an F1 race and they are on the last two laps basically and uh, this is going to decide everything. Wow, I have not seen F1 race but I get the emotion Harshit for sure. <laughs> are you a fan of uh, F1? Uh, um, I am I am just a fan of watching car races in general because I used to love this movie series Fast and Furious so that kind of developed my... Uh, desire of you know car racing. Ah, okay. I I only love uh, you know about F one. I only love the Bishop on F one, the light square Bishop. <laughs> are, 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 are. <laughs> That's my favorite. <laughs> but these are the standings Actually, here. Yes. And I had a funny joke of someone. So shout out to that person who said, "Do you know why the Bishop on F F one is the fastest piece?" Ah, wow. That's or the white Bishop. The white bishop is the fastest piece and the answer was because it starts on F1. So kind of a funny yeah. chess joke. That's a nice one. That's so cool. Amazing. <laughs> and remembered actually, but, Amruta, uh, also, uh, Pragnananda unfortunately doesn't have a chance for the candidates. But still, you know, all our Indian players are still looking for a strong finish. So even if standings wise, they might not be able to uh, clinch the first place, Prag and Vidit. They're still going to be looking to end their tournament on a high note, which totally. would in turn like uh, mess up the chances of Karwana, for example. If Prag manages to win today, Fabi is going to be out of it. So very exciting mm -hmm. match that as well. Yeah, otherwise actually Fabi does have a chance. Uh, we cannot just forget that. Maybe not, yeah. you know, Harshit, because one of the reasons is Nepo versus Hikaru. For sure, half a point there. Uh, I mean, uh, if it ends in a draw, if somebody wins, then it's clear. And last round also, mm -hmm. Hikaru versus Gukesh. And Nepo is playing against Karuana. 
yeah there is some chance because that in that karuana beats nepo hikaru draws ah. with guke something like that for some karuana they, like yeah. we keep yeah. calculating for guke you know all the best in fact all the worst results of our fathers maybe but, but guys uh, guke is playing with the white pieces against ali reza and ali reza not having you know any chance in terms of uh, the tournament standings is definitely going to want to spice up the things which is exactly what kukesh is hoping for ki yaar please play something exciting and not some boring or something so we get an exciting <laughs> game some yeah. nachdorf maybe because that would mean that gukesh's chances to at least have a chance yeah. of getting a complicated game and in those complications maybe he would you know uh thing that right now being in good shape he might be able to outplay firuza totally but you know what firuza will say anyway i want to play something exciting because firstly that's my style and secondly if i get to beat gukesh that's another thing he is such a rising star yeah. so i think he will go in for the, it he will go for it because in the first game gukesh was guys if you remember that game in the time pressure and which was a heartbreak for gukesh in this tournament but he did manage to come back like a super monster but he it was that game with ali reza which kind of uh you know kindled the fire within him to come back stronger because uh ali reza actually beat gukesh in the first mm. round where gukesh had a close to winning position amruta yeah that was a little bit of a heartbreak in a way now that we imagine if that half point or even one point gukesh had he would have been a sole leader but uh, you know round robin uh, we cannot just calculate like that Uh, also harshad yeah. i want to take you to the women standings because uh, yeah. we have tan zongi being the sole leader followed by leiting chi and lano and humpy and goriachkina all three of them on 6 and vaishali who has had a hat trick she uh, she is now on 5 and 1/2 points nurgil on 4 and 1/2 and anna muzichuk on 4 and 1/2 if today uh, rem- i just rem- got uh, got this idea that if vaishali scored three wins and if Uh, nakamura scored three wins both of them had a hat trick nakamura might yeah. even think i want to go for five out of five it could be that long attitude. castle <laughs> long castle and short castle both <laughs> so these are the women's uh, standings and we have the pairings quickly here nurgil versus yeah. lano tan versus mm-hmm. goriachkina so for the for tan it's going to be an important round humpy versus anna and vaishali is playing late in g so we will see yep. if she can strike back uh, there but uh, these Definitely. are the pairings and th- this yeah, is the if i could make another analogy it's like in f1 every second counts uh, in the last few laps and amruta in this last two games of the candidates every move counts so guys <laughs> we are rooting for every move uh, and we are hoping that you know with every move more complications develop and amruta i am here for a treat even if i am a commentator i am looking forward to follow the action as closely as i can kya baat hai harshit maza aane wala hai but before we go into that i want to quickly take some 2 minutes for uh, you know this thing just wanted to show this guys mm-hmm. harshit played in st louis and leon won the a group tournament which is amazing yep. and harshit Dude. we have yep. second in group b so harshit congratulations thanks a lot amruta yes i had a, i did not end the tournament uh, with a victory but uh, i still uh, secured second place so i'm quite happy with my result again 16 rating points so climbing back to my uh, new goals that i've created for myself so very happy with my performance and uh, I think definitely some credit of that goes to you know commentating and being in touch with chess and following such high level chess that I can kind of emulate some of that in my own play. This is amazing to know. You know, if commentary can be taken as a chess training, then we are going to have many <laughs> more grandmasters and many more commentators. But look at this. I love that T-shirt uh, which you're wearing. The stand with I don't know what's written there. But... It's Ukraine. It stand with ah, Ukraine and the chess pieces in it. Correct. Yeah, and the blue and uh, yellow pieces uh, portray the fl- color of the flag that Ukraine has. Absolutely, this is amazing and nice shirt here, uh, Levon. It somehow remember we remind it reminds of us uh, Levon style. <laughs> so uh, yeah, great uh, great result there. Love this article by Shahid. 
and uh, that, guys that is what i wanted you to know that harishit just played a tournament and is back from uh, st louis here to share with uh, yep. to share his insights with us and in the chat by the way harishit we have a lot going yep. on but uh, who's there yeah we the camera can we just look at the full screen once let me see if everything is all right cool wow That's cool we we will we'll might even the... see sagar maybe <laughs> <laughs> sagar bhai might come and say hi in the camera yeah at some point <laughs> ah yeah first in first 10 minutes Yes, that's possible. In the chat, uh, Harshit, today, what? Wh- uh, why is everyone saying justice for me? I am not understanding, guys. क्या कुछ भी नहीं हुआ है सब life is good, nothing is wrong, all good. Oh look, Muruta Firuja has come on the board, wearing all black because he is playing with the black pieces today. Oh, that's such a good spot because yes, he was And wearing. And Agar Ba, रे क्या बात है क्या बात है let's go here looking And cute one second let's go here कहाँ गया गुकेश का कैमरा one second अरे very सागर भाई yeah oh there he is sitting down and taking pictures guys find सागर शाह in the video <laughs> you there he is चलो time पे पहुँच गए हैं <laughs> That's so funny. Hmm. What do you think, Harshad? How is Ali Reza's mood here? He looks. I mean, one thing about all these players is that no matter what result they had the last day, they are able to come back the next day with the same strength as they had before the tournament. I mean, they are. Hmm. I mean, and Firuja loves chess. Amrutha. He loves chess. I've seen him play blitz all night for hours and hours continuously. so he knows how to recover from a win because in blitz you know when you lose a game you play the next game immediately you know how you are able to bounce back so firuja you know you see here he is like okay let's do it he is kind of shaking his head that come on let's come back in this tournament so far it's not gone well but come on two more rounds let's let's end well so he will fight back with the black pieces maybe we see e4 c5 sicilian if at all in such a crucial game it happens it would be crazy no it would be crazy and uh, firuja is someone who loves exciting chess and gukesh we all know doesn't back down he is always interested and curious about complications and um, we saw his game against uh, nijad abasov uh, the day before the rest day amruta where he found this insane move i was talking about knight to h7 and somehow managed to outplay abasov with the black pieces um so this is this, this is definitely going to be our uh, you know game of focus especially with our cameras uh, focusing on them but also the other games amruta today is just you know like uh, ek ice cream ka flavor is really good it's our favorite this this one it it probably some chocolate flavor for most of the guys but then there is also this fresh strawberry ice cream that also is speaking our interest so we need to decide and maybe you know get a double scoop or something like that mm, so uh, no one second which is the strawberry ice cream maybe the other games i mean my favorite is chocolate so for me oh, i'm okay. i was saying this uh, for me actually even guys what's your favorite ice cream flavor but nepo versus nakamura is important for us to keep a watch on uh, you know from yeah, bukesh's uh, candidate's sure. perspective so that is something which we will follow and of course any other game and which Prag- goes Prag- super and crazy and prakarwana also a big game yeah As a matchup, definitely there. We already have yeah. a super chat by Joy Datta. It's a super exciting day. Today, Guki ko jeetna hai. Jeetna hai. I don't know, but maybe even draw. Uh, actually, today, in terms of the um, what to say, ranking list, that is something he's going to target Ali Reza. But uh, let's see. Jo bhi hai, we have to play solid. We have seen that one loss, then you are just completely out. So yeah. slow and steady is also fine. Oh boys, there's a handshake, mm-hmm. and the battle is going to start very soon, guys. Gukesh, F T W Gukesh, O P in the chat. He is ready. Look at him, Amruta. He is ready. He means business. Um, oh, there are a lot of media. Everyone wants to take a picture of the man in form right now, Gukesh, and Amruta. He looks calm as ever. Look at his ferocious eyes. 
at at which point have you seen him you know tensed before the game like he he has a different kind of calmness intense calmness i would call it right when there are when you are playing such a high stake match when there are lots of cameras around you hundreds of thousands of people watching you live and you are still able to dissolve that pressure and perform as you would on a normal day it just exemplifies the kind of focus you need and gukesh is that's why the guy everyone is you know so excited to watch amruta i am getting the best seat in the playing i'm getting the best seat to watch this game i'm super excited vip seat we have a vip seat maza aa raha hai joy says what is the prediction for today amruta guki ko jeetne ke liye aaj kya special actually my prediction is not for one day but in general from the very beginning i have been saying that the indian an indian will win the uh, candidate so that was my prediction and right now if it's gukesh who has the chance so my prediction is that he will win the tournament and sagar shah with his phone over there slow and steady wow. <laughs> look at the camera view i mean you can see him adjusting the pieces through sagar's camera <laughs> yeah what a picture actually to take is become an expert videographer sagar has no <laughs> privacy right now <laughs> but look at look at gukesh yeah what do you think he is thinking about like he definitely do you think he like likes to meditate like with it does or do you think he is like going over the openings you know we kind of see him adjusting his uh, suit looking very sharp by the way but what do you think he is thinking about guys i th- meditation yeah i think uh, harshit he might be more of just calming himself down uh, and making his mm-hmm. nerves uh, stronger here i am not sure he mm-hmm. wouldn't be calculating anything on the board because that something he's done already from home and after first move he can put that energy but yeah he mm-hmm. does look a little bit more into a ma- mindful mode i would say In, not meditative but a mindful mode oh his eyes are is his eyes closed i was trying to see i think his yes, eyes are closed to me now it is wow it's the calm before the storm it's the calm before the storm abhi aag bande par jab khulenge amruta they are going to see some crazy moves and calculations um piruja on the other hand but you know harshit i want to mention one thing that uh, firstly we have this camera and we are able to enjoy these moments so guys a uh, big thanks to fide like really really uh, they have been supportive so do check out their shop also because uh, we yeah. have a chess base coupon code you can see the pinned oh, link prag prag in background <laughs> ah yeah there we go so you can see the pinned link over there and you can check the catalog it's super amazing maybe you can buy some stuff because they have a they have some very interesting things actually harshit they have a fide candidates mm-hmm. chess board which is which oh, will, wow. which has a bidding actually wow. so that's uh, very cool and interesting and they also have some uh, you know beautiful or uh, uh, they had this world championship of uh, ding versus nepo so uh, they have a mm-hmm. very nice autographed some different kind of poster which is amazing very limited edition kind of a thing so uh, mm-hmm. it's it's superb it's great later i will show you at some point at some moment right now we'll focus on gukesh but do check mm-hmm. that out and maybe we uh, we just, i mean that's our way to support fide and by that to support everybody here yeah sagar bhai op yes wow. ho gaya uska i think he's done <laughs> shooting around full circle <laughs> i think there might be a rule ki you know you can only take pictures before 5 minutes or something of the game so that after that when the games begin or maybe 5 minutes, minutes no, into after, the game so that after yeah. the game begins uh, until 10 5 or 10 minutes, minutes yeah. generally that's the so that after the opening stage thode moves ho gaye the players can you know focus and have no uh, camera flashes or something because uh, that might be something that you know the players won't be comfortable with so yeah now the players are just waiting like us you know <laughs> especially 3 minutes to go guys Harshit, when you are in a tournament and somebody people are taking your photos uh, in the round, does does it disturb you? I think Amruta, what happens is that you just get into the zone, or then as I said, that you are just thinking about the moves, you are just so excited and like nervous about the game that the the picture kind of you know 
यू डोंट रियली लाइक पहले स्टार्टिंग में फर्स्ट टू डेज यू माइट गेट अ लिटिल एंशियस पर बाद में यू जस्ट यू नो गेट इन द रूटीन सो आई थिंक द प्लेयर्स उनको अभी रूटीन हो गया कि यू नो दे आर यूज्ड टू इट या एंड ऑफ कोर्स इफ यू आर प्लेइंग कैंडिडेट्स वो तो होने ही वाला है पीपल आर गोइंग टू कम बिहाइंड यू सो सही है आज डॉन शाह रिकैप होगा Amazing. Harshit <laughs> brings some great energy. Says Kavita. I completely agree. By the way, I am running in a minute and coming back. Very sorry, Harshit, because last moment a lot of things today. So I'll just be back okay, in a okay, minute. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. Sure. <laughs> Guys, what's your prediction for today's game? I predict. I predict Gukesh is going to win. Then Nepo is playing with the white pieces against Thikaru. I think Nepo will, you know, want to win, but he'll also be like, I cannot lose this game. So he will be like, okay, maybe draw is not the worst result. So I'm, I'm predicting that either Nepo will push for a little bit, but mostly it will go for a draw. But Prague Karuana, I am actually have no idea how that game will go, uh, because Fabi needs to kind of uh, somehow make a game interesting, even if he's playing with the black pieces. So that game, I'm predicting a result actually. Fabi Prague versus Fabi, you're predicting a result, yeah. And Nepo versus Naka, yeah. what is your prediction? Nepo uh, versus Hikaru. I said right now that uh, Nepo will want to win, but at the same time, he knows that a loss would be a very bad result for him at this stage of the tournament. So he will, you know, be cautious in terms of uh, uh, in terms of his aggressiveness. Mm. But uh, you think uh, Naka will completely go for a uh, for the kill? Any chance? Definitely not, Amruta, because he is playing black today. But he knows that if he is able to draw today, tomorrow he will be white against Gukesh, and that Nepo will be playing against Fabi. So Nepo will have a very hard time, you know, uh, defending with the black pieces. So I think Hikaru's oh. strategy. Oh, games have started. Handshake. What's the first move, guys? E four. I am praying Sicilian, please. Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> okay, no more prayers today. Itali Italian knight f three. Let's let's see, guys, because we'll see a lot of moves now. Knight c six. So bishop, where will he go? C four or b five? B five. Lopez. Whoa. Whoa. Can you have the live board maybe yes. somewhere? Let's go uh, because it will keep changing. The angle will yes. keep changing. So maybe now we come back here. I love this can... angle. Yes, Bishop B five. Firuja is thinking. Firuja is thinking whether to go A six, whether to go Berlin, or do something like Prague and go F five. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's not forget F five, the move of the full tournament, I would say. But I think Firuja cho uh, choosing E four E five already means that he, does he want to just go solid and uh, you know not lose maybe? What say? Um. Not sure because we've also seen a lot of exciting games, uh, even in the Royal Opus. We've seen a lot of people try some funky mm -hmm. stuff like F5. We've also seen some like you know A6, some others. So I mean, I'm I, I think whatever Black does, it's going to be exciting because after Knight F6, I think Black White will simply respond with D3. Oh, what Amruta also. In the yeah. other game, Nepo versus Nakamura. Yeah. Just to uh, just looking on the live board here. Was also bishop b5 a6 bishop a4 and this very modern move bishop c5. Just one so second. So what is sorry. yes? So here we have Ray Lopez. Here also we have Ray Lopez. No, at this point here Pragnananda versus Karuana we have Sicilian. Kya baat hai? And uh, yeah. Vidit versus Ali Nijat we have Petrov. Just to check the openings which were played, but we are. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry, at Gukesh's game and Knight of Sixty Three happened. Rakshit, what you were mentioning, you are also Bishop C Five. Rakshit is very good at predicting everything. <laughs> Again, you know, if I read something in the chat or then it's I'll I'll take care, Harshit. I will take care today. Only you. first and the last mistake, bars, please. Let me get the bars. And while Harshit is looking at the position, because Bishop C Five here, what is Arkangels? Is my question to you. I get confused between the move bishop c5 again and again. Here also we have it, but in this case there is a6 move added. Does yeah. that make a difference? 
so it's, that's something you sh- yeah it's a very new way of playing it so hikaru is definitely trying to play something maybe surprise uh nepomniachtchi and get slightly out of his preparation because uh he definitely wants to play a position which he has analyzed more than his opponent mm. um and in this game amruta firuja versus uh, gukesh this bishop b5 d3 bishop c5 castle uh knight d4 played a uh, very solid line but at the same time uh i i think there have been some games even by arjun in this line and what's white's idea is c3 uh and then at some point king h1 and f4 wow yes um so this line even if it has very solid and drawing tendencies in general i think uh, it can be some some line which kukesh has a very nuanced idea in because he's playing very quickly yeah he i am just setting the bar that's why i was not talking to you like i was looking at the screen and i am almost done give me a moment i have added mm-hmm. a few bars but uh, that's the space maybe i have another bar to add uh, maybe nakamura nepo there is some space we'll do it later but harsh harshit as you were mentioning here knight d4 this is very modern the bishop c5 move and all that which is happening yeah. i like the idea no, with king h1 well f4 because it gives gukesh the chance to uh, play mm-hmm. rash but still should he do that <laughs> i don't think rash is the right word i think I, I honestly like he has definitely prepared some idea and whatever he will play today i'm pretty sure that he has taken a look at very seriously in his preparation of the candidates because uh, berlin is one of the most common lines amruta so look he's playing very quickly because i'm telling you he has a lot of uh, knowledge in this line i'm 100% sure kyunki this line amruta is so common uh, that his seconds would have made sure that gukesh has some idea oh so so d5 come as a natural move okay even if the king is in the center what what will white do here i he can take on d5 that's one option uh, the point is that if cd5 um bishop b5 check and bishop d7 let's say i can take and if you go queen d7 then i have knight f3 and white already gets quite a big advantage nice. because normally um, this bishop on d4 is uh, you know it's a very unusual it's not there and uh, yeah. when you have the pawn on c2 and so early in the opening yeah and like already we can see some tactical ideas after knight f3 amruta queen e7 let's say uh, would be a big blunder because <laughs> let's ask the chat Let's ask the chat. Maybe the first question for today, just to warm up, white to play. What are you going to play? Maybe we should ask the second move, no, uh, Harshit. Yeah, I mean it's a very forceful continuation. So if they find, uh, if they find the first move, I'm assuming they have seen the idea. Okay, chat is like, kya sawal hai ye? Se kon karta hai? Hamare saath and all that. But don't worry. We have got so many answers already. Let me just quickly show you guys. Knight d4, Sharvil, bad karma, Satyam, deadly, Surbhi, anonymous, Aryan, Deepam, Ayush, and Mahek. You guys have got it right. The move is Great knight job. d4. Yep. Four, ed4, and pin the queen to the king, and you win the game. Um. So yes, something like this, you know, could be a uh, trouble so you, you have to be very careful with black i think d6 if i'm not mistaken uh, is considered to be a very decent and solid move because you protect the e5 pawn so that after knight to f3 you can move your bishop back to b6 ah and then you don't have the f4 idea so instead f4 of knight of uh, knight of 3 can white go king, king h1, h1? Ah, but i think this there is some problem something here. this could be the idea but now you know knight to g4 amruta might be something you have to be careful yeah. about because suddenly if you go a move like f4 ah uh, yes sorry so you go f4 there might be some crazy shot here do you see it uh no i mean knight e3 right oh you can go knight h2 yeah mm yes Arshit exactly some like kill this it. i mean For, it's an yeah, idea okay. got it that's a cool idea because yeah. if you take the pattern oh, is something oh actually white to play 
after night h2 very good question is white to play okay intermediate now, move. Move. now find it chat <laughs> white to play what are you going to do here guys kaisa lag raha hai how guys are you feeling tense today we also have a poll uh which was i have to check the results currently we had asked gukesh versus ali reza penultimate electrifying clash we uh, had a very nice title today electrifying penultimate round so the uh -huh. poll is can't think draw will relax me 8% people said gukesh wins all hearts 77% ali reza breaks indian hearts 7% and i don't know i am so tensed 8% <laughs> so that is the poll but uh, people are all in positive for gukesh today let's see amruta i'm excited to see how many of the people have solved this answer what i thought the correct move is queen to h5 wow and 72 people have oh. found queen but tell me we have 60 answers for bishop f7 so wo to move we have, have to consider as well a oh, very very nice idea the point being king f7 then you want queen to h5 check but guys sometimes sometimes the threat is better than the execution that's why queen to h5 threatening queen f7 checkmate uh, if you go back amrutha uh, yeah one more move yeah queen to h5 threatening queen f7 mate and threatening to take on h2 now uh, is the best move in my opinion but uh, uh anyways very good job of finding this theme of bishop f7 in general so uh, some very you know in a very innocuously equal looking position there can be some tactical ideas for uh, both sides right absolutely right and uh, that's why this opening which seem like berlin and rai lopez it's it's as good as sicilian right now i can say that <laughs> i love i love it that firuja is thinking he is oh. thinking for 6 7 minutes now um so maybe is recalling his preparation but already a slightly good sign for gukesh so maybe we can just uh, have a quick look at um, you know what the opening is just uh, one moment here because 9 minutes at this point why would he be thinking and has gukesh brought in something new on the board So let's just I think yeah. this is all fairly known, but maybe he's thinking what line to play or maybe what to play which Gukesh hasn't seen. Let's quickly go to yeah, knight f three, bishop b five, knight f six, and if you play, press enter, guys, on the chess base uh, analysis board, if you press enter, then you can see the live database, which basically gives you access to all the games that have been played in the current position that you have on the board. Wow. Um yeah that's just one D3. play actually you're right and uh, d3 23000 games almost here yeah very common bishop c5 also very common castles knight d4 also main move take take and knight d2 so far everything is quite well known but still very um, less games you know 200 games in comparison to the main, super main lines would be yeah Okay, but you are saying that he won't be surprised. He knows that he's only yeah. recollecting. He's only thinking yeah. how to continue. Because c six bishop c four. If you look at it, if you make those uh, moves on the board, ah. bishop c four. Um, who has played this with white? Eric, uh, no, with white. Not very. Uh, I mean, known player. I guess I bishop a four was more yeah, common. Yeah, exactly. Look at this. Bishop c four, which is slightly rare, actually. Correct. So Bishop A4 Karuana has played. Par Pono Mario, Ivanchuk, Hari, Nepo. Yeah, a lot of games. In fact, Anish. Yeah. Yeah. So it's pretty pretty well known. And with the black pieces, so Kramnik, Firuza, Aronian, Vishi has played it. Raja has played it. Many players. So Bishop oh, C4. Oh, if you said Firuza has played it, if he, if ah, Firuza has played oh, it for with that, then. uh he has definitely looked at this position and he has uh, so that means bishop c4 may be a small deviation to take firuja out of his preparation amruta ah correct that's why he's thinking otherwise he's not going to spend yeah. time in th he knows he comes under time pressure so definitely yeah. is a very important point we got to know he's played that and bishop c4 so d6 has been i think d5 has not been played much one yeah. game or something like that yeah. Five uh, basically 
is a little too early with your king still in the center amruta um, usually it's a good idea to you know break in the center when your king is not in the center so that uh, you won't face problems uh, with uh, your king coming under attack oh that's amazing so now we have the whole picture of uh, what's happening in gukesh versus ali reza open oh, support moves actually and Very i think cool. we have transport c3 bishop, uh, bishop b6 bishop, bishop b3 and and now go back to the board because okay. we have transposed ah because you're saying bishop a4 bishop b3 would lead to the yeah. same thing yeah let's say d6 try to make these moves now c3, d6 c3 bishop b6 bishop, bishop b3 bishop b and now look yeah more games it's transposition yeah so now we have the top players pono mario has played this david navara has played this and with white anish has played with david so let's just wow. quickly look at what anish had gone for mm hmm something like this yeah solid opening with uh, you know you can have chances uh huh so a5 played by feruja and does does gukesh still remember this move he's thinking he's looking up he's recalling his, whenever people look up uh, amruta that usually means that they are recalling his their preparation and i think he knows it he's just making sure what I had checked. Kya tha move? Kya tha move? And he will soon, I think, play either a4 or oh, look at this camera angle! Wow. You know they have such a little camera, like it's so mini, uh, and it's placed near the board. It's just amazing what uh, you know you are Fantastic. able to get the angles. Yeah, he's thinking. He's recalling his preparation. Um. What I pressure you can for... feel, no, uh, Harshit? Like right now, this game, in a way, you can't lose. That is something like you know yeah. somewhere at the back of the mind, the result uh, would matter. So and yeah, it's such a huge pressure. All eyes on you <laughs> at seventeen, <laughs> at the age of seventeen. And if he wins, the candidates will be the you know after Bobby Fisher, he'll be the youngest. Definitely crazy. crazy. crazy oh and there is i think the is that a photographer in the background yes yeah, so i think maybe i think this is the last minute probably of when they can be inside um, and gukesh super focused amruta already he, you see him oh hikaru is watching he also wants to make sure uh, to see what the opening is because now amruta the players also have to check ki what is happening on the other boards Ah yes, we'll also quickly go to Nepo Naka and all other boards. No name, just Indian yeah. says one and half billion eyes on Gukesh. <laughs> yes, <laughs> one definitely. and half. But you know, I disagree with you. I think uh, the current population of the world is eight billion, and I think uh, <laughs> all eight billion eyes on Gukesh. <laughs> Let's go here. Let's check other games while Gukesh is thinking. After a five, could be possible that Ali Reza is well prepared here. But anyway, Gukesh is never, you know, worried about any opening surprises. He can always yeah. figure it yeah. out on the board. So let's go to Nepo versus Naka from standings perspective. Yes. Very important game. Yes. This is actually Amrutha. If you take it from, yeah, we saw the this move, Bishop C five, uh, early Bishop C five, yeah. castles, yeah. Um, Knight F six, Knight E seven, sorry, C three, castle, a Knight G six, uh, sorry. D4, Bishop A7, and Bishop G5, F6 only move. Bishop comes back to E3, short castles, Knight D2, and I think Amruta, if you look at this position in chess base, I am pretty sure Nihal Sarin has played this with both the black side and the white side. If you just could confirm that, if okay. you go into our Let's, main uh, just... chess base uh, analysis board. Let's just check that out. Uh, here we have a six, a four, bishop a four, bishop c five, c three, yeah, yeah, so g e seven. Actually, Mame Dara has played it. Grishchuk has played it. Okay, c three, knight g six, d four, bishop a seven, bishop g five, f six, bishop back, castle, 
and night d2 can you just check if nihal has some games i remember yes. nihal wow. playing this like what a memory grishuk against grishuk yes i i think nihal was you know he used really like this idea to kind of take opponents out of their preparation so um maybe hikaru also with some similar ideas you know of this f5 break wants to somehow create his own chances and take nepo out of his familiar territory this is so cool because that does say something about nepo's psychology then today uh, sorry naka who is black i forgot <laughs> nakamura is black so, ah, so yaar, nakamura wants to win is nihal the speed chess champion helping another speed I chess champion i was going to ask that what a good question ooh <laughs> that would be interesting that would be crazy what if <laughs> because if they win then maybe they will reveal or maybe for world championship they won't but uh... yeah no i'm just joking i mean uh, very i mean everyone just nowadays is so well prepared amruta and taking ideas from all these players you know these youngsters nihal arjun gukesh all these youngsters uh, the stars have a uh, great opening preparation and uh, all the experienced players like hikaru know this and maybe they also want to emulate and try to uh, play the same ideas and ed4 lot of moves being played here quickly they prepared so many moves so cd4 uh, or bishop d4 cd4 looks more natural d4 but looks natural d5 and then you don't like the bishop maybe but then you don't like this bishop hmm. also <laughs> I think Hikaru has definitely prepared this and cooked something in his preparation. We will hear more about it in his recap video, <laughs> where he will let us. For uh, Gukesh's perspective, by the way, A5, yeah. he's still thinking. Oh, he's still thinking. Yeah, okay. for Gukesh's perspective, what would you say is the best result of Naka versus Nepo? What's the best result of? Naka versus Nepo for I mean which can favor Gukesh or does it matter or does it not last round I think uh, Gukesh plays Naka uh, I think it's so hard to say Amruta because Gukesh plays against Hikaru in the last round and Nepo played against Fabi so I was actually having a discussion in the Saint Louis tournament with, alongside other Indian grandmasters and other. a uh, very strong uh, grandmasters and no one knew what the best scenario for anyone is they are all like anything can happen and we just want to see ki kya hoga yaar yeah but uh, you know whatever normally whenever there is confusion and we don't know for sure cbi chat knows everything for sure so they are saying mm -hmm. draw is the best result mm -hmm. i think because look if naka wins and uh, let's say if gukesh wins it's different but still huge pressure yeah and if yeah. they have a draw then even today in terms of this the pressure is a little less because you don't lose your uh, joint lead even if you end up drawing the game I mean, if i guess if they draw and gukesh wins that's definitely the most ideal like that's for sure mm. um if gukesh manages to win he's going to i mean he's he's going to have very good chances going into the last round so that like his strategy is clear ki i want to win and whatever happens on the other board what can we do about that yeah that's true so uh oh. now here we are uh, prag versus karwana can we have a look at mm -hmm. it because it's sicilian and that's my, what's your favorite opening harshit i love the najdor with black but you love like for you for you love sicilian yeah Yes, it's my favorite. Awesome. Knight F6. Actually, Fabi played this uh, in a previous round in the candidates too. So he's repeating what he had already played. Surprising. Hmm. Something like E5 happened. D3, Queen C7, Knight D2. Knight D2. And E5. E5. A4, Bishop E6. Hmm? E3. We are at this position with Prague having one hour forty-eight minutes on the clock. Fabi having one hour fifty minutes on the clock. They are on move number eight. What do you think? Yeah, and now position? we see that Black has two bishops, but we know that uh, bishops do better when the position is open. And now the position is kind of closed, and I myself uh, prefer this position with White because let's say at some point you go knights. 
See for Amruta, maybe let's say for example. Okay, um, I'll make it a move. And yeah, maybe let's say if Black has to take, for example. Yeah. Um, and you can take with the B pawn. Um, and uh, you we see that the White Bishop on C one is so much better than the Bishop on E seven once it comes on this uh either B two uh, A one H eight diagonal or even if White can somehow have these ideas with uh Knight, let's say castles. Knight H four and F four. Wow, for sure, because the light square bishop uh, being out of the board is uh, much. It's very very much favoring white, right? Mm hmm. But where is the break? F four is the only break for white. F four uh, is the break. Are you going to uh, focus on the B pawn or something? Actually, yes. If black goes B six, Amruta, very nice idea. If black goes B six, A five is a very nice strategic idea. uh we have we have kind of known this like minority attack basically the a pawn is kind going to try to challenge both the a7 b6 uh, basically pawn structure and if a5 you if you ever take then look at the pawn structure black has <laughs> absolutely <laughs> uh like you know terrible pawn island that black has because c6 c5 doubled pawn a7 a5 doubled pawn Bishop is also direct squared, so everything is uh, looking good for white. If that's, this ever that's happens, that's true. But you know what? What now? I'm reminded of Gukesh versus Karuva, na, where Gukesh had like all seven isolated pawns, and that was still favoring <laughs> him. So now I'm like, okay, next time, every time such a pawn structure is there, first think of it. Is that really bad? <laughs> Because he's changed <laughs> certain things in the mind of minds of people. Uh -huh. Oh, by the way, Sachin says Weedy with the white pieces uh, down twenty minutes against Nijat. So we will go there and check that as well. Yes, please mm -hmm. see the chat. I will see the chat. I completely, you know, the games are so engrossing. Also, the openings right now we have a lot to learn. We have Grandmaster uh -huh. Harshit Raja over here. So. A five was such a great move, yeah, Harshit, which you mentioned. And look at this; the computer yeah. also loves it. Also, B A five, we are happy. And even B five, I don't think you have anything to worry about it because anyway, this is not going to be a passer. So, okay. I have a crazy idea after B five, Amruta. Like I have uh -huh. seen this. Uh, you just go there quickly, and very interesting idea, guys. Sometimes, like you just leave that pawn on C four like that. And you say, "Ki, I mean, let's say, for example, queen e, like castles, castles, let's say." And I've seen this idea of C, B, C, four. Why just goes a move like knight d two? Oh, completely insane. And the point is that if you take on d three, I take back. And even if you are up a pawn, my knight is going to sit on c four. The bishop on e seven still remains bad. And now. Even if I don't have the C pawn, I have an open file, semi-open file for my rook. Wow, this is such a cool idea! Like you just don't care about it, and Black is very happy. But eventually, he's anyway uh, down with these two isolated pawns on the open file. Yeah, I love this. Yeah, very so good th one. So this idea, like you know, these kind of strategic ideas and the pattern recognition that these imagine Amruta, if I as a normal Well, grandmaster, know these ideas. Imagine what kind of strategic ideas and pattern recognition players like Pragnananda and Gukesh have. Just imagine, guys. Unbelievable. But Harshit, question for you: What is a normal grandmaster, and how many types of grandmasters are there? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, um, it's like how I like to say is that being a grandmaster is. Kind of comparable to being in the IPL of cricket. Um, so all chess grandmasters are in the IPL, and then the difference is that, for example, Chennai Super Kings or Mumbai Indians, like the better teams, for example, uh, are maybe let's say twenty six hundred or something like this. And even in those teams, there are players like M S Dhoni or someone who are like you know at the very top. So even if we are in a pool of players, like even if grand if grandmasters are like a pool of players which are very strong. But even in that pool, there are some players who are much stronger than other players. Wow, I love this comparison. It's it just fits in perfectly for especially for all the newcomers. Also, they would be able to relate because cricket. I think in India, everyone's able to relate. Cricket, I have to yeah. context is a much jata hai. So, uh, are you a cricket fan also, Harshit? 
um i don't watch a lot of games but uh, whenever there is like some important indian game or something i obviously watch it ah, nice. um because maybe a question Amruta... for the chat they would know but uh, who is the second over here who is uh, a big fan of cricket in candidates one of the seconds a big fan of cricket who is he guys do you remember yeah we will move to another game uh, here i think prag is at 1 hour 42 minutes he is having a decent opening i believe and yeah. a pleasant position yeah. definitely something to look forward to some strategic battle uh, some moves happened okay yeah, let's quickly okay. go uh, go uh, once one, let's do the ones let's look at a game of vidit since we didn't take a look once okay and we'll come back to uh, vidit's game um and we see that nijat has a lot of time on his clock e4 e5 Petrov, Petrov defense guy. Yes, Swidler. Swidler is the one. Yes. Yes. He is very much. He is a big fan of cricket. Watches everything. Knight c6 there. Short mm-hmm. castle. Oh, Vipul Kotiyal, thank you so much for your contribution again. You have. Yeah, uh, you are the opener. No, in cricket, what do we call? Opening batsman. <laughs> <laughs> Bishop e7. Mm-hmm. Seven. Yes. So mm-hmm. far, very normal. Bishop d two. Bishop g four. C three. Uh, uh, castles. I guess. Yeah. Yes. Can you Church have three? take a moment and at looking at Ali Reza the way he's uh, you know sitting on the oh. board, but he's oh. just not even looking like at the board. He's looking at other games. It was a very nice moment there. He's he's very yeah. relaxed. Yeah. Bishop went to h five. And look, look, look. Amrutha uh-huh. Gukesh is. Just quickly taking a glance over the other boards. कि उधर क्या हो रहा है? Just so that you know, I have an idea of how uh, much risk I have to take. Definitely something to keep in mind. क्योंकि अमरुता, if you see that there is a result in Nepo versus Hikaru game that definitely changes how Gukesh mm. uh, would want to uh, take risks because next round is black and obviously we know कि black से taking risks is very difficult, अमरुता. Yes, that's so, true. Yeah. Uh, so, so he will definitely. So even for them also, they will keep coming to Gukesh's game. That's why uh, Naka, uh, we can see so many times he's around Gukesh's yeah. game. Based on that, they all will be like all of them. Chalo draw kar lete hai and uh, let's be solid. And last round, um, actually, last round must win situation is much better, right? Instead of a penalty mint round, if you are in such a situation. Mm-hmm. Because you know that the, today, if you win, you yep. are that's that has a different kind of an energy. So you're yep. right. G three, Queen D seven. I think I've seen this position. King G two, um, Bishop G six, and Black takes with the F pawn. Um, the point is that he wants to keep. He wants to activate his rook from F eight. Um, and he basically says that. Uh, Uh, you know we have equal material and some pieces have been exchanged so i will go maybe rook f7 rook f8 next um and i have easy play i think what's white's idea amruta if i am not mistaken knight e1 and queen g4 is is an idea that i have seen at some point if i'm not mistaken amazing um maybe we can actually quickly check the analysis board because This position has also occurred in a lot of games, if I am not mistaken. Yes, let's just have a look at that very quickly. And let me get it in store. Just to quickly yep, knight take F6. it from your mm-hmm. d six eighty yep. thousand. Three. We've all seen this. Even Vidit has played it. Many people have played it. Castle, Bishop e7, knight d2, take, take. Yeah, c3. So far, all well known. H3, Bishop h5, g3, Queen d7, King g2, g6. Oh, still, a lot of games. Takes. Yeah, two hundred games here. And Bishop f4. That's yeah. the move which Vidit has played. Uh... Yes. And I I don't know if I'm wrong if I is this I don't know if this is the moment. But I, what do you think? Instead of bishop f4, is there an idea of knight e1 or knight moving somewhere and yeah, queen g4? Yeah, knight g1, knight h2 is there. Has been played. Knight g1 has been played. Martinez um, and knight h2 has also h- been tried by Swane Duda. Yeah. Yeah. And basically, you want to uh, like if you are able to put the pawn on g4, like let's say knight e1, rook f7. Let's just make moves. Okay. 
queen g4 and if black takes i will take with the h pawn and i i'm happy with this change you know my pawn took uh, my pawn improved from h3 to g4 because even if it's doubled it controls the very crucial f5 square and next i want knight d3 rook a1 you know maybe i can even go f4 g5 at some point so this would be something that uh, vidit would like very plain um, position and very cl very clear plan what you are showing so he goes for bishop f4 instead maybe he has uh, some other idea um yeah he went bishop f4 who has played that lano has played ne that okay yeah arishchenko but okay not very commonly played so what is what did he play did his opponent make a move i don't H6, think H6. so okay yeah five games so i think he's still in his preparation maybe nijat preparation yeah queen d3 g5 is the move if he's prepared we will be definitely yeah but if this happens amruta hmm. if black is very well prepared i think uh, we might see mass simplification actually and some equal position because um, it seems as if uh, abasov is very well prepared so something to keep hmm. an eye on in this game let's actually go back to our main focus of gukesh's game yes. let's go there see if there are some moves okay so we have had one Ooh, move long after thing. a5 knight c4 was played by gukesh he thought for uh, 9 minutes here and made this move and bishop went to a7 how quickly did he play? Uh, that was a very quickly played 30 yeah. seconds by yeah. ali reza he goes back and now gukesh and is now thinking thinking for 20 minutes so a big mom decision i guess for gukesh ki does he want to go king h1 and f4 oh yeah 20 minutes that's a long time is long just... thing wait guys you want uh, nepo versus nakamura bar also on the screen so i'm just adding that mm mhm Yeah. Yes, because that's a huge game, so that's a good bar to add. Correct. Drag, but it's not getting added. Okay, I'll just refresh it. And guys, Gukesh kind of is thinking because maybe he's also waiting to see what happens in the other game, and then make a decision. You know, like all these psychological things. I mean, I don't know if Gukesh is considering, but just think, ki agar if you are in Gukesh's position, you are like, I have two plans. One is simple. and one is slightly aggressive um but i don't know how the position is going to change in nepo and hikaru's game so these kind of things are so hard to predict amruta yeah super super hard yaar but i do think that the kind of uh, you know if they keep watching each other's game many times maybe they will somehow it feels like it will go towards a draw because at the end of it uh, somewhere it's dependent on somebody else's game as well but uh, otherwise I, even yeah it's hard to think like if, if you were uh, gukesh's let's say second uh, like helper amruta what would you tell him would you tell him ki don't think about that game focus on your game or ki yes. take a look at that game and make decisions accordingly kyunki if you say ki don't uh, if you say ki look at that game then you can sometimes get nervous and stuff mm. at the same time ki agar you don't take a look at all at that game then you might make a decision which is practically not better yeah i think uh, it cannot be dependent on the other board as such firstly you have to play your mm -hmm. game because other it's very scary you know you can get uh, distracted what do you do like, yeah. what would you do because uh, you have been playing round robin many times your last round would would be dependent on other stuff so what do you think Okay, or it's very hard. I it's very hard to. I personally think Amruta ki it's better to focus on your game. Um, because sometimes you know you think of the other game. Ye possibility kya hai? Wo hoga to kya hoga? And then you kind of get distracted by your own game. So if I was Gukesh's helper or mentor, um, which I, which by the way, guys, he has one of the best seconds in in on uh in uh, uh, Gregor Gaius Gaiuski, I think. who has also been in the team of vishwanathan anand so he has a very very experienced and uh, strong mentor so uh, definitely something they would have you know considered in the discussion in the locker room 
uh, before today's game locker room <laughs> that that sounds cool <laughs> that sounds cool hikaru with the disadvantage yes but i really want gukesh to be the sole winner say satyam in the chat otherwise it's going to be difficult in tie breaks for him yeah there is one thing like if you talk about rapid games if you talk about tie breaks and rapid and if at all it enters into that then naka like uh-huh. naka is definitely uh, the strongest yeah mhm so he will have that edge yeah very very crucial decision i'm actually quite curious in the gukesh's game as well amruta i'm like what, let's try to yeah. think what is he thinking about let's like, go there let's go there uh, surya super chat says guki wins today naka and nepo draw prag wins and fabi is out tomorrow if guki even draw naka out and if nepo wins he is equal to guki and guki wins lot of calculation and everything favors gukesh so definitely understand the emotion uh, thank you for that but <laughs> that one line will have you know you have to do lot of calculation but it's good to have it will come back to the super chat anand sastra with the thank you for your contribution and bhushan date also says 20 30 tak do bar world champion banega gukesh are kya baat hai that's a, that's a game what a pretty wow maza aaya abhi uh, which game gukesh ke game pe let's go to gukesh's game what he must be thinking guys what are you yeah, what thinking for gukesh why to play what are your suggestions and harshit also we are going to, harshit is also going to think suggest um, ideas i have actually at some point in this idea of uh, white also going uh, a4 in these kind of positions to stop black from playing b5 um because black can sometimes expand with b5 and a4 so tell me something like uh, right now if uh, would you mm-hmm. consider like normally they bring bishop to e3 at some point to challenge uh, there's also bishop mm-hmm. g5 but black has not castled though here with the pawns mm. on c6 and f5 i don't think he's any time going to consider a long castle idea but he can keep mm-hmm. his king in the center right if i go a move like bishop g5 Which... G five. The thing is, f six now, Amruta might not be a good move, because after bishop f six, queen f six. If you, I can take the pawn on a five, ah, and it might yeah. be that you have bishop takes f two. But uh, this but, is a nice bishop, no? Ah, but no. After but rook, okay. Oh, okay, your guys. queen is attacked. <laughs> which which is the yeah? There is a skewer over here, which is bishop on f seven. rook attacking there you don't really have to worry about the knight so yeah. so yeah bishop this is cool because normally bishop f6 bishop f6 we just don't consider a move like yes, this yes exactly but only because it is deflecting we can consider that so bishop g5 h6 is not possible but bar says yeah. there is a good move for black what is the good move for black wow um, this one let me all ask uh, the chat because i don't think uh, it's easy to find maybe harshit mm-hmm. will find for sure but I doubt about the chat. <laughs> chat को roast कर दिया है. <laughs> Guys, black to play. ये tough है थोड़ा tough है. Did 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 you yeah, find it? Yeah, not an easy move. You found it. Harshit I, finds it. I Harshit found is it. right now. You know you should play more tournaments. Harshit <laughs> should just not be at home <laughs> and uh, bunk your college. You your college will give you permission, right? If you want to play tournaments. Yeah, but I have to make up for it. Like it's even if you miss school, you have to come back and make up for it. So after the candidates is over, I will need to first take a piece from all the excitement and uh, put that excitement, unfortunately, <laughs> in my studies. <laughs> so you have a lot of things to cover in your studies after you come back. Yeah. What's the move? Oh, oh, lots of ideas. B five, bishop g four, a four, a four found by Krish Vedan, Sagnik, Shridhar, Satvik, Dhruv, and Nishant. And uh, yeah, Harshit, what is this move? A four. A four, Amruta, exactly. Uh, take expanding on the queen side, taking advantage that you cannot take the pawn on a four because of this nice move b five. But Amruta, nice. he has made a move. He has made a move which we did not really consider. Knight to e3. Very interesting move, and the engine does not like it so much. But 
I still think that the engine evaluation does not af- matter a lot in these kind of positions because the position is very uh, solid right now. So I don't think the evaluation matters. But what's his idea? With knight e three, right? Like you would not like to go to f five and allow bishop f five, e f five, d five. If I'm correct, very yeah. good point. So then you can't go to g four. Then you can't develop the bishop. So uh, very good question. What's the idea there? Maybe queen f three. Maybe the idea is queen f three, and then maybe go knight f five after that, so that ah. you can take on f five. Yeah. Maybe that's the idea. But right now, what what would you consider for black? Um, I was in. It does. Do you ever consider the move h five? Wow, it it's my fa- it, the ever- problem was for me. It was my favorite move. So even if it didn't work, I would <laughs> play that. <laughs> So yeah, H five. This is a cool one. Uh, you, let's say we continue uh, with your idea. But probably not play. Uh, Queen F three. I thought I have two ways. One um, way was Bishop G four, which is not that attractive. But Knight G four. Oh, Knight G four. Queen F seven. Mate. Oops. <laughs> Oops. So Bishop G four is a okay. is an idea. Mm-hmm. Okay. Maybe perhaps question mark. Bishop G four. Knight G four and if knight G four and G four and you open the rook basically, got it. Could be an idea. Yeah, and like this not... could be a possible idea. Like especially uh, for Ali Reza style, he will definitely. Yeah, Ali Reza think. style. But uh, the other solid option is just castling, of course. Um, yeah. And if Queen F, um, Black can actually Amruta consider this move G six. Um, I real understand why Bukesh might have gone for this, Harshit. Maybe he doesn't mm-hmm. want D five. And with queen f three, the pawn, point. the knight, and a bishop, he thinks he's stopping d five. But the computer yeah. still suggests the move d five over here, and I don't know Whoa. how come this move is possible. D five, e d five. You also always have this intermediate move. Bishop takes e three. You wouldn't mind giving this dark square bishop. Because now after bishop e three, what do you take back with? Um, that's a good. Uh, maybe I want to develop. So bishop e three, also dark squares. And now I just take back on d five with? with the pawn or the knight, maybe even. Yeah. The knight probably better. And if bishop and uh, bishop c five, rook e eight, and black white has two bishops, so I think I would prefer white a little bit. But uh, but what is the other idea thing? after? D five, D five. Does Black have any other sneaky idea? Bishop B three. By the way, over here also after Bishop B three, the best way to the best takes was Queen takes E three. The computer suggests because you attack ah, the E five ah, pawn here. The... Mm. So, uh... but actually after E D five, there's an intermediate move. Oh, oh, okay. Let's ask the chat. This one is something very possible to miss. Black to play over. Yeah. If very nice move. On the uh, board. Guys, black to play. Let's see if people can find it. We I see already a lot of suggestions. Oh, by the way, I actually forgot to send uh, the Zoom link to Sagar. Arey, arey, arey. <laughs> no, anyway, I don't. Know. Justice for Sagar, bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but maybe we'll get some update from Toronto. I'm quite excited to see what Sagar has to say. He doesn't have uh, space on the screen right now, though. <laughs> I mean, it, we can just stop someone's video or something. No, no, we can don't adjust. worry. Like, uh, we'll manage it. Today, this was uh, very much, uh, uh, you know, later. I got to know, so we have fixed this. But guys, if there are any improvement uh, suggestions for the layout for tomorrow, let us know. Definitely, let us know. Maybe Harshit, possible for you to yeah. forward the link to him? Yeah, yeah of course. Everything is possible. Thank you. That helps. <laughs> That helps a lot. 
let's go yeah so the move chat has found it or not let's just have a quick look at it bishop g4 e4 wow actually bishop g4 so many of them wanted to play uh but the right move is a4 deadly ninja divyam krish vedant koharti rajesh archit lufthansa brishti and shantanu so here we have the move a4 superb how come you guys suggested bishop g4 though because that one was just hanging no guys kisne dhundo naam dhundo sabka are kitne logo ne kiya kitne logo ne bishop g4 bola i can't believe 36 people blundered bad karma ne to tago <laughs> amazing and e4 was another uh, suggestion by the way so that one how is that what was their idea sometimes they have you know some good ideas actually but this one you take and then they defend so nothing works this one mm-hmm. was tough a4 because a f- yeah bishop a4 bishop takes e3 and the a4 bishop is hanging but i have another insane idea Good. if you go back disco guys a4 hmm he takes c6 agar if you take okay the point is that if a b3 you have c b7 and white is doing very well but go back nice. go back amruta okay. now guys after d takes c6 now i will just say, show this move amruta e5 to e4 ah uh, uh, your idea is that you can't take c takes b7 so if d takes e4 you take on e4 i take on b3 and now white is a piece up uh if cb sun bishop b sun but some insane continuation because what? after what? ab3 e5 are you serious if this is and now the who is calculating then i get it the knight is hanging and cb7 is the threat so you know lot of things to consider no this is actually this can get very sharp definitely Wow, this one is really cool. The, all the tactics happening there. So one thing we learn from this position is A4 is a move which all the time you have to be alert for. With this disco happening with Bishop B3, with some B5 ideas and all that. So A4 deflection of the bishop and discovered attack is a intermezzo all the time to be alert. Mm-hmm. Now Ali Reza is yeah. thinking. Uh, if he is better prepared, do you think he would have all those ideas in his preparation? It's like you know vaguely. I mean, he's thinking. He has thought for more than twenty minutes now. So even if this position is familiar, Amruta, mm-hmm. both players are actually taking their time. They are not really making uh, moves very quickly. And only after how many moves happened? Nine moves. How many moves were? Twelfth. This is the twelfth move. Twelfth move. They have thought for about half an hour each. So uh, they are taking their time, Amruta. Wow. This is amazing. Oof. Um, cool. By the way, we have a news that Nepo versus Naka. Nepo has an advantage. What? Let's go there. Um, uh, I think this is probably preparation of. Uh, this is all still preparation of Hikaru. I think Amruta. Because we were looking at. You remember I was mentioning about the move D5. Yes, yes, yes. But there was a bishop somehow. This is a little different. E takes D5 played by Nepo. and the computer just completely prefers this position so let, let's say just queen takes d5 queen d5 hmm. okay i want the d4 pawn is hanging so bachana padega rook e4 is a move knight f3 is a move um rook e4 is a bit too much knight f3 is the simple way but then there's bishop g4 so quickly to show that after knight f3 uh, there will be bishop g4 and black is very happy to pin it um so how to save the oh knight f1 kya because knight if you go knight f1 knight f4 there is knight e3 knight e4 knight e4 no oh, knight e4 wow so uh, interesting knight c5 ah maybe, if rook d8 yeah if rook then you can actually make a move like bishop b3 wow. i wanted to say really and if What's queen, d- queen d4 some crazy okay. ideas okay. This one, Harshit. This yeah. one, we have to ask the chat because you know they'll be very happy and proud of themselves if they find it. Why to play over here? Classy move, maza a jayega. ऐसा कुछ है जो Harshit is uh, Harshit. You're calculating insanely. 
yes i'm very excited i'm just hoping harshit uh, you do have you know if you have some chance to get into candidates in the coming years harshit mm-hmm. seriously le hi lo padhai vadai ja are har i mean these guys amruta we are sitting in our chairs here we are we are watching in a very comfortable position without any pressure um the the things completely change when you are actually in the action and the person playing so very easy to commentate and suggest good moves but very difficult to actually be sitting in that chair in toronto canada in this case and uh, play at the level um and determination like these guys so yeah even if you know i am able to suggest some good moves and ideas guys the level at which they are calculating is uh in multiples uh is multi like much much higher in multiples than what i am thinking but a very nice idea now let's see amruta kisne kisne dhoonda knight g5 has been found by chirag oh. shaditya many people knight f6 is also was suggested by many people uh, let's just go back and see whether both of them what work or move. no knight f6 is not working by the way yeah because Look. i think their idea was if gf6 our chat is very tricky if gf6 they wanted rook e8 check very tricky chat <laughs> takes but and if king g7 then you still get because it's fewer so but after knight, knight f6 uh, unfortunately chat the queen can go back to f6 Chat and then piche mud ke dekhna hi nahi hai they often miss the backward moves <laughs> queen f6 and now black is a piece up yeah. but the other 30 40 people who found knight g5 what a move guys well done because if queen d1 you can have knight f7 intermediate or uh, yes king, king g8 knight takes d8 intermediate check queen b3 tab kha lo and now a b3 and uh, yeah if if you make a move like knight f4 what does white do <laughs> oh you want 100 people to answer here harshit being ambitious guys checkmate in one move jago 1 am only 1 10 am we to were you know getting these kind of answers at 5 am when our guys are playing well so yahan pe to 100 is okay by the way we also have uh, got one second some contribution on help chess so abhish raj thank you so much you are the 1266 believer kartik date has contributed and vipul kothial also the first one today um, and yesterday on rest day we had krish so amazing guys amazing support thank you let's see how many people have found a move going to the chat chess moves which ha more than 100 kya baat hai are well done well done guys checkmate in one and baki ke logon ko thoda alert rehna padega guys because a lot more questions are coming so this one was a teaser rook to e8 <laughs> checkmate uh, um very uh, cute checkmate with the knight on d8 and uh this game amruta before jumping to uh, other games i actually am worried for hikaru i'm yeah. very worried yeah. because uh, even if he has uh, seen this position maybe uh, the f6 g6 g7 pawns with his knight on g6 feels like white has actually gotten an advantage let's say i go pawn to d5 here um try to go pawn to d6 it is not easy for black to play because knight c5 can also come knight c5 knight e6 ideas um definitely right. I mean, I uh, something right i mean i was looking at why you can't go bishop d7 and just exchange that but then you what you say, yeah. said like if you want to go to e6 then this even more helps because your knight, knight is going C5. to sit yeah. really strongly over here and, and if queen no c8 you go i can go rook c1 and knight e6 and the c7 pawn will come under big fire yeah um, so the Wow. This is actually looking a little shaky for uh, Hikaru right now, but we know he's a tenacious defender. But at the same time, if Nepo smells blood, Amruta, we have seen how dangerous he is. He knows where uh, 
to where uh, his opponents are weak and he quickly able to you know jump on that opportunity and i think he will be very happy right now you think so because uh, what would he, what would be his assessment during the game would he also be assessing as much as the advantage we are seeing here um it definitely looks very pleasant for white because his pieces are all centralized and the as i said this knight on g6 kone mein ghoda doesn't really look to be very uh it doesn't look, doesn't seem to be in the part of the game right now um if the knight was on d6 instead i would say that black is much more happy because the knight if if a pair of knights get traded amruta i always like to ask this question ki which piece if, if when you trade helps your position mm. oh, that's is okay this case work. guys in this case what piece of black is not doing well the knight on g6 if you are somehow able to trade that knight with the e4 knight just imagine then it becomes so much easier for black to play this position actually um, this one is very important question what you say because harshit you know many times you've seen that one wrong exchange and a position just collapses it's not even yeah. understood at that very moment because the advantage doesn't mm-hmm. drop in as much but uh, strategically it's very diff- it becomes very difficult to play without that particular piece so Uh, this exchange yeah. is a very very advanced concept there and i think uh, grandmasters are really really good at understanding that definitely um and while uh, nepo is thinking uh, amruta an interesting development Where? in the def- okay this happened by the way this knight e3 queen f3 will we see d5 how is fusa right now oh. let's just have a maybe big screen there and just try to guess he's thinking maybe he's considering the move d5 which we discussed because of ed5 this intermediate move a4 amruta not easy to find i'll be honest with you but, we but saw you know, it piruza the... going towards the end of the tournament and being motivated to beat a person like gukesh finally it, it this candidate games are all going to go in history and i see gukesh a little stressed there do you do you feel that little bit yes of yes yes even i feel the heat so i will take off my jacket it's getting very <laughs> intense already here um and he is definitely considering all sorts of ideas we discussed amruta very interesting development in the fabi uh, pra game if we quickly just yes. uh, take a look of the development uh, because after knight g5 this exchange actually happened uh, bishop c4 b4, b4. Bishop e7, knight c4, knight went back to d7, defended the e5 pawn, knight g5 now threatening to take this. So bishop takes c4, b takes c4. The structure exactly yeah, we discussed. Exactly. Absolutely, you had mentioned And... about a5, b5, some wonderful ideas allowing this semi-open file. Harshit, I'm I'm getting some training from a grandmaster. You see, <laughs> only thing is I will forget after some time. <laughs> That's the problem. Arre arre. <laughs> so um, but after knight f8 uh, even fabi is you know again put the knight back on d7 amruta for one uh, second hmm. um he is asking himself which piece of mine can improve and it is definitely the knight on d7 so he plays knight to f8 and his idea is to reroute the knight to e6 uh where it can go to either d4 or f4 So can I ask you a question Harshit because in this structure the center is pretty closed right now and we generally mm-hmm. say knights are good in closed positions and for black yeah. this bishop is also not a very um, you know beautiful piece here with these pawns uh, making it difficult uh, to be mobile so bishop g5 mm-hmm. seems like an exchange while we were talking about it that can black take this uh, knight away it comes as a very first question to the mind yeah very nice question um i'm not sure because bishop takes g5 um white has a very solid pawn structure so black can effectively never go f5 correct because if you go f5 the e5 pawn will be very weak so what in my opinion fabi's thought process was that if i take the knight on g5 i essentially have no breaks i can simply wait see what white wants to do and white has a plan he wants mm-hmm. to go castles and f4 
um so fabi is like i don't want to really you know be the person to only defend 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 so let's try to create my own chance ah that makes sense actually because for white it's the clarity is much more so he goes knight mm-hmm. f8 now clearly wanting to uh, eye on these squares as you mentioned so what is this yeah. knight doing here on g5 and also long castle could it be a possibility to you know keep it so flexible that eventually you long castle yeah i mean long castle is a scary move to make amruta <laughs> because the... you are an attacking player no would you consider Bye, an idea like uh, what d5 play by r bo- oh firuja my god uh, against go is so sharp then if he is played d5 he is considered this idea he can't he can't otherwise F- play that yeah and now gukesh is thinking what a what an insane find by firuja is we all know how dynamically strong he is and he is uh playing very accurately in the opening stage today okay so uh, firstly very important thing for us to understand is we calculated with ed5 there was this move a4 now let's yeah. say just at this position this was one candidate move but what other ideas is white having if he doesn't take Mm, you don't have to do anything because I don't think Black wants to go d4. Um, so I can perhaps just make a move like h3, let's say, a waiting move. Okay, the, uh, you won't consider knight f5 yet. H3 is a very ni- in nice waiting move, Amruta, because mm-hmm. it also gives you the opportunity to sometimes go knight to g4, which is a very nice idea nice. in these kind of positions. Because if you take on g4. Uh, let me just show some let's say you go bishop e6 bishop e6 knight g4 let's say take take and sometimes white goes g3 king g2 and the rook comes h1 and you know suddenly some wow. attack maybe yes all these ideas oh this is great this is yes. amazing i think uh, sometimes knight h2 knight g4 also happens it's uh, it's something similar yeah Amruta, I'll just take a quick small break. I'll be right back. Uh, I'll totally. keep my video on. That's fine. Uh, yes, yes, I'll just be. Just... I'm right back. Yeah. Don't worry. And guys, so D5 has happened on the board, but this doesn't mean that Gukesh is in big trouble or anything yet. Uh, he's calculating. A good thing is that he's very very calm. If I must show you his camera right now, look at him. The way he's calculating. Yes, he was he was looking a bit stressed a few minutes ago, but right now he knows this has happened. This is the current situation. He's not going into the past and all of that. He will find a way out of it. He's played very very solidly in this whole tournament. He's the one who has played the most solid chess. So let's see. He will defend in the best possible manner. And we are anyway talking about something which is slightly pleasant for black. but not as you guys think that this is a big trouble not at all can what is the question also guys this camera what an angle uh, we are getting to see gukesh and ali reza's game live we are so uh, lucky uh, that fide has given this camera it's beautiful so thank you to fide guys a big thanks to fide and also to all of you because as i had mentioned earlier you guys have been watching the streams watching the videos and with all your views that helps a lot joy datta says guki op in the chat and do we have more people we have N- nurali khoja who has become the 1267th uh, believer just contributed 501 rupees so thank you nurali also i would like to show you something oh nepur se sikaru blunder there's the red uh, beep what can be the blunder over there what are you seeing let's go to nepo so 94 queen d8 was played and you remember harshit was mentioning d5 I was also liking the move directly knight c5 and Nepo goes bishop c2 which just drops his advantage completely and he's going for some 
very different plan. He's going for the king. He's like, I don't really want to play anything strategic here. So bishop c2 does look scary with queen h5 incoming. And what is black going to do here? What? Why is this move not liked by the engines? Hikaru blunders. <laughs> not a blunder. It's not a blunder for sure. But it's a... Uh, sorry, Nepo blunder you might wanted to say. It's not a blunder. But bishop c2 is not something which the engine prefers as the first thing. Because of... Yes. Yes. Absolutely right. F5. And if you want to keep the bishop... Oops. What did I just click? Sorry for that. If you want to just go bishop f5, then you better be careful about the discourse over here at some point with the queen jumping anyway to f3 or h5 attacking the f5 bishop. So f5 is the move. If Hikaru plays this move, Nepo will go knight c5 because he cannot stay. I don't know if he wants to play knight g3. It just doesn't make sense. Where is the knight going? There is no dark square bishop, so you can't even attack this guy with that other bishop. So, knight c5 would be the natural move and maybe what Nepo wants to still do is to make this pawn a little weak. f4 with the idea of f5 and all of that is not really going to help because the queen jumps in and the knight is hanging. So, that can get very risky. So, that is what Nepo's plan is to, you know, provoke the pawn to f5 and say that I have a nice bishop which is going to look at that. Your bishop is going to be restricted. F5 is going to be weak. And a knight is going to be misplaced. So still the position is pretty, pretty favorable for uh, Nepo. It's very hard to play this position from black already. That's what it seems like. Nepo is down to 1 hour 12 minutes. Very rarely we see him with such low time compared to his opponent. But yeah, the opponent is Hikaru Nakamura there. <laughs> so... He's thinking with 1 hour 37 minutes on the clock. Pragnananda's game we saw till knight g5, bishop c4, bc4 and knight f8. Prag is still thinking. They are pretty close in terms of their times. 1 hour 23 minutes for Prag. Fabi has 1 hour 26 minutes. Nijat versus Vidit is going on. Uh, I think we saw until bishop f4. h6. Queen went to d3 and g5. This was something we expected because we were looking at some games in chess based database. And here we are at b4 with it having this slight edge. I think with it will push this position. Um, I'm, I'm betting on, uh, you know, with its result. My prediction would be that with it will beat Nijat because the last time he played with him, he had, he had some missed opportunities. By the way, Gukesh makes the move. Yes, he finds the best way to answer this. Not to take here, to ignore. Sometimes the best answer is, guys, ignore. Not like I literally don't care. That is different. Ignore is different and I literally don't care. We will talk about the difference between the two later. But for now, Bishop C2 has been played by Gukesh. Let's try to understand this move. First of all, if black says, let me take here, d takes e4, then white is very happy. The knight is going to jump to f5 next. You have a bishop here on this diagonal and then slowly this bishop will develop. If bishop f5, queen f5, by the way, let's not forget that the bishop will jump to g5. So that would be fine. For sure, Ali Reza is not going to take here. If Ali Reza pushes the pawn to d4, and asks where is your knight going to go. The knight is waiting to jump on f5. So he's very happy doing that. Knight f5. And to show you if queen f5. Bishop f5. Queen f5. e5 is going to be attacked. So let's just make this move rook e8. Wanting to defend this. And then we are happy to jump with the bishop to g5. This can be, this can be a good position. I mean for Gokesh. We don't have to worry about anything here so the best move here which uh, the engine wants to you know keep that slight initiative for himself for the black pieces is a move which kind of stops your opponent's idea which is the move which will stop Gukesh's idea so black to play over here Sakar Chess says I already ordered chess sets also check link to buy opening course by Anish and Sagar 
फॉर श्योर फॉर श्योर गाइज वन सेकेंड दिस इज समथिंग डू चेक दिस आउट ओवर योर दिस इज द पेरिंग बट डू चेक आउट फिडे इज द यू नो शॉप आई विल शो सम वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग कूल स्टफ दे हैव यू कैन यूज द कूपन कोड चेस बेस फॉर टेन परसेंट डिस्काउंट वी ऑल्सो हैव लॉन्च अनिश गिरीज ग्रैंड मास्टर्स गाइड टू ओपनिंग्स सो दैट्स बीन रियली अमे गोइंग वेरी वेल एंड वी हैव ऑल्सो लॉन्च द चेस सेट्स टू न्यू चेस सेट्स मिनी चेस सेट एंड चेस्पा चेस सेट सो दैट वन ऑल्सो अ मस्ट चेक आउट लाइक डो नॉट मिस दैट एट ऑल सो या लेट्स गो बैक देर टू द गेम एंड वाइल वी वर टॉकिंग अबाउट बिशप सी टू वॉज प्लेड द मूव चैट चेस मूव टाइम टू सी वॉट इज द चैट सजेस्टिंग क्या बात है जी सिक्स काम साइलेंट मूव बाय स्वयं ह्यूमन मिस्टर इंडिया कॉयज अमित राय विघ्नेश अखिल डेडली चक्रधर एंड वेद दैट्स द राइट मूव यू स्टॉप योर ओपोनेंट्स थ्रेट एंड द थ्रेट वॉज द नाइट जम्पिंग टू एफ फाइव एंड देन मे बी वी विल हैव आइडियाज लाइक डी फोर टू कंसिडर सो जी सिक्स वुड बी अ मूव ओनली थिंग इज वेन यूर मेकिंग सच ओ हर्षित सॉरी वेन वर यू बैक आई हैव बीन टॉकिंग एंड टॉकिंग एंड टॉकिंग कब तक मैं बड़बड़ कर रही थी <laughs> कुछ बोला क्यों नहीं <laughs> I was listening to the insightful analysis shown by you, so I was, you know, not disturbing the. अरे 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 अरे, guys, chat में कुछ तो बोलने का ना मैं ये right side में देख रही हूँ. I am not going to get to know if Harshit comes over there. Aisa next time, please help me. When <laughs> Harshit, Harshit, you are a prankster, huh? Complete. <laughs> Have you made any crazy April Fool pranks? Maybe yes, maybe no. <laughs> oh, that will be cool. Maybe next time. You know, this time Sagar was very busy there, and normally we have some uh, amazing April Fool pranks which people fall for. Uh, especially one of the prank was about uh, Thej Kumar, and he, he, it was a very nice article. Later, many people fell for it. They thought a movie is being made and all of that. But they are also very positive. So uh, we will next time write about your pranks, Harshit. अरे 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 बाय द वे अमृता इन द गुकेश इज गेम ओ बिशप सी टू जी सिक्स ओ बिशप सी टू प्लेड ओके नो जी सिक्स इज नॉट प्लेड बिशप सी टू वाज द बेस्ट वे टू आंसर व्हिच गुकेश प्लेड एंड यू नो आफ्टर अ पॉइंट व्हेन आई लुक्ड एट द कैमरा ही वाज ही इट फील लाइक ही हैड गॉट हिमसेल्फ बैक लाइक व्हेन ही वाज दैट लिटिल बिट स्ट्रेस्ड वी सॉ हिम ही वाज बैक एंड ही प्लेड बिशप सी टू यू कैन सी हिम ड्रिंकिंग वाटर adjusting his sleeves over there all of it i think he will he might even go for a walk <laughs> take a walk but Are no he's just sitting there and here the move g6 if ali reza plays tell me how how easy it is to make such a move because you are committing to make your dark squares weak where bishop g5 can easily you know jump in sooner or later yeah I mean, also with G six, you have to understand that a move like you know Queen G three now, let's say, and still Knight F five remains to be an idea for White. So like even if you go G six, you still have to keep the recurring idea of Knight F five in your consideration. Ah. Um, so G six is a move which you know comes with uh, definitely a lot of pros, but also some cons because the dark squares become weaker. So it would be not that easy to make. You mean, or would it be like you just know that you want to stop knight f five? So then that becomes easier. <laughs> it's a tough decision, would you say? Or it's a tough decision. Tough decision because um, your bishop, your dark square bishop is on the a seven position. If that bishop was on the king side, if it was on let's say g seven, uh, like you know, if g six bishop g seven, then it mm. you know it's more easier to uh, make moves like g six. But when your bishop is on the opposite side and the dark squares are weak around your king i think it's not an easy decision amruta yeah cool um, so we we actually we are hoping that g6 doesn't happen on the board but let's see when if mm-hmm. it happens it's not like a completely the position is fine i mean gukesh can make some moves yeah. it's it's not like a big trouble right this position would you call it yes. like a trouble no 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 it's just a beginning of the game so uh, i mean maybe 
black is comfortable but uh, it's still a complicated position so uh, engines are not playing this game it's humans who are playing it so a lot of you know inaccuracies and you know complications will arise and uh, still all three results are on the table amazing uh, harshit also can we quickly check vaishali and hampi's game uh where it has reached because she's oh, playing with oh, late vaishali going for the hmm. audi four wins in a row <laughs> oh so this is the current position she takes d4 vaishali vaishali's position is clearly better that's what the computer says but only if she like if finds oh, the next move, the move last move by she any takes chance what by any chance c3 to c4 or no no not c4 because the knight will jump to f4 so yeah. mm-hmm. knight takes d4 seems like the most uh, logical the, yeah it's a is a good move you can the most is the by far yeah because yeah. you are directly having the knight in the center attacking e6 so you can continue this simplistic way for sure mm-hmm. and a good move harishit because you wanted to play c4 which was the right idea there the move is bishop g3 ah you and if e5 then uh, the b3 h8 diagonal becomes very weak absolutely so bishop e3 um and after a move like knight still knight b6 now the g3 c7 is also a pin so okay you have few ideas one is pawn to c4 which is looks very tempting and c4 and c5 this is one idea yeah but the idea that is more tempting mm-hmm. um and perhaps the more stronger idea is there any chance knight takes d4 and sagar bhai hello 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 oh hello sagar hello hello guys kya baat hai sunai de raha hai acche se badhiya yes 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 dikh raha hai sunai de raha hai ekdam badhiya bhai log aaj to mast camera camera leke tum log sab mast dikh rahe ho sagar bhai this is the most exciting day on i mean the second most exciting day because tomorrow we have the finals and sagar bhai we saw you taking a video of gukesh how was he feeling like before the round what was the atmosphere very like calm. very calm i think whenever we see gukesh i generally calm down as a person because mm-hmm. he's so calm he's so cool he's so amazing Uh, yeah and today he you know what happened was we had a meet up uh, in one of the parks here and i mm-hmm. was thinking how many people will turn up you know like 10 people yeah. maybe 20 max we can uh-huh. think of maybe 25 and uh-huh. the guess so what more than 100 people came wow uh, and they brought the indian flag wow. and they said wow. pura pura aise park mein and then all these Let people came to do. <laughs> <laughs> and then we walk from the park to the venue like nearly i think half people went so nearly 50 people walked and we came here and then these people stood outside the playing hall and as mm-hmm. the players entered it was like everyone was like yeah come on to finish come on start come on so it was very cool uh, i have i have those videos i will put it up and um, I thought I thought that this entire thing was very nice, you know, putting the players in good mood. But I yeah. could sense the atmosphere in the playing hall being very tense uh, because such a important round, right? Uh, there was this yeah. one nice moment where we had the chief guest today, who is an NFL player, and he coming oh, wow. and asking uh, Hikaru and Nepo. Uh, so how are we doing, guys? So Hikaru said yes, good, and Nepo said. Uh, trying to be good you know so <laughs> <laughs> i think nepo nailed it when he said like you know we are all trying to be normal right yeah. now there is a lot of pressure so yeah lot it's a very of... big yeah yeah so uh, i'm Again, i'm very excited can you can what? you guys take take me through gukesh's game like uh, the the live position i thought gukesh was yes. a little passive So just to leave this over here, guys, that has happened. And uh, uh, sorry, C takes. What was the best happened. move, Amruta? Yeah, over in here, that in this instead of C four, yeah, I think C takes D four, taking on D four. Okay, yeah, simply and D five pawn is undermined. Yes. Yeah. So Vaishali nice. clearly better. 
just to show what? you what vaishali might score her fourth win in a row yeah highly possible humpy versus wow. anna mudich going a little unclear Equal. yet yeah. we'll come back here but let's go to gukesh's game oh g6 played oh she played no, yeah no. oh i thought you played it okay okay ha huh. i thought Amruta, yeah. yeah what is that line yeah. below you yeah. what is that line which one d4 no 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 the line is a line hai na tumhare niche in the video are ha thanks in your video oh are ye to kitna important line tha ग्रेट न्यूज फॉर अस इन फैक्ट बिशप सी टू इगर इयर दिस इज दोजिशन गोके स्लाइटली we can say in the unpleasant position very slight but what no. do you think I mean, yeah i think uh, sagar bhai we've kind of reached a very like typical italian position where black has gotten in the d5 break but now the thing is if black ever takes on e4 white will happily take back with the d pawn um and then he will maybe come back with his knight to c4 um i still think even if like if we forget about the engine evaluation i personally think that this is an equal position um where you know, which means that, that i will have yeah i also thought the same what you are saying but after the mm-hmm. move g6 i was not mm-hmm. very clear what is white's next move matlab white khelega kya what is the plan let's say queen g3 idea knight f5 but ah okay you want to go maybe let's say king h8 i e5 is but then e5 pawn is hanging yeah so, so i have a dual threat yeah Rookie uh, eight. Rookie eight. Uh, is knight f five possible now? Because maybe. But you can take on f five perhaps, yeah. And but the bishop on c two, yeah. The bishop on c. No, I don't. Maybe I don't like. Yeah. But then knight at six. Take I thought. King g seven. Uh, g seven and queen f three. But yeah, queen f six back perhaps. Queen f six can be a move. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. Maybe I yeah. was thinking not instead of Queen G three, if we can play the move H uh, three, uh, yeah, with the idea of Knight G four, but then this variation <laughs> existed. This is this was something uh, Harshit was mentioning that takes takes, and he also mentioned one of the ideas to keep in mind is uh, this. Yes, move. it's a great idea, and I wanted to make it work like Bishop E six, Knight G four, but then mm-hmm. after take take. Knight takes, pawn takes, queen h4. You queen are in trouble again uh, because yes. g4 Very is nice hanging, point. and so so I was yeah. actually getting a bit worried through these variations. Then maybe mm-hmm. Mukesh is landing in a tough spot. uh maybe not very clear like right now but definitely it feels like the game is not heading in his way as as someone with white pieces. Hmm. Yes, but the thing is, Sagar Bhai also. uh the opening that feruja played the berlin defense if white were just to play everything uh like normal and usual then the game would have uh shifted towards a very solid and very uh, deeply analyzed by feruja so i think gukesh's idea today was that let's just get a game we saw that we saw him doing that with uh, abasov as well where he played this move h6 and knight h7 and he's like okay engine says that i am better but prove it he true but you know feruja is a slightly more dangerous opponent uh, than abaso and also i i get this feeling that maybe this position is very straight forward for black like you put bishop on e6 king on g7 queen d7 uh, so we'll see how this develops but yeah. i i have a feeling that for now feruja should be happy with what is comfortable yeah so if uh, just to check also the what the computer says g6 is best then we should also see what the computer says the next move is rook e1 is the best suppose yes rook e1 you put the rook here uh, for true, black it's true. a clear next move that he wants to develop his bishop to b6 and, and uh, now h3, i have a question yeah knight f1 yeah, <laughs> knight f1 with the idea of putting pressure on e5 that could be possible but then you have to worry about knight g4 bishop g4 Stop. True. Okay. Thinking but if knight f two is ever a move, guys. Knight what? F five. F five. Is that ever a move? Ooh. 
So your idea is if takes takes. Take? Which okay, you get back. a piece. Okay, I know I'm down five. a piece, but rook e five. Even sometimes, like let's say bishop g five now. Yes, after rook. Okay, rook five king h eight, bishop g five. Okay, I'm down a piece. I agree, but rook g eight. Uh, let's say I will just play bishop h four or h four. Both moves are interesting. And next, yeah, I want rook a one. I hope Rukesh does not do this inspired by him. <laughs> oh, no, because I think Please. this is very interesting, and in the normal situation, he will Bishop definitely Piet? consider. But this Bishop tournament Piet? situation, me kya se? D four. Ah, I understand, Harshit, by that you this. you are this enjoying. So cool. That is like over. Bishop Piet Please, Rukesh, by. Don't don't get carried away. G six happening on the board. It's really not so easy to play with the white pieces. Mm -hmm. By the way, But... I need to tell you guys here a small secret, which I hope uh, not many people will hear. Five thousand only is that many people have been asking that ticket mil raha hai ki nahi, you know, yaha pe. So there is a small thing which has been introduced, which is like if you come. And you buy worth hundred Canadian dollars from the shop which is here, and the shop is very interesting. It has uh, hoodies and T-shirts and everything. Is Then you can actually remain. Is it like yes, a it's a Fide shop. shop? No, it's a Fide shop, uh, run by Fide. But it is. I I will show the video and whatever it is. The people can actually stay here for the entire period. So if so you I'm, buy wow. something for hundred Canadian dollars, you can stay there. Ah, yes, last it's like it's only they are uh, releasing. Yes, because, because it's a new, new to... thing which they have uh, introduced. So I don't think it's publicly put up anywhere. But just for all our viewers who are thinking, five thousand three hundred people on the live YouTube. So that's a secret, guys. Never tell Sagar secrets. <laughs> But Sagar, no, no, you guys, are actually, I'm okay. sure, I'm sure that it is a very nice thing which will happen if you guys come here because you know Fide would be happy. You will get to see, and also. Um, It's it's worth it, yeah. Like uh, good products, and then you tell get me, to stay with tell it. Tell me one thing. I heard that this Friday there is this candidates board which is going to be auctioned. I mean, it's, yes. it's a, firstly in chess, it's you know in cricket we know a, a lot of things like there is a bat and everything, all of that. But in chess, it's a little new. So a candidates board will be auctioned. Is that true? Like you can have bidding yes, and everything. Yes, there is a candidates board with signed by sixteen players, mm -hmm. and I think there is a bidding, and it's on shop. dot pide. dot com website. Wow. So all those who want to bid for it, please go there But and bid something. for it. What do you think would be the highest, uh, you know, bidder? Abhi to kuch, abhi to kuch, four thousand, four thousand dollar kuch hai. पांच हजार डॉलर है एंड आई एम थिंकिंग दैट इफ गुकेश विंस आई वांट टू मेक अ बिड ऑफ टेन थाउजेंड डॉलर्स वो उसको <laughs> It is right. It's Currently at two lakh sixty six thousand four twenty INR. हाँ वही बस सोच रहा हूँ मृता अपुन खरीद लेते हैं ठीक है गुकेश वैसे भी जीतने वाला है जिंदगी में आगे बहुत कुछ and then we can actually sell it and then make money. <laughs> Good idea. ठीक है so if Gukesh wins we will try to get this board uh, to India. रीजन फॉर इट इजुडेरता Oh, by the way, ये उसका बहुत बार होता है ना हाँ वो ऐसे by the way chat को एक question तो पूछती हूँ chat what do you think at what price will the board will get auctioned according to you you know, chat is very smart in all of this हाँ हाँ chat तो भाई वो तो वो तो ढूंढेंगे loop hole क्या है would think I I have never even seen such an auction only uh, auction of uh, global chess league CSL and all also, those also 
talking about uh, like just coming back to chess just take a look at this game sure. prague versus fabi where a lot of interesting moves have been played oh we are uh, knight g5 knight f8 ko we left prague went oh. queen g4 great idea because i think there's serious Prug. pressure here h5 i like prague's position and queen f5 with the threat of queen I f7 prague ne mate net mate mate threat lagaya f7 <laughs> <laughs> mate nahi hai the king will run though Name, um and if f6 i think guys his idea is actually knight to e6 get rid of the uh, knights and basically now after the knights are traded we are playing against a very bad bishop on e7 so let's say a scenario where we exchange 27. all the major pieces Let, let's let's say queen 7 take yeah take. and you exchange all the pieces like uh this position will be slightly unpleasant for black to defend because Very rook slight, b1 no? Ah, rook b1. Rook b1 because b6 there is no, a fight. No, sorry, because the bishop, I mean, uh, yeah, it's like at there is at home one person who is so lazy and he gives such an energy in the entire house by doing nothing. Yeah, you just don't know. Amrita, are you talking person. about yourself? Ja rahi hu main saagar. Oh God! I am gonna Kutti. keep this in mind after you come. Maybe Harshit is thinking that there is no such thing in my life. What is this? Hey, hey, hey! Harshit, you did you see today? Harshit, you know. By the way, Harshit, uh, dekho, what happened in the last hai, two rounds? In the last round, I won, but uh, in the second last round, I won, but the last round I actually uh, lost. But uh, the thing was, if I even if I won, then I did not have a chance. for first place so i tried to play so something very second? risky i finished second yes second in this tournament who won it uh batsur and dambasur and won the b section and leon actually won the a section ah, leon mendon ka kya bhai leon to bhai ekdam form mein hai he is the next big thing second. i feel yeah. of indian chess i, I sure. actually Guys. showed the article also shahid had written jahan pe all the details were there harshit ke you have to see harshit ke kitne sare photos the badhiya badhiya he is wearing some nice shirts and all that so harshit is not just playing chess sir harshit op guys harshit op harshit bhai uh, your rating right now did it increase in this event yeah i increased my rating by 16 points so i'm getting oh. back to and that to at this back, le- uh, what is now getting back to 2500 yeah my rating now will be around 24 close to 80 so with hopefully one two more tournaments i'll come back to you know yeah, 25 15 maybe something like this and you know sagar yeah, he is also like when he's commentating firstly he gives some amazing ideas like it's insane the speed at which he is calculating also not just tactical ideas but a lot of strategic ideas he's he's really good at exchanges and all so uh, it is it also helped him he said commentary yeah baat hai yeah, sure. thank you that's good to know Uh, maybe I should also think about it to play and Amrita should <laughs> think about like, it. Otherwise, like, मुझे तो कुछ मदद नहीं हुई. So, guys, uh, if we think about it, today's day, if Prague yeah. manages to hold Fabi, which is very likely, yeah, from the position he has here, मतलब जीत भी सकता है, but draw looks likely. Then Fabi's chances of winning this event become lesser. because then he has to beat nepo tomorrow correct yes yeah yes yeah and today if gukesh i would to tell you the truth uh, looking from gukesh's uh, body language and also the position i am not a big big fan of his position so maybe let's say draw is a good result today for gukesh yeah i actually then also think the, that he should also think not burn the bridges yeah. Yes, and then we come to this important game, which is Naka yeah. versus Nepo versus Naka. I was just when I looked at it, I felt like great result of opening for Nepo, but perhaps not mm-hmm. so much yeah anymore. Yes, because if you go back two moves, Amruta, uh, we I mentioned this move pawn to d five, uh, Sagar Bai. Yeah, with that the was instead of bishop c two, instead of bishop c two. Yes. After queen d eight, knight to uh, d. And now I want to go d6, or I want to go knight c5, and uh, you know basically cement my knight on e6 perhaps. So I think this was a way White could have actually gotten a serious, serious advantage. But uh, now it seems like 
Hikaru is kind of getting back into this game by making because the move F five. Yeah, because F five was first thing he had to play, and now your B six has been played, so he is able to assess ninety six taking this. Now twenty five, maybe no twenty five bishop. It's it's a little surprising mm-hmm. yeah. no, for Nepo. This was kind of a big opportunity to go D five or let's say even knight C five here. So with the, yeah. the bishop C two did not help him. But I thought that it was a little tough decision to understand whether the pawn on F six or F five because pawn on F five did look bad. Yeah. So yeah, he can so, maybe draw. We can say. So today, if everything ends in a draw, then we go tomorrow with the same situation like today. <laughs> oh, true. Oh, by the way, I like how Vidit is uh, pressing a bit, but I don't know if it is enough. Sagar, by look at the clock situation. Forty-six. One hour, six minutes for Neja, and forty-six minutes for Vidit. So. At least, according to the time situation, I am, uh, you know, kind of guessing the psychological uh, frame of mind therein. I think Abbasov will be quite happy right now, uh, having such a big time advantage. Oh my hmm. god! So yeah, we... I think Abbasov uh, would be looking for his first win in this tournament. But at the same time, I have a feeling that if Vidit manages to win two games, he will have a very positive feeling about these candidates. Than just you know ending it with two draws. Yeah. Yeah. All is well when you finish well. Like exactly. The same exactly. Goes. So Except if you are Harshit Bai, he was always happy, regardless <laughs> of his result. <laughs> Today, by the way, Amruta I had a very good stream. Did you see it? No. What? What? what a! You did not see Sagar Bai stream. No. Not on Chess Days India. Happen. It was on Samai's channel. No, oh. I knew there was something, but I just at I think six forty five slept off, and I was like in because I had such a long day. It's not even Amrita. It was very quite a How was normal it? stream. Like it was, it was decent. Like good that you were not there. Like you could sleep and Lunch. take rest. Yeah, seven six forty five to ice. I woke ah, up at eleven. It's so important, so. important because anyway, like chessy who are okay, like a good time. Okay, so G six maybe uh, maybe now okay. जस्टिस फॉर अमृता कुछ तो चल रहा था इन द बिगिनिंग आई डोंट नो इफ देयर वाज एनी कनेक्शन बट नहीं नहीं वो इसका कोई चैट क्या हुआ था think... चैट आई एम नॉट अवेयर लेटर प्लीज लेट मी नो बिकॉज़ आई डू रीड द चैट एंड व्हेन इवन व्हेन आई हैड आस्क्ड देम फॉर द ऑप्शन चैट को तो तुमको पता है ना हम तो सागर की 11 लाख वगैरह बिडिंग के लिए दैट इज देयर गेस सर रफली अराउंड 10 11 लाख लाख में बोर्ड जाएगा 10 11 लाख सो सागर पूनम डिवोर्स गैम्बिट अरे भाई क्या हुआ क्या है ओ माय गुडनेस ठीक है चैट क्या है है फिर के वापस लेट्स नॉट गो कमिंग कमिंग बैक बैक का फेवरेट लाइन आज इफ आई हैड टू टॉक अबाउट चेस इफ Coming back to chess. Yes, Arshad, we are not coming back to chess now. We oh, are still... by the way, Gukesh played. Gukesh only said coming one, back wow. to chess. Nice. Now we need to come back to chess because rookie one is yeah, rookie a good one. move. Bishop he has e6. played, and uh, bishop e6. But bishop e6 is not as uh, like rookie eight is also a move which can tempt you to go for or uh, what else? King g7. Yeah, that's what the computer says. King g7 also. So I'm actually I don't know about you guys. I I really like. Okay, I know it's not my game, but this idea of knight f5 Amruta makes white play easy right now. Do, do we agree that black plays easier? Yes. Yes. So after bishop e6, knight f5, wouldn't you agree that ev- like objectively maybe not, but at least practically it's easier to play with white? No. Wouldn't you agree, Amruta? Bishop e6, I, knight I, f5. You should, you should seriously consider being a uh, judge of a supreme court. <laughs> do, do you agree? <laughs> yes, I completely. No, I agree. In fact, I would love if Gukesh goes for such an idea. Only question is today if he goes for such an idea is a risky thing. But क्या पता मजा आ जाएगा. Yes. I have some update here. There is one game which has ended. Oh. Uh, oh. In the women's section. Okay. Which is Tanjongi versus Goryachkina? I think they drew. Oh wow! 
So Tanjong he keeps her lead. Still in the but lead. If yeah. Late, if late in year today loses to Vaishali, then maybe Tanjong he almost becomes the champion. Oh, champion. Yeah. My goodness. And so, she has seen already that Vaishali is better. So maybe that decision is uh, because of. Yeah, yeah, true. Very true. Could be. Vaishali. Could be. Yeah, yeah. Vaishali is much be- very, very true because in this uh, stage of the tournament, you have to kind of keep an eye for the people who are just behind you who can. catch up mm. uh, so yes. a very nice practical decision by uh, and jongi that's true ha ah, yeah yeah sure yes. uh, by the way the, the point is Bizarre. tan jongi tan jongi and uh, goriachki na tan jongi could have played for a win but why shall mm-hmm. yeah <laughs> that was the joke yeah no but uh, sagar we have some super chats divit mathur says guki ko dekho ya kal apna tournament khelu of course guki ko dekh lo divit joy the <laughs> Joy Datta says hello Sagar superb camera work today in the beginning. Ah yeah we we actually saw you you were shooting and we were able to get that mobile view what you were shooting. Yes I generally have a lot of so what I did was I shot the first move of the Nakamura Nepo game and then I quickly went and because I didn't want to miss any moment of vocations. Yeah, so that was very and, nice. Uh, uh, what we see you movie. also were there. Then we watch one damle pillar of Indian chess says Guki OP. How are you, Amrita and Sagar? GM sixty nine OP. Hoping to see Guki as the candidate and next world champion. Oh, definitely. Yes, <laughs> everyone's very excited here. In fact, uh, you know, if Bukesh wins, so many things will roll differently in the world of chess or in Indian chess. So we are all very excited. But for now. Yeah. Lies a very now, big hurdle. Let yes, we have a big. You know, let's keep the let's keep everything Sorry, in Arshish reserve bhai. right now. We, we, because we, wait a second, Arjun Bhai, <laughs> I need to talk about something else for now. Then you can use your dialogue. Okay. Amruta, yes. आज खाने में क्या बना है? अरे खाने में हाँ हाँ आज क्या अरे Arjun Bhai, use your dialogue ना भाई. नहीं ना. एक्चुअली अमृता <laughs> waking up all night is not easy and doing it for a whole month is really commendable hope guki wins uh, yeah yeah definitely i mean really amazing of harshit also to join us whenever he could be from his tournament and all right now is waiting he's calculating things on the board harshit all this time he used to come up with some insane ideas after night f5 and tactics let's go let's go while sagar no i'm back. just hmm I actually just I think like I don't know Amruta like I think practically if if Gukesh thinks that's my thing if Gukesh thinks that Nepo versus Hikaru is going to be a result mm. which means that he would be trailing by half a point if that is his thinking then he should definitely consider or he probably is considering bishop e6 knight f5 Amruta like but right now if he would see the game then he would assess like he's not getting up right Ah, uh-huh, now he's up. I yeah, think he's not on the board. There so, is a live. I'm pretty sure there are live boards for everyone to see. I think, hmm. or something. There should be something like this where the players can, you know, take a look at the other games. Um, so I am. I personally believe that the the this game can become quite interesting if a move like knight f5 happens, or go, uh, he might just go something simple like h3. Yeah, and the good thing is Ali Reza has been thinking. So for rookie one, when did he start thinking? Six minutes. It's been six minutes. Fifteen moves yeah. they have played, and maybe Ali Reza takes some time because as you are calculating a move like knight f five, even Ali Reza it's so much of his style. Like if he was white, he would yeah, himself sure. calculate that. So all of these yeah. calculations will are will be time consuming for sure. 
So yep. I'm predicting that he might think another few minutes to make a decision whether Bishop e6 is a good idea or rook e8. Uh, so at least on time, there is not a big gap for Gukesh, which is very important. Yeah. For sure. Um, is there any update in the other games is what I was checking yeah, and Raga, not yet. F5, Bishop d6 was played. So he defended mm -hmm. uh, the f7 guy. And now Prague yeah. is thinking... Um, yeah, he might. I mean, Prague will definitely be wanting to put the pressure on Fabi <laughs> right now because he wants to strike back in this tournament after, you know, having a loss to Hikaru. And Sagarbhai is going to have some exciting apple update as of my eye. Got yes, the apple. tell me the update, Sagar. I, I went to ask, but they said that we will update you. So I went and bought an apple. <laughs> okay, Sagar, that's cool. But they will update, no? Then you can let us know later. Uh, sure. And last three, two super chats I had to read. I'll just quickly read it and uh, finish them. Pratham Anand says, Sagar, bhai, I was going home, but just took a U-turn after the secret. So we'll be able to access the place to see them playing. Kya baat hai? Amazing. And uh, we had Rishabh saying, chat to super chat. Earthling sends love and appreciation to Chesbiz India and GM69. Much love. That's what he says. Uh, yeah, I've read all the yeah, super chats. And I have read all the, I think, believers. So, all going good, Sagar. All going ex excellent. समझ में आएगा बात करना मुश्किल है सीख ही जाएंगे अभी तुम दोनों अगर गुजराती में बात करोगे तो आ जाएगा with the idea of yep. f4 and black mm -hmm. plays knight g6 what is a good mm -hmm. move for white oh white to play yes yes with the super question bad bad kar lo aati hu ek minute bad bad kai disrespect to bhi yaar kya hai but sagar bhai do, do you actually like do you actually think that gukesh was having the same focus today and the calmness yeah. like he was with yeah. Abasov or was he more same. nervous today? I didn't same. find him nervous at all. Same, same. And I also feel like Gupesh does not think about these things so much. Like definitely mm -hmm. somewhere in his head it's there. But mm -hmm. he's one of the most calm, calm players in the chess circles. Because as the finish line gets closer, Sagar by Yes. Every yes. human, you know, it crosses your mind that I'm almost there, I'm almost there. And that's why they say that, you know, the hardest thing is, like, is to, you know, maintain focus when you're almost uh, about to reach your target, whether in chess or somewhere else. So, it will be very interesting to see how Gukesh manages to withstand the pressure. I, I do think it, but I feel like... Uh... He's a little bit different, you know, Harshit. And I think all the players who go on to become like these stars, they rise up to the occasion when such a moment comes. Like, for many, it's like a pressure moment. But for someone mm -hmm. who's really good, they're like, this is an opportunity. Like, this, yeah. iske liye main peda hua tha. like this is for what I want. Yeah. So this is what I think the players must be thinking. I mean, such, such uh, a privilege and pleasure to watch uh, these players, not only just Indians, but everyone participating and giving their best in this event. And as Amruta is back... Amruta, uh, what are the answers? Yes. Wow. Knight to e6, found by... 51 people. Yeah. You can read? You don't see it in general? Yeah, I cannot. Sai Shruti. Yeah. Bridge Patel. Ah, Vrandesh, Divit, Shivan, Kishan, Kavita, Banti, and Neeraj. So, Knight E6. What a classy move. Deflection takes, and then the pawn structure, and a completely yeah. trapped bishop. So, castle, uh, knight G, uh, castle, Knight G6. How was it coming if you go Knight G6? 
I think yes. Prague is going to delay castle, uh, maybe. I think he just did castling. He oh, just played castle. He castled. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So knight g6 of course won't happen on the board. I mean, maybe it will. No, it won't. <laughs> but then black also wants to castle. It's so difficult. And no, no, no. Do, because he can't long castle. If he castles, the h5 pawn is weak. The knight is oh, not able can... to move. Amruta, he hmm. can go queen e7 to prepare knight g6. Hmm. Okay, but, but that's then a long time, f4. no? Exactly. F4, but look, the only thing is, f4, is it too early? Weren't you, Let's weren't you scared it. of... Oh, if g6, kya hi trickery? Sagar by trickery. Wait, wait, wait. Oh my god. Why do bye, bye, play? Bye, bye, bye. Some tactics are here. Why to play? This is insane. Like they, the the players are waiting for this opportunity. We are waiting for this opportunity to, you know, find these beautiful tactics that the players are calculating right now. Bridge Patel, bye. Bridge Patel, well done. <laughs> um, Manik Sharma is saying, Amruta, you are doing well. Don't take so much stress. Stress? What stress? Is stress le, no stress, Manik. Amrut. <laughs> Lazy. Amuta, can you... Hmm. <laughs> okay. can you show the ch chat chess moves? Yes. I was just uh, going there. Everybody finds it. Like, nobody gets wow. a wrong answer. Wow. Wow. What a chat. Sahi Two buddy. FP5 is the only one. Can you read that name, Amruta? Yes. I will read it. <laughs> FP5. Oh, FP5. Somnath Bichara. Somnath Ji. Galat Jawab. <laughs> hmm. So, he Bridge Patel, Spandan being brilliant at chess and few others, but the move is Queen F7. You just are giving a piece because it's the time to disco at 2A. Yes, and the rook opens up from F1. Amazing discovered idea, Amruta. Um, so, actually, F4 is a very interesting move, and I quickly actually saw some update in the Hikaru game because. Uh, I have actually started to think that now uh, Amruta and mm -hmm. Sagar Bhai, if Bishop B7 is played, and let's say the knight can come to H4 and Queen to G5, suddenly you know uh, Hikaru's uh, like you know tactical sense is going to be uh, activated. Oh but Akshit, my first question is: This is a great thing you mentioned. Why is the D4 pawn not hanging? Queen takes D4. It is hanging. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I guess he wants to play queen f3, yes? I thought personally that his idea was the sneaky knight e5 move. Queen d1. Wow, this is queen d1 and mentioned. now knight g6. Yeah. g 6 And now rook a d1. And now I go rook to e7 next. And rook on the 7th file um, will probably give me enough compensation to... Uh, you know, yeah, be back the bishop in can't uh, develop, and the bishop will have to go to b7, and then you jump in with rook d7. Rook d7. This is so yeah. cool, actually, not so yeah. easy. Yeah, rook e8. But I, I think that black should not take the pawn because this might lead to a drawish position, and I think already black has kind of equalized if he takes on d4. But I think personally, Hikaru might sense this opportunity that uh, I can actually play bishop b7 and look you have an isolated pawn which is weak my f5 pawn is advanced but i can actually use it to my advantage if i go f4 f3 sometime the position and... i completely agree with you harshit but what about this sense as well the sense of fear about being on top and today everybody has that uh, subconscious fear if they lose they are kind of out you can say so as hikaru said he is just playing for fun. He has no stress. He <laughs> will play whatever he feels is the best and whatever, you know, um, gives him the most chances. And I personally mm -hmm. do think he will be considering bishop b7 quite uh, yeah. strongly because he has a draw. Queen d4 is a draw, guys. No, but yeah, bishop b7 ke baad white ka move is also not so clear because I was thinking no. knight e5 here. But yeah. then knight f4 looks strong. Yeah. But dangerous and queen mm. g5 coming in yeah. and some checkmating ideas already can be you know seen yeah my god guys yeah. uh someone said why is no one talking about 
second place. Uh, second place this time may not be that important because Ding will play the world championship. So I think it's all about first place. And by the way, Gukesh takes on D5. Can we go to Gukesh's game? Gukesh ne mara wow. hai. Aur Ali Reza ne bhi mara hai. Oh, so Bishop E6 happened. ED5 and C5 yeah. when there were so many takes to be played. Yeah, he just C took here. D5. Uh, he got rid of tension, but I think this does help black because Sagar by a move like e4 can be in black's consideration to just sacrifice a pawn, but uh, play with two bishops, Amruta seems like uh, which pawn sacrifice? Of, he, like, let's say h3, you go h3, hmm, for example, hmm. and e4 can be a possibility suddenly, like uh, or rook e8 first and then e4 to sacrifice a pawn. Knight e4, queen e4, and uh, the bishop on c1 is bad. The knight on e3 is dominated because of the pawn on g6. And maybe in the future, if not now, maybe first rook e8 and to prepare a pawn sacrifice like this. Hmm. Okay. So Let's see what Bukesh should do here. What would yeah. you do as Bukesh first? I'm, I'm thinking. Because generally when you take and give black such central pawns, you want to break the center immediately yeah. with d4. Right? Next. Yes. True. C4 bhi kar sakte kya? by chance C4 uh, is uh, uh, the fault. Maybe one thing yeah. right now, whichever position we have landed here, this knight and this bishop seems like a definite issue because it never could come mm -hmm. on F5 or yeah. even G4. So in that yeah, case, yeah. if we just in hindsight have to look at it, then the move knight, this move, knight E3, was mm -hmm. started uh, started this uh, what to say, little bit of unpleasantness mm -hmm. in the position. Mm -hmm. True, true. Okay, short a little bit of. Oh, he played x3? No, he's not no. played, but let's say the he plays h3 over here. Yeah. What are you going to do? Because if you play d4, that's hanging, no? Takes, takes, bishop. Yeah, d4, I, mean, I don't like. I don't like. I think takes, takes, bishop, d4. Yeah, simply. And he wanted to try c4, Sagar, I think. C4. No, no, no. c4, I don't like also d4. Okay. Just. Black is doing well. So h3. No, not h3. Let's think about a good move for white. Then you don't Let's have think about some... is not possible. I mean, do you can you move your I mean the problem with move like knight f1, which Sagarbai was suggesting, is that knight g4 suddenly becomes uh, an issue, one of the issues. Maybe yeah. like this, maybe you go back knight e3, yeah. Maybe you no, just say that okay. Oh, oh. Crazy. Completely. Bye crazy. bye bye bye. bye. That's a crazy idea, Amruta. This is very crazy, yeah. If you show that, yeah, knight e3, f5, and if knight g4, oh, sorry. the rook, fg4, the rook opens up. Knight g4, ah, f5. Knight g4, I was only generally uh, saying that f5, ah. but here, oh, oh, this also works. Oh. Yes. So a big decision for Gukesh, and I saw him giving a sigh, so maybe he's, you know, like, uh, it's like, mm. kya karu abhi? Abhi kya karu? I mean, like not so easy to make a move with no, white. And for Ali Reza, this is like the best position he can get. In the in fact, in this tournament. Easy to play. Yeah. Yeah. So H3 is the move which computer suggests here. So that at least you are, you know, getting re rid of these ideas. And then later you might think of, again, reviving the idea with Knight G4, Harishit, which you were mentioning. Mm -hmm. um, and maybe you can still have these at the right time to at least looking at maybe even knight f1 who knows because there is no knight yeah. g4 so the h3 is a calm move i don't know how how would you assess a move like h3 or it's a very prophylactic move but a tough one would you say here i mean the thing amruta is that if you make a move like h3 what problem does black have he'll just go rookie it and he's like i have a good center solid center my pieces are developed my king is not really coming under the attack so, like, what's my problem? Like, H3, I just go rook e8, for example. Yeah, suppose you go rook e8. And then it helps ah, with then your knight idea. Knight f1, maybe. Yeah, yeah maybe now. Knight... In fact, there are two ideas. One is knight f1. And, uh, you know, Harshit, the computer does suggest the one which you had mentioned, like, visionary, <laughs> long back. Okay, you... by the way, I have an update over okay, the please. sign board. Huh. Uh, and that Ritnani goes. <laughs> the thing is that they were going to introduce more boards. Okay. Uh, which oh, are signed wow. one. So this one is over actually, as you are rightly. Oh, he played by the way what? G3? H3. 
H3. What is oh, over? he played H3. Thank yes. God, that's still the best way to. He's defending well until now. He's defending well, Sagar. Now Knight. the idea is Knight F1 or uh, later Knight G4 or one question to you. You know, remember Harshit that was speaking about E4. So yes. if Knight F1, this is the move which the computer suggests. Yes. Yeah. Okay, this because time there are thinning ideas also with yeah. Bishop D. Bishop D5 is an idea Ooh. right now. For <laughs> Bishop D5, I think we'll sacrifice one exchange. Bishop takes D5. Then no, then no, no, one. really? Go on. Yes, yes, yes. Rookie one. No. Go on. And then Bishop G5. They sacrifice Ay, another exchange. <laughs> Rookie one. Hai. Rookie one. Bye bye. Look at that. Rookie one. Philanthropy. Okay, okay, okay. Bishop F6. Hmm, but queen b6 unnecessary ठीक है queen b7 भी खेला तो नहीं सागर भाई का आईडिया में बात कर रहा हूँ हाँ what was that idea which you were so excited to show वो तो दिखा हो queen d6 और queen b6 okay and now bishop takes f take it सागर भाई भाई मैं तो बोल रहा हूँ ना कि मतलब ये सब चीजें जिंदगी में करने की मतलब यही उम्र है सत्रह साल की उम्र में बट मुकेश <laughs> ये सब करने रहा है ही इज बीइंग वेरी सॉलिड सो नो राइट अगर भाई या आई नो मुकेश हैज लॉट ऑफ रिस्पांसिबिलिटी ऑन हिज शोल्डर्स बाय द वे आई वाज थिंकिंग आई वांट टू प्ले माय क्वीन टू डी7 बट समहाउ द नाइट विल हैंग राइट फॉर ई ऑप्शन एफ6 सो आई वाज थिंकिंग कैन वी स्टार्ट विद जी7 Okay, we can check with this move, but it looks like you know, एकदम ऐसे dull move, like mm. with so much happening there. <laughs> so then what? D four. The so the king G seven is one uh, the best move by computer. So मैं सिर्फ I'm only telling my perspective. Why? क्या है? This is like I'm I'm finding good moves and she's not even acknowledging that. डल मूव एकदम मजाज नहीं आमा तो कहीं राम मजाज एक्सेक्टली पूरा मतलब इट्स लाइक यू नो दैट जो पूछा तो मजा मार बिल्कुल नहीं है ऐसा वाला हर्षित भाई इट्स लाइक इट्स लाइक दिस रिलेशनशिप वेर द अदर पर्सन इज वेरी नाइस एंड काइंड एंड द पार्टनर इज सेइंग यार तू कितना बोरिंग है यार तू ऐसा ही कितना अच्छा है बोरिंग नहीं बट लुक एट दिस ना विद सच अ सेंटर बढ़िया नाइस पीसेस ओवर हियर फॉर ब्लैक King G seven. So first you will will we can say no. The idea is Queen D seven. I'm going to. The thing yeah. is not like that. I'm, I like yeah. it. No, no, don't take it seriously. It's a great move, Sagar. But to understand. No, no, I'm going to. I I never took you seriously, Adar. Oh. Allah. <laughs> I have to just stop Impossible. all curse words in my mind to you. But Sagar, what if D four was my question? Yeah, yeah. Arre, it's, exactly. This is. I I didn't see the computer. See, no, and D four, an active move is a good move. ये देख, active करके बढ़िया move है और King G seven ऐसे शांत इस that's a yes, character. Yes, actually, actually D four, D four, Knight C four really sharpens up the game, right? But oh, there is Bishop C four, D C four, E four, right? Mm -hmm. No, no, no. I mean that Bishop that four, Bishop four. No, no, sorry, sorry. Actually, after uh, Knight C four, hmm. Amruta. No, no. Maybe there can be E four directly could be a move. Because now D takes E4, the bishop on C4 is hanging. Ah, But nice. oh, actually no, continue that variation. Achha. Continue that variation. Bishop C4, bishop to G5. Nice. Oh wow. Nice. Now oh, wait, G7. Ah, uh, no, you can't. Still, this is hanging. What will you play? The move King G7 that you said e5. runs into e5. e5. Yeah. Maria, Maria. So this bishop G5 idea, sudden jump is something Black will need to be alert. Like constantly, it's a True. pressure. And that is the reason, Sagar Shah, that Why King G seven helps. Hmm. Yeah, Sagar Bhai knew everything. He calculated <laughs> all this and told you, and you just said, "What did I do wrong?" That's uh, that's reasoning okay. Is important, na? Boy, you have to convince in a nice, effective. It's, it's no, important. King G seven is a very nice move. Hmm. It's yeah. a prophylactic move, and actually, black with the move King G seven, it also enables, um, like. It actually stops White from having this bishop h6 idea. You know, White had the ability of going knight g4 mm -hmm. and sometimes bishop h6. So that has also been prevented. So, um, I think, I think you sometimes want to make a move which uh, makes like your future moves easier. And I think King G7 is one such move. 
it also gives gukesh many ways to go wrong so after g7 now gukesh has to decide ki ab fir se what what is the move that he wants to play because it's not so obvious maybe knight f1 uh, right nee, now firstly why, why, can you go knight g4 yes i was wondering knight g4 knight g4 let's say i take h4 queen, queen h4, h4. G- rook e5 g5 is a mistake yeah bishop g4 i guess yeah g5 could also and even f6 but... and this one okay yeah so rook e5 yeah rook e5 bg4 and yeah. uh, not bg3 yes i was going to queen. ask can i ask a question to the chat <laughs> yes but okay No, queen G3, yes, they will find it. Queen blunder. G3 yeah. is a big blunder. Pin. Yeah. Hmm. Um, so maybe perhaps Queen F4. Um, but yeah. then. No, sir. I want to. I want to ask a question to the chat, which is a little deeper. Like, don't make the move. Okay. okay, it's back. Can you go back? Queen F3 pet. If now Queen G3, guys. Queen G3, Queen G3, F G3. What is the good move for? Are don't make the move. Ah, I said. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry. Queen G three. Don't what is, Queen G three, Queen G three, F G three. What is the good move for black there? Okay. Let's ask our chat. All right, there we have a question for the chat, and while the chat is thinking, Anirudh says, "Agar apni wali commentary kara, please." Aaj energy low. Anirudh bhai, idhar Anirudh bhai, idhar uh, in the press room, no, so I cannot shout right now. Ne to fir mere ko nikal denge ask. Hmm. Lazanish asks, "How can I learn chess? Can't increase my rating." So, whoever asked me this question, um, I'll also uh, tell, let Sagar answer it. But I always thought that uh, a very good way to improve chess uh, is solve a lot of puzzles. Hmm. Because when you solve a lot of puzzles, you kind of develop your pattern recognition. Hmm. And you might have heard strong chess players use use this term a lot, pattern recognition, because basically. whenever you look at a position the way stronger players uh, evaluate positions is based on how they have looked how, how how they recognize patterns and for example this concept of uh, for example knight g4 at g4 g3 king g2 i have seen it so it makes me easier to find it so solving a lot of puzzles and looking at like you know 50 to 100 uh, games every day even if you look at them quickly will give you a lot of ideas that you were never aware of Uh, Hi Ali, uh, thank you, thank you, Harshit. Bye, Rookie. That is actually board. I very much agree with Harshit. Yeah, he can do. Just solve tactics, and you can see how Harshit is uh, already solving it. But Sagar, you had asked a question, and no, no, here Rookie we have on the answer. board. Yes, we'll go there. But look at the answer for Queen G three Queen. Ullu samjha kya unko. See, there are a few people who have mentioned rookie eight, bishop b eight, etc. So, थोड़ा बहुत है, but yes, guys, it's an illegal move, so cannot play f g three because the pawn is pinned. Okay, yeah, Amrita, yeah. going back, but rookie like eight. I'm very excited. Every go. move, every Let's move go. is Rukeshki very important. Rookie eight, take move. Oh, wait a second. After rookie eight, what? What? What is the good move? Harshit, you have found. Okay, let's go. No, no, no. Harshit, bye. Harshit, bye. Don't dream. Are we getting too excited? Are we getting too excited? Don't dream it. Because Arshid it's a tough one. You can't game. play that move in the game. Wait, 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 wait. It's a wait. tough one. Harshit, bye. Got me. Got me. Okay. Yes, I got me. Harshit, go for sure. वो तो उसका expression से ही समझा लाइक ही is excited about it. This is one. Th- what is that? अरे भाई Harshit, bye. Blueberries. Oh, Blue, blackberry just, or blackberry, yeah, blackberry, yeah, blackberry, don't blackberry. Don't sorry, do sorry. Don't do that to me. That is my most favorite thing when I go to the. Arshid, why? Why are you standing? Why are you standing? Ah, drink. Come, come. Agar, brother. Drink. Will eat. Ah. Tomorrow, like, without drinking, he will eat. Ah. 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 Ah
<laughs> भाई सागर भाई आराम से है मतलब वापस तुम जाके घर बेड पे He's he's like you know he's a little shook. I saw his expression. He's like ये क्या हो गया? थोड़ा हाँ, he's shaken up a bit. He's But shaken guys... up because I mean he cannot go rookie seven. He cannot go bishop d seven. So that means he has to go back to pavilion. Hmm. <laughs> Either rook f eight or rook e seven. These are the two. No rookie seven not possible. Sagar bhai. Ghoda is hanging. Why not? Oh bhai Ghoda ma bhai. Arey. Arey rookie seven. Obviously he's a blunder, Sagar. हाँ हाँ कैलकुलेशन Then you have all the time to at least throw a knight f1 and all the ideas. I'm still not sure. You know I, what I was four. thinking? What mm. I was thinking here? Mm. After rook f8 to play b3. The mm. idea of bishop a3, very silly move, but no, it's a decent move actually. Well, I was oh, I was only worried about rook b8 b5 somehow. Yeah. Like. Yeah, that would be dangerous. B3 also kind of somehow. Hmm. Doesn't feel right. Bit... Yeah, but actually, definitely, if you have to go back, just think psychologically, yeah. Amruta. You just played mm. rookie eight. Mm. You are like, "Chalo, mm. I want to go e four. I'm looking forward to like you know a very good future on the e line." Suddenly, my opponent goes bishop a four, and I'm like, "Damn, e seven pe nahi ja sakta. Bishop d seven nahi ja sakta. Wapas jana padega kya?" Ah, uh, exactly, bhai. It's same what, like what happened in my life. Like I was doing really well, and then suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> Something then, back to the. Hello, 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 hello. hello. <laughs> I think mean, I mean valid ma- marriage certificate expires after every ten years. You know that, na Sagar? No, 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 Amrita. No ah, marriage. I didn't say anything. Amrita, there is a big Are update. Title, big update. What about title? In Pragna Nanda's game against Karuana, it's a huge shift that has happened. Fabi is better. I don't know what happened. Karuana, uh, Prag has made oh a huge God. mistake. So after queen e seven, h three, queen h three. What was Prag thinking? I think he wants to go f four. I don't think he has. Maybe what else? But then f six, f six. Or he wanted to stop. Tha? Maybe suppose knight g six now. No. Huh. What if knight g six? Go. What is happening? With queen what is happening? Nothing changes. With queen yeah, nothing changes. Yeah, So tell me yeah, one but... thing. Tell me one thing. Uh, he could have played f four, right? Yeah. It was a normal move here. Yes, absolutely. Right. Hmm. Then, but he went. He went queen h three. Now Fabi said, "Bhai, kya kar raha hai? F six, right? Hmm. Now the knight has to go back to f three, and Fabi pushes g five, and suddenly knight that pawn is coming even further ahead, and uh, huge trouble for Prak. Yeah, will I have to go queen f five again? Because you don't want a queen here. Yeah, let's go passive. Uh, yeah, it's a queen f five g four. Actually, the queen is a little shaky. I'm. Oh no, g four nah, is no, happy. You are happy. Yeah, but you don't. No, but I, the hmm. problem is like knight e six or something yeah. like this, and the queen can Correct. somehow you know become flick. Oh, queen. Oh, next move. Rook at six. And long castle later, you wouldn't. But bye, but bye. I can give a check. You know. Queen g six. I just go king d seven. Sagar bye. Bye 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 bye. Can you make that move with the queen g6? One check, de do. King go d7, and now d d d, and now the rook is coming to g8. And what a beautiful coordination there for black pawns are just yeah. coming down. E4. We Ali Reza so played e4. Why Ali Reza played e4? That's what we had to calculate this. It's a good move. That was the best move, and maybe he has not missed this or. Maybe he missed it, but he yeah. anyway went for this idea. Let's uh, try to understand what's happening, because D takes E4, 
you will play mm-hmm. with you have pawn. to take with the pawn because if you take with the knight your rook is hanging ah yeah right so pawn takes pawn takes queen it already take. took it it took on it okay. yeah this took, has happened took it took back with the d pawn now where do you go with the queen g3 f4 only two squares you know in a way uh, because yeah, two two moves yeah only two squares queen f4 or queen g3 Knight, Let's say f4. f4. Knight h5 maybe? No, no knight h5. It's knight possible. h5 you can take. No e4. Ah, but no. Then I, you I can take on h3 maybe. No, brother, e8 is running. E8 is running. Bishop e8. Bishop d7 forced. Bishop d7 forced. Yeah, but then just move the queen. Ah. But now the problem is queen c4. D4. Yeah, queen c4. Actually, where do you go? Because queen c2. Queen c2. Queen c2. Oh, queen c two b five. No, 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 no. Only one square. Queen c four. Wait, what did he play? Ah, queen no. e two played. He played queen e two. Queen e two. Yeah, Very he quickly played, he's back. playing. Yeah, twenty moves. Queen e two is also. Actually, well Amruta, hmm. maybe it's a strategy. He, I will play fast. Pretend I have hmm. calculated everything, or actually, he probably did calculate everything. <laughs> and <laughs> okay, he doesn't need to pretend, but yeah, that's true. Uh, Like someone like us, maybe we just pretend that we have everything under control, and uh, Firuja has to make like for twenty uh, moves in forty four minutes, and the position is very complicated. So yeah. he is utilizing like the is time. Like Sagar is pretending right now, like everything is under control. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that way. So yeah, but Amrita, now rookie seven is making. Pro- now you are not going back home, right? Because now the knight is not hanging on f six. Correct. That's true, but still, you always have to worry about this. Always, always, always. We have some super chats. Uh, Sagar, boy, what's the next move after that joke? Poonam Pandey has super chatted. Had a lovely stream with Sagar. Such a sweet person. No, it can't be the real Poonam Pandey for sure. Thank you, Poonam ji. Also enjoyed a lot. No, I don't think she's. I mean, chat would know if. How much she's... money was given in that super chat? Fifty rupees. Yes, maybe not the real one then. <laughs> But she's become the new member. Ah, yeah. If she's the member, obviously not because we never saw. Uh, we remember some names, no? When they become members, so chat. Hmm. Correct. Try and कर ना बंद कर दो. Yes. हाँ. <laughs> okay, rookie seven is probably going to be played. Just quickly taking a look at the Hikaru game But, because uh, that. Bye, Arshid. Bye. You never. You never said coming back to chess. आप directly बोल ले लगे. चलो जीतो भाई को कैसे बचा है F3 F3 oh, and no, then rook d8 coming so he played d5 yeah, how is it d5. working if rook d8 now i think you have bishop b3 or yeah, worst case but the thing is looks scary yaar because mm-hmm. knight f4 and then suddenly d5 pawn is under pressure yes oh or bhai 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 can't believe g3 just g3 is possible Better move. Trying to see if there are. Oh my God! Whoa! Hmm. Whoa! 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 Arshad, what happened? Queen of three. Queen of three. Start. 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 Start हाँ बिशप डी फाइ बिशप डी फाइ ओके यार गाइस वाइट टू प्ले फाइंड अ मूव व्हिच मेड हर्षल क्या बात है गो क्या बात है रेस गो बाइक मोड हाँ बाइक मोड बाइक मोड वो रहते थे फर्स्ट वी यूज्ड टू हैव दिस काइंड ऑफ जोक्स तो जहाँ पे नहीं आई आई कैन नॉट सी यू एक्चुअली Wow, so many people, people have found it already. Bye. Sai Shruti, Prakar Gupta, bye, bye. Adarsh, Chinna, Arsh, Satyam, Akul, Deep Throner, Laksh, and Neeraj. What are you talking about? Queen D5. Rook D5. Rook. 
this is really i am sure harshit first that time it would be like wo 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 yeah pe bhi chalta hi gaya chalta hi gaya night of sir and rukta seven one more last vroom <laughs> What a what nice is plate. Plate. Okay, rookie rookie seven, seven, plate. Rookie seven plate. Yeah, okay. but actually, guys, let's also not forget that the game Prague versus Fabi is going to have a huge impact on the standings. If Prague, if Karuana wins, if Karuana wins, that is all they draw. Guys, guys, imagine this. Okay, this is very likely to happen now. Fabi wins, Bukesh draws, uh, Nepo Naka draw. Okay. They all move to eight points. Tomorrow, Fabi versus draw. Nepo draw. Gukesh versus Naka draw. Everyone moves to eight and half points. Everyone goes into tie break. Twenty second ko four player tie break. Baap re baap. Another. Maza ya jaaye. Crazy. Dangerous. Dan. It anything okay. can happen. But I mean, this. But look, but, oh, but very. Knight of one played. Played Lots his knight of... on f one, and he's saying, "Boy, my bishop is opening up on the dark square, going to g five, and pinning your knight, and also black ka jo bishop, dusra bishop hai, it is on the other side of the board, very poorly placed. Actually, very well placed, but very poorly placed for the action on king side. King side, yeah. And if you think about it, Gukesh is actually, you know, uh, trying to." Utilize the strategy that I mentioned of playing fast. He again made this move in a matter of two minutes, and mm. Firuja actually is down to less than forty minutes. Definitely oh, something that was discussed on the drawing board uh, when they were preparing for this match. Two, 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 exactly. So now, now, what should be Firuja's move? Because his rook is a little awkward on e seven, right? It cannot go to d seven. It cannot go to e eight. तो करे तो करे क्या जस्ट बी सागर जस्ट बी ओ माय गॉड आई एम जस्ट जस्ट डोंट नो व्हिच गेम टू फॉलो बिकॉज़ फाबी हैज प्लेड लॉन्ग कैसल्स या आई टोल्ड यू दैट टाइम एक्चुअली द कंप्यूटर वाज सजेस्टिंग लॉन्ग कैसल एंड इट इज इनसेन विद दीस पॉन्स देयर यू डू नॉट रियली हैव अ ब्रेक ओनली वन रुक व्हिच कैन बी ऑन द ओपन फाइल अमेजिंग सागर बाय डू यू रिमेंबर that uh gukesh uh, prag was trying to exchange the d2 knight when he played the move knight to g5 but that knight that was having such a good future on g5 has become passive on d2 and back, black is going to exactly what has happened to that knight it is <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay 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 bolo bolo nahi bolo bolo okay, okay. bolo hi <laughs> harshit harshit the nahin, moment nahin. harshit harshit bhai smile nahin, bolo, like abhi to waisa kuch bolo bhai samajh gaye ko main idhar se nikal hi dungi idhar se direct aise wo art of ending hai na waise tumhara ending you cannot you cannot uh, kick me out of the zoom meeting because i am using the same account as you <laughs> So if you kick me out, if you if I want to kick you out of the house, you will have another key. So I can't do that. Exactly, exactly. Hmm. Okay, guys. But coming back to the position right now, <laughs> it seems as black is going to have a big tactical um, attack on the black white king because h4 knight d4 g3 idea. Samruta, I am scared for Prague's position. If I was yeah. Prag, I would be hoping that यार मेरा king g1 के जगह पे a2 पे होता तो कितना safe हो जाता था. Oh, oh, actually. Can't yeah. Even no, no. I mean, I think for Prag, it's very difficult to even create counter play on the other wing, right? क्या कर सकता है? Yeah, because if you go a5 and a6, Black just responds with b6. Uh, Amruta, let's say you make a move a5 for Black. Black, no, no, no. Black, right. Black yeah. goes. Uh, let's say rook d8. Okay, you're not worried about or, a6. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to g8, and whenever you respond with a6, I just go b6, and all of your attack is stopped as Sagarbhai's eyes are closed. No, no, no. I'm not. <laughs> you want to sleep, Sagar? You want to sleep? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm very fine. Very fine. Uh-huh. By the way, Vidit is getting a very yeah, solid edge against Nijat. He, I had, pre- I have predicted for this game, Sagar, a uh, long back. With the twins, will, yes. So a five. Very interesting six, position. Rook e one, rook, queen d eight. But thirty five minutes, and now Nijat has used some of the time. Eventually, this mm-hmm. is going to uh, hit the king. 
feel mm-hmm. i feel okay but let's go to gukesh's game that nothing beats like we cannot miss we have to analyze every move here in this game because this yeah. is the only game for us uh, gukesh can become you know in go in tie breaks so let's have a look here knight f1 queen was queen c7 played. played and now queen c7 so the queen very c7 first... ah. Bishop G5 runs into Queen E5, I think, right? That's his idea. Hey, big move, big move. And uh, Queen is centralized, and sometimes Amruta, the Bishop from A7 can go to B8, and the uh, the H2 Ooh. square, you know, can sometimes uh, be a little uh, vulnerable. And yeah, guys, do you remember this knight and this pawn? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, the knight on h2 i think i think gukesh really likes his knights on h2 and f1 yeah he had played knight h7 knight f8 do you remember sagar oh so this yeah, knight, yeah yeah he has more understanding here about the knight on f1 <laughs> maybe harshit as we were discussing the ferrari the f1 this <laughs> knight seems like that <laughs> yeah maybe the bishop is not the only piece which likes uh, f1 racing yes actually true So queen c7, bishop g5 is one candidate option, candidate move option. I want to trade the queens. How can I do that? Because if I trade the, the queens, oh. if I trade queens, the pawn on e4 is weak. Uh, the hmm. dark squares are weak. So in this position, guys, if white is able to trade his queens, that's a success. Wow. Okay. So let's bishop, say that. But tell me something. Do you want this bishop here because, or you would like to exchange this bishop? I mean, in the few, it depends actually because the bishop on a7 actually, uh, there was a like in I had a coach Evgeny Vladimirovich, uh-huh. a grandmaster from Russia, very very experienced and nice coach, and he said that sometimes some pieces look aesthetically very good, but in fact they're actually paper tigers. Oh, What that means is that they're tigers, but on paper they are actually not really very dangerous. They are not like right. you know, uh, Madras tiger, which we have. Exactly. Are, are, are. <laughs> oh, so, by the way, Prague's advantage is going like Arun is minus one point two. Stay here, Sagar. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, we'll stay here. We'll stay here. And I was just saying, like, it's Prague is making maybe not so great moves back to back, which is increasing Arun's yeah. edge. Yeah. Hmm. Mm-hmm. So that's why the bishop on a7 is not a very uh, like you don't have to fear this bishop because I you know I wanted to go knight g3 but once again you can't go knight g3 big blunder so then the next move came in the mind was bishop b3 which uh, black is very happy about because of uh, I think bishop c4. Mm-hmm. I was considering Amruta bishop g5 queen e5 queen b. E five. If this can ever work. What a move! You wanted to exchange the queens. Hey, Harshit, why? Why are you sitting here? You have to go. <laughs> go ahead, man. In life. Yes, Sagar. I am yeah, going. I have. Right. Actually, I don't mind saying it, but I have a goal in chess, and uh, I'm going to have a journey. Like I'm going to try to become twenty six hundred. I've. I became a grandmaster, and after that, I kind of did not have a set goal. Um, but now I do. I want to become twenty six hundred as. Soon as I can, so I'm going to start putting in efforts towards that goal. Wow, this is amazing! This is so great to know. Beautiful. It. I think Harshit, it's very likely that within the end of this year you will cross twenty six hundred. The way you are, you know, that is huge. That would be that's huge. But yeah, let's see. I mean, long way to go. Um, but yeah, this queen b five idea, Amruta, as I mentioned. Like basically, kind of uh, as I was just explaining, that queens exchange will happen, so that would benefit white. Hmm. No, it's beautiful understanding actually of the position that you remove the queens out of the board and the e4 pawn is weaker. Love it, love it, Harshit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So queen c7, cool. bishop. So this is my fourth scale. Yeah? Like for bishop g5, this is pin. This is attack. Is the is queen e5 the only way? No, Black Ali, has there is a, Ali there is a Ali there is very dangerous. Yeah, here he might have some move up his sleeve. Yes. Oh he my has. God. You found mm-hmm. out. क्या भाई ये तो? He played Bishop B3 by the way, so we have we are actually going to switch up our analysis as Bishop B3 was played. Good move. But guys, what It's is happening? Amazing to... move. I will tell you why Kukesh played this move. All okay, the time, tell. Bishop C4 was a big trouble to the queen. 
that's why he's gone this move so let's say i was asking bishop g5 what the other move and that was bishop c4 or even if i go bishop e3 the move was bishop c4 and your queen is attacked let's say you move the queen again then rook d8 true if you go to queen c2 here then queen e5 now you don't have queen b5 which harshit wanted so bishop yeah. b3 was played and uh, Nice. nice. He's getting nice move. the more pieces that are exchanged, that more it will benefit White. I think Amruta. Yes. By the way, we have a help chess contribution by Anirudh Bhutani, twelve sixty ninth believer, and another one oh. is also Anirudh Bhutani. Oh, back to back. He wow, by Anirudh. And... Thank you so much, guys. Right. Help chess is our chess chess based India foundation, a charitable foundation where we support chess players. So please feel free to go to helpchess.org and support. And also, right now, Harshit Bai. finding let's this round play. to be very exciting yes very exciting and amruta let's switch up our uh, cameras let's look at how they are doing let's take a zoom view. on the viewers cam um how is how are they thinking because very important to also understand the psychology analysis so we will of course be uh, doing but let's take a look at how the players are feeling in real time ye mera favorite thing to do hai you know you Watch a blitz game. There are people talking about it, but you actually get to see how the players are thinking, how they are moving. Bhai, my name is Madhav Gado. So, Harshit Bhai. Yeah. Uh, there are people talking about it. Aisa bhi nahi bola. Sagar Bhai commented karte blitz games. People. Sagar Bhai to. Yeah, yar. Sagar Bhai to. No, I mean one. Uh, no, actually, Sagar Bhai also. I've seen many videos. Jhaan pe. uh there is an analysis board as well on the side of the video so one of my favorite you know scenes but uh, look at this now gukesh is thinking but he is rocking in his chair a no actually mm. he made his move so now he is moving his chair back and forth seems comfortable and boy are ali ne bola bishop ko ki bhai lati mar diya direct e4 lati mar Yeah. the bishop of it you know sagar so many times in the opening this move was such a killer blow suddenly with ideas like bishop f2 finally but there is no here. board change change to the board Achha, board sorry, sorry. <laughs> yeah okay actually a very good move guys because bishop takes a4 nahi mar sakte kyunki the rook on a8 suddenly becomes alive what you like but you can't play bishop f2 right I can go bishop c4. I can start with bishop c4, perhaps. Ah, sorry, bishop c. अरे वो bishop नहीं c4 पे जा सकता है. Oh, if Sagar was here, he is literally literally put uh, touched another bishop. दोनों साथ में दल दे, and he had to take bishop f8. So he picks up another bishop. Very critical round. Ah, uh, क्योंकि वो ये भी he made GM norm no in that tournament. तो वो वाला था. Ah. Uh -huh. Nice story. It's amazing story. So bishop c4 ko what uh, where is this queen going queen c2 yeah it's the problem because queen c2 gaya so there's also bishop d3 coming i mean all sorts of problems for uh, for uh, kukesh so oh. he cannot take on a4 b5 okay. bhi aa sakta hai so yeah and you know what yeah, now please. is the move maybe this is the move which needs to be asked to the chat black to play over here what will you play if you were listening to harshit's commentary carefully then you will definitely find the idea but if you are not to fir guys thoda dhyan se suno dhyan se neeraj mishra thank you for your super chat sam robert says movie ticket danny interview was cool sagar bhai will let him know australian dollars rohit kumar sagar want to work with cbi how should i proceed please drop a mail on chessbizindia@gmail.com mm Chess is the only game where the game moves at dash pace, at a slow pace, at a tortoise pace. Yet no one, including the players, don't know who is winning until it's too late. <laughs> yeah, I don't know your name. I can't read that, but thank you. Prasad Duhuri says Harshit, marriage counselor, couples therapist. <laughs> Harshit, 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 ko naya career is also there. Uh, but no, he's not helping us actually. He's adding the uh, fuel. No, like he's not. He's very diplomatic. In fact, ah, but it's very diplomatic. I am changing the subject where mutual agreement is existent. Judge Arshid, 
लॉयर बनो लॉयर वो आई डोंट नो क्या पढ़ाई कर रहे हो बट थिंक ऑफ इट नहीं जज का मैं भी अलग मे बी आई डोंट नो हाउ इज इट अ सेम वे टू गो थ्रू बट लेट मी क्विकली गो टू राज सेज सागर बाय व्हाट्स द नेक्स्ट मूव आफ्टर दैट जोक आई डोंट नो आई ही इज नॉट हियर बट लेट मी जस्ट गो हियर एंड चेक द आंसर्स ऑफ द पीपल बिशप बी एड वाह यूसुफ आदर्श परसिवियर बैड कर्म हर्ष कृष्ण यश शंतनु नीरज एंड चक्रधर दे फाउंड इट कितनी यू हैड सेड अबाउट दिस मूव सच अ लॉन्ग बैक टाइम एंड फाइनली इट्स हैपनिंग बिकॉज इफ जी थ्री देन द नेक्स्ट थिंग कम्स ई थ्री क्रशिंग बिशप ई थ्री रोक टेक्स ई थ्री बहुज खतरनाक अटैक ब्यूटिफुल so yeah. a4 on the board and gukesh is thinking yeah. uh, he has to make sure that he doesn't make a mistake mostly mm-hmm. is it a forcing computer says it's a forcing move now bishop e6 is forced, forced. yes no you won't nothing else so, excites you like a move if you go bishop c2 also no bishop c2 i mean you don't, you cannot allow bishop c4 because it almost traps your queen so correct so why the thinking That's because good. a4 was played at 36 minutes for ali reza and uh, how much time did gukesh ha huh, okay he it took yeah make he just made sure bishop takes c6 yeah, yeah. on the board rook, rook takes e6, c6 will be quickly paid sure. yeah and now bishop yeah, he... c4 ideas are gone this is happened on the board mm-hmm. so uh, new position yeah but i like i don't like this pawn which is clamping this structure in some way yeah maybe actually Prag should uh oh, sorry Gukesh should start exchanging some pieces and yeah Bishop E three played just as you said he's starting to exchange <laughs> he is in agreement with me at least there's one person <laughs> so, so I was Bishop... agreeing with you Harshit all the time are, are. thank you thank you <laughs> so Bishop E three you exchange this piece and now at least it kind of feels that you know White has at least no troubles of hmm. being worse but if this uh, knight reaches to D three uh can it be let's say i go knight d7 here oops um yes but uh, i mean let's say i have i mean i can just go rook d1 maybe get all my pieces in the game and i'm quite happy kuch problem hi nahi hai abhi um knight e5 i have knight d5 idea so be careful oh um Queen and then e4 problems. Yeah, e4 pawn. It's not a problem. So bishop e3, very nice practical move. Uh, he doesn't really want to, you know, get worse. And actually, uh, uh, look at this uh, Hikaru's game. Yeah. Now it's important to see what's happening there. D5 was played. Rook d8. We discussed bishop b3. C5, C5. played. What's his idea? B5 and... c4. Yeah. And my question is, can I go knight g6? Queen g6. If you go, I go rook e6. And um, if you take, then I'm quite happy because queen e6, d6, rook e d1, rook d1. Why I have a mm-hmm. huge pass pawn and e7, rook d8. White is winning. Oh yeah. So uh, rook e6, rook f6 probably needs to be played, but white is slightly happy there. I feel uh, rook f6, ah, rook yeah, e6, sorry. rook f. Mm. Yeah. And uh, white is probably happy here. Uh, don't play queen e two. By the way, actually you can go queen e two. Rook e six, rook f six, queen e two. Okay. Yeah, rook e rook f six, queen e two is probably a good way to continue. And uh, oh, the engine doesn't like it. But basically, white's position kind of seems good. Yeah, in general, with the pawn on d five. So knight g six, maybe black will take h g six. Actually, wow, you're going to consciously uh, double these pawns here. And yeah. I just thank you. I just have to be worried of one thing. If White goes Rook E three, oh, do not play F four. Don't ah, go oh, F four because. I should not show the arrows over here. Let's ask this move to the chat. Your White to play. White to play. Is it too simple, guys? Too soon. Yeah, of course. Of yeah, course, they found out D six. Sai Shruti persevered. Deepam, 
you guys have found out d6 this bishop possible to forget it's on the other side of the board but so c5 has been played which is interesting and we were looking at knight g6 ideas which could happen on the board you is it going too early to say it's going towards a draw yet or can we say that yeah it kind of is leading towards some sort of um, some sort of an equality but the game is still going so i don't i wouldn't say it's leading towards the draw uh -huh. but uh, actually a3 played amruta by firuja oh let's go there because gukesh also just came back from the bo from somewhere now he's drinking water yeah and if you quickly have the analysis board because this move a3 undermines the pawn on b2 and c3 okay so first of all if you simply take that's not good i mean it doesn't look good but generally go what what move <laughs> would you think of i mean ideally ideally i would like to go b3 c4 like ideally so if you but the problem b3, is b3 c3 pawn is uh, yeah you under have attack so like bishop takes a7 rook takes a7 rook c1 but back yeah rank but i'm still a pawn down yeah and back rank has no problems yeah so that's not working What's the move? Um, so that so if that's I I mean so I guess Bishop A seven Rook A seven and I actually, actually might need to. I don't even know how to continue. No, can you not? Can you not attack this guy here because A B two has Queen B two, which will defend ah, this. Yeah, maybe Knight G three. Yes. And now we can finally play. Oh, Knight G three. But yeah, I mean actually Amruta slightly unpleasant for White. Maybe Knight E three is a better move. But I why believe. is this a problem? Because. Um, knight on e3 g3 is not what? attacking ah, anything and e3 yeah, e deflection yeah knight so e3 knight... might be a better square okay knight e3 um, so it's more con like the knight basically guys always remember when the knight is in the center it con controls as many squares as octopus has legs if i'm not wrong on this one which is 8 um i don't know if i'm not right yes, or wrong yes. on that one but yes, yes, yes. yeah yeah so um If it's on G three, I think it only covers six. So it it's better to control as many squares as possible, which is why they say that the knight um, is much much more stronger in the center. Yeah. So knight E three also is a good blockader. So I like this move better, Harshit. Uh, and it could help. Maybe C four knight D five at some point. Only thing worries yeah. is that if this knight reaches the D three square um, with this pawn on E four. Uh, I'm not sure how dangerous it can get. So Gukesh will yeah. not allow that. Knight e3. What will Black play over here? Maybe Rook a5. Is the is there a way that Black can try to create an attack, or with such less pieces, it's not possible. Hmm. I think it's very hard, but it's possible actually because Rook g5, Knight h5, Knight f4. It looks practically scary, but our Knight on e3 at least is now doing a better job of controlling those. Uh, Uh, important points of G two. Um, um, and A three is still thinking. Yeah. Uh, is there any update? Uh, qu maybe quickly. Do you want to check of what yes. Vaishali is doing? Just uh, quickly. Uh, we never we have Vaishali yes. and Abhi's game. Vaishali right now. Because is... guys, hmm. even if the, even if Vaishali doesn't have uh, chances in terms of winning the tournament, she has won three back to back games in a row. And uh, we'll be looking forward to grab one more victory against one of the tournament leaders, almost Lee Tingji. And what a blow it would be for Lee to lose this uh, game. Yeah, and Lee is very hard, you know, tough nut to crack that way. If we have to put it. Yeah. So for should... sure, because uh, she is also being supported by one of our uh, channel, uh, like like you know, friendly. People, uh, Rajabov, you know, one of the very, very strong players, and uh, is hopped on the stream of Chess Base India many times. Um, so I, this would be definitely a game to survive for Li Tingji because if she survives today, she can has chances tomorrow. But if today she loses Amruta, it might be over in the women's candidates. Oh, yeah, Tan would be Tan would be the winner, no? Almost in that case. Yeah. This is very true. Yeah. If I must just quickly show you the standings for the women's section, here we have it. 
tan is on 8 she has drawn her games she is on 8 and half and if late ingji loses no but if late ingji loses tomorrow tan will most likely draw the game so that is who is she playing with she is uh, playing with anna playing okay anna. so, so then, not easy uh, game but, but it will be draw because anna has had a to tough tournament uh -huh. yeah, yeah. So Anna then, is not doing yeah, really so well. Yeah, so if late Inji loses, then yeah, you are very right. It's a clear cut uh, chance. Yeah. You know, Leia has always the uh, strike back. Many of the games she was losing. It's not so easy mm -hmm. to still beat her. Let's yeah. see. So if that's the update in the women's section that uh, Vaishali has very good chances. And I think Humpy has, I think, already drawn her game. Okay. Um, If I'm not mistaken, because they were seem to be repeating moves. So I think that game is already a draw. Um, not yet updated so coming either, back, but uh, most pro most likely it will be queen yeah, end game and yeah perpetual. most likely I think it's going to be a perpetual uh, quickly coming back to the men's uh, section Amruta where our eyes have been since the start um, actually uh, in the game of Prague Fabi everyone says that you know Fabi is completely winning completely winning but guys just think about it let's say black goes knight d4 Okay. Last I go one. queen d1. Hmm. Queen d1. You go h3. I go g3. You say that okay, I'm winning your exchange. Knight f3 check. King h1. Knight takes e1. But I take queen e1. And Amruta, hmm. how do you proceed with oh black? My. Oh my god, you don't have this break. You don't have the this. bishop on d6 <laughs> at some point would like to come to h6 maybe. But I always have knight h6 yes but i always have knight to f5 ideas and um, this actually might be practically completely uh, fine for uh, prague actually even an idea like queen e to f3 could be of consideration uh, and then if you take then queen takes and the plant the knight on f5 and say that i have a fortress i can't even believe Maybe. that the assessment it felt like you know when you were taking this it felt like it's lost but just the fact yeah, exactly. that it's not lost is a yeah. slightly shocking impact. <laughs> exactly, guys. This is not that winning for uh, for Karwana as you think. Even if they say that, uh, even if the engine says that uh, black is much better, still a lot of practical chances. And quickly jumping to Gukesh's game, we see he plays c4 in the live cam. Wow, you know, I was about to show you that the engine the is recommending move. the move c4. And explain to me, Harshad, yeah. that's what I was going to tell you. Amazing vision. This is what vision looks like. The a1 h8 diagonal. That's where I want my queen to be in. If a b2, queen b2, Amruta, suddenly the c3 pawn was such a big a weakness but uh, Gukesh is like you know what my c4 killed though if you want to take your b7 pawn is first of all weak so you, you have to be careful uh, and second of all the queen on b2 is going to be look looking at this uh, diagonal and sometimes bishop at 6 and g7 square can of course uh, happen yeah very good point actually the pawn on c4 now that it's not on c3 the queen I this dark square is which the g6 move was so happy about um, yeah. Yeah. Something's gone with the wrong with the camera. I don't know what. Yeah. But I'm sure it Maybe will come it will back. just refresh itself. Yeah. Um, Otherwise, I will also refresh it later. Uh, maybe I'll just have a thumbnail there for a moment. But this game can be very exciting, Amurta. Let's say black goes after c4, knight h5. c4, knight h5. After instead of AB2. Directly. Directly. So we and are now saying, Arshid, so basically you are saying that AB2 is not a problem. White is very happy. Queen AB2, B2, yeah. Queen B2, I'm you very... are very happy. Okay. So then mm -hmm. you say ki knight h5 is the next idea to consider. Maybe f5, f4. And try to push those pawns and say that I am going to go all in. Very much Ali Reza style. Very much. Definitely. Uh what Ali Reza is going to be thinking right now. So let's see what he go what he goes for because he can just go A B2 and simplify, which actually being in if I think might be a decent result for Gukesh because 
फ्रॉम द ओपनिंग वी वर ऑल डिस्कसिंग की डजेंट लुक वेरी प्लेजेंट फॉर वाइट डजेंट लुक वेरी प्लेजेंट सो मे बी एक्चुअली ड्रॉ कंसिडरिंग द पोजिशन ही हैड नॉट अ बैड रिजल्ट in terms of standings we never know what can happen in the other rounds but in terms of gukesh's position today i think amruta yeah, draw not draw the worst result. result for sure completely agree ali reza also looks like uh, he's not given up it doesn't feel like he's given up in the in the tournament is fighting this game with the black pieces i he managed to create amazing play but you know i'm really uh, really proud of her, the way gukesh handled all that pressure and also yeah. speed later he made some important right moves they were very slight you know back to back accuracies but it did put mm-hmm. ali reza in that uh, moment of finding the best moves again and again which he did could not do that and i actually have a feeling that nepo and hikaru are going to draw their games i think gukesh is going to draw their game i think 95 queen g5 we might ah, see yeah. this actually if you go there 95 queen g5 knight f3 ah, back Oh, they they did not, but they can repeat Amruta. And if this happens, Gukesh draws his game, which we are expecting. Uh, I mean, or hoping, because I think it's a decent result. And seems like Fabi is putting some pressure, but not clear yet. So we might see a three-way or four-way tie still tomorrow, going into the final round. Crazy man, that's so amazing. That's that's going to be how much tension are we going to carry? You know, it's like uh, kya ho raha hai? Pata nahi. So much uh, craziness there. But Pragnananda, I think today he does have some chance. No, we can't consider yeah, the, that he will be yeah, lost. Yeah, uphill task of defending this position. People think he is absolutely getting crushed, but I personally think he has practical chances to defend this game. Uh-huh. Um, on the other hand, Amruta Fabiano Caruana. I mean, we all know how dangerous he is. Um, in a, in so it is a very the best thing was if Gukesh could have beaten Ali Reza, but as you said that the position based on the position, it's just not possible. Yeah. Even now, uh, it would be if Y two is able to win, that is only through a miracle. It's not possible. Yeah, this yeah, position yeah. I mean, is not something like that. You know, if Gukesh should have won, and this all this scenario, these are all uh, should have, could have, would have kind of scenarios, right? Mm-hmm. Like we have to be practical as well. like firuja is a very strong player and also from the opening it seemed like firuja was in control so draw is a, a very solid result i think yes yes oof wow so going to with its game maybe we have some time because for c4 alireza is thinking he's down to 27 mm-hmm. minutes he has to make 15 moves gukesh has 37 mm-hmm. minutes and a good move has been played on the board we'll check qu- and, uh, with its yeah, yeah with its yeah, position yeah we didn't take a look yeah. we thought he is pressing a little bit with the white pieces um his clock situation not the best but uh, it's very easy to play with white but amruta i don't see a breakthrough because b5 kela to e5 pawn weak hai hmm. if you take on d6 i will take back with the queen most likely and uh, the f4 square becomes weak uh, um so we might just see uh, we might just see us another solid draw actually ah, uh, in the vidit you think so because i why do i keep feeling there is a score okay what if he is able to manage in some way which looks impractically very difficult right to go yeah, h4 for is like you know you are you are asking for trouble with a move like h4 because <laughs> even if you put your king on g3 and play h4 I'm going actually play it. Let's play King G two. He had by the way King on G two, no? At some point, okay, King H eight. Oh, Knight H five played by the way. We'll get there oh, very quickly. He played Knight H yeah, five. Yeah, we'll just get, yeah Knight H five played. We'll just quickly finish that line and come back to this game. King G two, King H eight, King G three. Let's say, mm-hmm. and if you go H four here, if you try uh, King G eight, if you try to go too crazy with H four, Amruta, suddenly I will quickly show this idea after H four. Bam! What's... Rook to f4. What is happening? Wow! Unshit you bang. can't take here. That is so. Unshit, cool. Welcome Bye. back, Sagar. Bye. <laughs> Guys, uh, with it, Rook. With it, Rook. Oh, so my hmm. prediction went fully wrong. 
Okay, so Vidit has drawn your position. Yeah, that's what actually uh, was showing that there is really no. I just that. interviewed Nija okay. right now, and we spoke about his tournament and how he felt and you know how tough it was for him, and he gave some very nice answers. That's wonderful. Nija, yeah. first time, yeah, you no, you had interviewed in the beginning also somewhere else at the start of the event, but now, yeah, yeah. and By actually, way, we are seeing. Repetition and the I did Hikaru finish his game by the way, uh, Sagar by because it seems no. like they're repeating night of Queen H5. Uh, yeah, can you can you just show like five, last few moves? Yeah, 85 Queen G5 and now Knight F3 back yeah, and then okay. Queen H5. And, and uh, I think that this game, if not has already finished, might finish very quickly. Or maybe Nepo decided to deviate here and play on because, um, you know, guys, what. What this could mean is that Nepo might think that he doesn't have that much to risk here and continue playing, maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's why to would try. Because, oh, we have a blunder alert on yeah, Vaishali, Vaishali board. Vaishali has lost her advantage. Oh. You know, Le Tingye is like really a big fighter. Huh? He, she never gives up. Exactly, that's what we were talking about because she has, uh, you know, made a comeback in the games, many, many losing yeah. games. So, it's both, both Tanjongi and Le Tingi, amazing. Okay. So, uh, Sagar, uh, this thing happened, Gukesh's game. I don't know, were you able to catch up after A4? No, A4, Bishop E6, Rook E6. Okay. Bishop E3, E3. Okay. And uh, yeah. Gukesh found a very nice move here, uh, mm -hmm. C4. And uh, Whoa, this was what nice. Kind of a move is Look this? at this. What Harishit mentioned is this diagonal over here. This one, the dark square is you can't take here. First, Harshid, why? This is Harshid, why? Mm -hmm. I call C4 as a Goki move. Definitely. It's a move, it's a move which normal players cannot play, I guess. No? Very tricky move because okay, just unfinished, but it's a very nice move. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, sorry. Please finish. So, so if a b2, queen b2, and if you start to take on c4, Haan, ye dekh le, that, that we must be this. big trouble. That yeah. must be big trouble. Yes. So, he played knight h5, knight h5 on the board, and now Gukesh is thinking. And actually, he even knight h Sagar, by we are kind of seeing a clash of two similar styles. <laughs> Both of the players are very dynamic and aggressive. White is like, I'm going C4, and uh, uh, Firuja is like, okay, if you go C4, I want to go F5. Okay, F5, uh, is the F5 4 is exciting, but also it is at the same time very weakening, right? So it's not an easy decision uh, to go F5. Oh, by the way, I, I'm pretty positive that Nepomniashi's game has finished. Sagar by it or it might finish. Yeah, 9 of 3. If he has repeated a second time. And then push the Yeah. So you will need to ask someone. Card reader in the game. Type C, right? Type C. Type C or USB? Anything is Connect my camera. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, Amrita. Any question? Coming back to chess, Harshit. <laughs> Coming back to chess, exactly, guys. Don't get distracted by the distractions. Uh, knight f3, queen h5, knight e5 seems to be, I think, Sagar by draw here. Seems but like... I don't see them. I don't see the they players must be analyzing. coming. That means uh, no, yeah. I think they, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. But so, guys, but today all... doesn't seem like the decisive day of this tournament, no, in any oh, way. But then, if it is tomorrow, Bap Re. No, no, no. Fabi hmm. might be deciding something in the Prague no, game. Fabi, Fabi winning, Harshit Bhai, Fabi winning is not at all making anything decisive. It's only adding the flame, I mean, what, ghee into the fire. Ruko, Ruko, <laughs> this is happening. Harshit, what you exactly, mentioned. Exactly. Because Sagar, yeah. look at this. Harshit had mentioned but, knight of three check. You win the exchange, hmm. let's say. But still, hmm. the, it's, it could be it's like... A, it's a fortress. It could be a because hour, yeah. because black going f five is too risky. Um, I mean it's not too risky, but like basically no, uh, Ashima, it's not a fortress. Why? Why I will tell you because you can go rook h five here. Yes, you, even and, if you go rook h five, okay. And e2. then with the idea of sorry, queen e two. Let's say queen e two, queen d seven. 
Yeah, so basically I'll allow you to go f5. Let's say bishop e3. Yes. Bishop d2. D2, let's F5, say. You go F5. Because, okay. Yeah. I can I can keep I can make many preparatory moves, but then eventually I'll play F5. Yeah. Five, let's say Amruta. I take. My point is that I take. You take with the rook. Uh, I take. Queen takes. And the thing is, I go, let's say King G1. Um my next move is Queen. Okay, rook f8, I go rook f1. I defend everything. Or rook e1, both are fine. Rook f1 I like. Next move. Yeah. Uh of mine will be bishop c3, then bishop b2. And if you leave the queen on f5, the g4 pawn is weak. Um, and the bishop yeah, on d6. This is equal. This is equal. So actually, I was mentioning that this position looks really good for black. I agree. But practically, it will be a very, uh, very difficult to actually beat the fortress of uh, Prague. Okay. Got it then. Like Prague. G3 Prague played, is... by the way. Prag is very tricky guy. Yeah, he never uh, lets anyone win easily. <laughs> of course, amazing. this is amazing. We'll come back here. But you know, it Amruta, would be great to find guys. Try to work out if there is a plan for black in such a position when you are an exchanger. I I can only say about this game that if Fabi is the best player in this tournament, this is mm -hmm. the moment where he has to prove it. Like True. this game, yeah. if he proves it, he has a chance in this event. Oh, all of this happened. Queen d7 played exactly what yes. we were saying. By the way, totally, totally. Kya baat? Kya baat kar okay, okay, what is this yes. position then, guys? Wake up! <laughs> Bye. Yeah, se lagta hai kabi kabi apu nis bhagwan. Got to watch his super chatted Sagar Bhai sharp today after evening training. Evening training. Concert okay. training. I don't know. I missed something. I don't know. I'll. You have to tell oh, me. Oh yes, 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 yes. Uh, guys, I am in Canada, so it's only been afternoon here. So I didn't understand evening and all. Hmm. Oh, but I have one question, Harshit Bhai. We need to. Yeah. Here. Mm -hmm. And if and my idea is, if you go rook h five, I'm just trying to be a little bit more sneaky, not wait and play f three. Very nice. Another idea, Harshit, that I mentioned. That f pawn can push be pushed here, and you can bring your rook here. And then mm -hmm. after g f queen f three, I feel now you can't get f five easily. And uh, b d two rook f one. I guess this is also fine. No, actually bishop d two rook f one, and you plant your knight on f five perhaps. Um, yes, and could be a defensive mechanism as well. Um, yes. So actually, some chances here. Let's quickly jump to Gukesh's yes. game, guys. G3 has been played. Kya baat hai yaar? You know Sagar? You know Sagar the way he's... What's that? Mithai? That's... Are, are. <laughs> I was given... I was given Vada Pauch today. Huh? By... Uh, uh, by someone at the meetup. Can which had six the... Vada Pauch. Oh, by the way, Hikaru and Nepo are here. So, I will just uh, <laughs> mute. Are you such a story? You don't have to say anything. स्टोरी बताता हूँ तो हर्षित जी थ्री इज द मू आई वॉन्टेड टू आस्क इवन दिस दैट दिस इज वॉट ए कंप्यूटर सजेस्ट बट थ्री स्क्वेर यू आर सो वीक प्लीज टेल मी हाउ इज दिस मू सो गुड um it prevents knight f4 uh, that's first and it it's kind of a preventive measure against the idea of f5 f4 and um i think what he wants next is like the ideal scenario for white would be what happened bishop what happened c5 bishop c5 okay Whoa. rook d1 i guess i would play rook d1 very quickly if i am harshit oh you are harshit and so you will play rook d1 but so why rook d1 yeah. so quickly just to develop and uh, a b2 queen b2 basically uh, there will be back, back rank like I, my rook will always be eyeing on the back rank problem i mean now. you wouldn't think give it a thought that you want the rook on a1 or you don't want it that way like to protect it too but i want it can also come to d5 for example i want to centralize my pieces okay um okay. so nice. this could be this would this seems to be quite logical rook a d1 nice rook a d1 and what else is possible what other moves would you think of um 
I would go rookie day one. I would. I would not spend a lot oh, of time on this move. This so he has thirty one uh, minutes and Ali Reza down to twenty two minutes. They have to make sixteen moves. Okay. Guys, quickly to update you of the results once again. Nepo versus uh, Hikaru. The big clash has ended in a draw, which means that uh, they both share the lead with. Wait, 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 wait. They both share the lead, but B three played. Oh my God! Not a good move. He was making all the best moves until now, but B three is a move which computer hates it. Long term advantage. I like rook it one a lot because the pawn on A three kind of uh like this fixed pawn structure. I thought the A two pawn will be maybe weak in the future, but um. But you know what will what is the you know way that Ali Reza can put pressure here? You have been mentioning it again and again. F five or what? Yes. Yeah, I mean it's quite a, quite a logical, quite logical move. So I don't think it's a very like you know hard move because that's whole the whole point of black with knight h five is to some times push. Yeah. Yeah. So did he did he play b three because he must be thinking that these bishops will get exchanged and eventually that gives him a chance to uh, create a weakness on a three. Is that yeah? Would that be the way that he's thinking? I mean, he's becoming more ambitious, right? If he would not play b three. In a way, the yeah, exchanges is more equalized. That way. Yeah, rook d one is a very natural looking move, which uh, is not very ambitious, but you know, it's just a developing move, which for me is very logical. Um, b three is definitely ambitious because it says that I want to make the pawn on a three weak and be able to you know use it as a weakness, but at the same time, it gives black some time and f five played Amruta. Oh, without even much thought. Actually, maybe we can just look at the big screen for a while. Yeah, slightly nerve-wracking for mm. uh for all the fans right now. Absolutely, man. Okay, and I'm making a prediction, bold prediction that Prague is not going to lose. <laughs> wow. Let's just. I think he will not lose this, but let's. That. That's my prediction for that game. But let's keep our eyes on this game. F five played Amruta, and this is actually this is actually what uh, intense pressure looks like. Amazing man, because uh, first one move earlier we thought okay this will be this will also at least a draw looks likely that game has ended yeah. in a draw with the effect of the other game also it feels like it will end in a draw, but then suddenly yeah. f five uh, is something that lots of work to do for Gukesh. F four is a direct threat. How would you firstly how do you deal with this threat? Mm -hmm. Not easy. Maybe bishop takes c5, queen takes c5, and rook d1. Somehow, still my idea to get the rook. So either you take take and go rook d1. Now with the idea of this, or directly rook d1. Still uh, yeah. f4. Let's say rook d5. Okay. Can I go queen f queen somewhere on? I can't go g5 mm. anyway. Yeah, with the rook on d5. Don't know where mm. the queen should be, but yeah, maybe here because. Let's say rookie d1. Can I go? Hmm. Rook d7 is your threat. Ah, but e3 ah, is e3 dangerous. E3 is always yeah. something. A diamond. Wow. Diamond. Because rook d7, then your idea of queen g5 may be perhaps. But again, this um, rook d5. Ah, you have a check in between. So yeah, if I go enter. this rook here. No, you don't have that. I do now. E f2, queen f2. Okay. Ah, now f g3, rook g5. That just equal. Okay. Oh no, FG3 Queen F7 oh. check upper se. Oh. Oh god. Queen F7 and mate. Check mate. Wait, look at Gukesh. Look at just zoom in that in his video. Look at how he's focused and thinking. Look at that angle. He's totally focused. Um he knows that he has to be very accurate in the next few moves before the timing control is reached Amruta so that His position, you know, doesn't get in big trouble. He knows the other game is a draw, so now you know he just needs to uh, also, you know, be solid and not. Hey, is he going? Uh, ah, look. Also, look at that. 
Nakamura is yeah. just watching the game. So their game just mm-hmm. got over. So both of them looked, I think, at that point, uh, ki what's the result? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's, but he doesn't Big know moment. what the result is. But Big he's really moment. curious. Yeah. He's curious because... I, I... Hmm. Gukesh might be thinking ki yaar, R ya par, maybe. But R ya par last round, na, light, because right now it's a little bit... Last round you are black, na, Amruta. It's not so easy. So he's majorly looking at not even going into tie break, actually. Yeah. That is what I mean, making him so ambitious. He's thinking is that if I, if I draw today, tomorrow I am playing with... Um, Tomorrow I'm playing with Hikaru with black, so not an easy game. And if on the other hand, Fabi wins today and he wins tomorrow, he wins clear championship. Mm. But this one can so, make him over push, Harshit. Yeah, he has to be careful. I think honestly, Amruta somehow just, you know, trade, 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 draw is fine, chalega. Curl, wapas, we will fight because it's important to be in the race and not, you know, fall behind by half a point when uh, the other players will be able to take over in the last round. Mm. Yeah. Also, Adhireza's expression, if you see, it's still like, he is in, like, it, it's not like he's very thrilled or excited. He's just yeah, playing yeah, and he's, yeah, having a different vibe on his face. Yeah, it's it's still pretty, pretty balanced, Amruta. Even if uh, the engine might give a small preference. Are our Pura everything of our analysis is surrounded by the engine, guys. Just think about the player. They have no idea what the engine says, nor do they even care that much. They just want to make the best move in the position. And uh, Amruta, I think uh, still Bishop C5, Queen C5, Rook D1 or Rook D1 immediately. I think I think Gukesh still thinks that this position is you know around equal and has three results uh, on the table. So if one if we go Bishop C five is what engine recommends, Rook A D one is also mm-hmm. one of the moves which is possible. Uh, he uh-huh. doesn't recommend F four as the next move. He says you can prepare mm-hmm. because one of the idea is also Bishop B four, and if Black says no, I don't want to exchange it. Oh, what? Wait, yeah, wait, he, so took he took on C five and Rook A D one. I think that was more human mm. because it's also a good thing. No, he doesn't have to worry about Bishop B four and no exchange again. Mm-hmm. So queen c5. Maybe he plays rook d1 now. Because you know, I think what he's thinking, Harshit, or if you look at the king, this king is also very weak with the seventh rank and with the queen coming on this diagonal. Maybe it's a if white thing. ever comes to if white queen ever comes to c4 and on that diagonal Amruta, it will it can be quite dangerous. Yes, absolutely. Actually, I'm liking uh, Gukesh's decision because uh, he it means that he is not fearful. Gukesh, he, of course, Amrut, he never fears anyone. <laughs> he is the fighter. Is he and, still not knowing uh, the result of Nakamura? Like, is it because he played? No, 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 he does. He knows, yeah. No, he knows all the game. Yeah, yeah. The result, the games have already finished, and the players know what has happened. Could do you think any different? Uh, like when he played B three, if he had known the position over there, it could be any other decision. It it's a question to ask him later, maybe. Yeah, I personally don't think so. I think Gukesh is someone who is uh, very much focused on his own game right now. Mm. But actually, Amruta, it is slightly unpleasant. Yeah, he doesn't. I mean. I'm trying to judge his facial expressions. Very he does hard, seem no? focused, but no idea. It's like a poker face. <laughs> also, not just poker because some of sometimes it feels like it's very confident. It feels like very confident with some tension. Mm-hmm. Confidence with mm-hmm. that tension. So he's trying to be intensely calm, but maybe. My God, what pressure! That seventeen years of age. This is the amount of pressure you're taking on yourself, and that's guys. Still, it's a we, good think ki, we think we think that today, our tenth exam is our first exam, and I'm very worried and stuff. Yar, idhar dekho kya ho hai. This is called real pressure, Amrutha. My God, seventeen years of age is like what eleventh standard, right? 11th standard, yeah. And Rook yeah. even played, by the way. Amaruta. Yeah, and 11th, we all maximum time pass, karte, I believe. 
Parishad, <laughs> exactly. Did you attend a college when you were in eleventh? Uh, not that much, for sure. Okay, that's what I wanted to confirm. <laughs> yeah, Nepo Hikaru, the result is updated here on the bars. It's a draw, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Queen Rookie D1, as you said, happening on the board. Quickly taking a look at Pragnananda's game because Bish, what they played a few yeah. moves. King H1 takes mm -hmm. Queen E1. Take, take. King has been taken on eight here. Mm -hmm. But I you are, I I like that bishop on d2 and rook on f1 and those ideas. But maybe anyway mm -hmm. it's a fortress because this bishop has to keep def defending this. So you think about it, guys. Ki, uh, black has a rook uh, for white's one bishop, one knight. So just thinking that white has three pawns and black has five pawns, the engine evaluation should have been plus two for black. But it seems as if engine is only giving 0 0.7, 0 0.8 for black, which means that white has a lot of compensation. Um, if you try to understand uh, the evaluation right now for the people like, you know, who don't understand what fortress and stuff means, that's basically maybe a good way to think about it. Right, Amruta? Yes, totally. Yeah. No, this one, this fortress is one of the most unusual kind of <laughs> fortresses I've seen. And you got this idea such a, like, way before it happened. I could not believe it, you know, yeah. at that point of time. As I said, it was quite shocking uh, to mm -hmm. be exchanged down and this, no plan for black. Like, plan in here. 18 minutes. This is clutch time, Amruta. This is clutch time. The, we have come down to the rapid portion of a classical game. Um... Firuja is still thinking and Rook A8 plays. Very logical. Goes Rook, oh, Rook, Rook F8, F8 played, sorry. Rook F8. Okay, so now okay. you have Rook D5 as the most natural move to go for. And uh, what else is the possible? Rook D5 is okay, let's possible. Let's play Rook D5. Another move. Yeah, let's Compu one. No, computer has another Queen move, E3. which is nice. Queen E3. Uh, Queen, not E3. Because then he is happy with Queen E7. Oh, okay. For, because F4 mm -hmm. comes with somehow the tempos. Mm -hmm. So Queen mm -hmm. D2. Oh, idea Queen D5. Very interesting. So Queen, because you have been saying to exchange Queens. And uh, this one, if it goes into an endgame, then we don't know whether the A3 pawn is a hero or zero. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, I still think that uh, Black is at this point not really worried about, uh, you know, the end game because he thinks that I'm he's going to be able to launch an attack on the king's side. Um, so let's try to analyze. Rook d5, queen c7. Okay. Uh, or queen e7 queen you want. Seven. Okay. Can I go... What's the move here? We looked at the idea of rook d1. Is c5 ever a move or it's too slow? Probably too slow. Uh, c5. Okay. Too slow. Yeah, because I wanted queen c4 mm. and rook d6. With you, you know, there is also E3 in the air. You have to keep... I was trying F4. F4 and... Not computer. I was computer thinking... is best move if you want. Then it is knight F6. Because uh, you win the pawn. Uh, mm -hmm. You are winning the pawn, no? Or... Yes. Actually, Amruta, I am slightly worried. Yeah, I mean, I am started to become slightly worried actually about Gukesh's position. Uh, no, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yes, he will have to figure out things, but he has more time. So, Queen E7, yeah. you want to go F4. Okay, I want to double on the D5. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's decide. I will look at the engine from one of the side, either white or black. You try with one mm -hmm. side without engine. Okay. Which, which side would, with... you say, would you say you want to try? I wanted to try with white to actually to see how he was trying to defend this. Okay. You want to go F4 and E3. Um... How can I defend? Queen D2 is seems like a natural move. Um, and if F4. And then I thought Rook D7. Queen, if Queen G5. Queen D5 was my idea? Yes. And now you get the Queen exchange which you have been wanting. But for takes, what are you going to take with? The C pawn. <laughs> CD. And then uh, maybe I want to uh, bring my rook with e1 to c1 in the future. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. 
no this looks good so uh, let's go back and let let black try something else queen d2 you played f4 okay i want to still try with f4 rook d7 now queen f6 suppose still queen oh queen d5 now run okay g4 now i have to go g4 and now a move like e3 and then queen oh something rook d5 played amruta not the best move now no okay rook we are analyzing this only this only we are analyzing okay, we yeah okay analyzing this only yes queen e7 queen e7 played instantly 30th queen d2 yeah now he has to be accurate amruta yaar yeah yeah he has to be and they both yes, have same accurate. time guys guys white needs to be accurate i mean i in the rugs game at least it's easy to play with easy to play with uh, white but in this game you need to be accurate kyunki agar f4 aur e3 aa gaya na amruta to it can be dangerous yaar yeah and ali reza's style ali reza is making moves pretty fast right now because generally he is uh, taking in minutes e and okay what is why he is going to play something what is the rook d7 what no what did he play f4, f4. What? what he played this oh. move because you know oh my was suggested goodness. it and i was like no way that gukesh is going to play f4 no way i didn't even you know mention it because it looks so scary cross. it's so scary how does he think of such a move first of all we are not even talking whether it's a good move or a bad move and all of that it just like the bar is still in creativity <laughs> the roof what is this move what's happening uh, for i can't take this guys in the chat i should have asked if n if n person yeah but I, I, chat is too strong yaar amruta you need to ask difficult questions <laughs> the n person is confused ho jate the na kahan se kaun sa pawn ha thoda but kaise bahut hi then i am underestimating them that's true so you can't take the pawn first thing you stopped at 4 but uh, mm -hmm. anything else what else can black black wants to break the structure so black let's say goes with what comes to your mind actually because we have to see for ali reza if he will be able to think of that amruta f4 is a move that i know you wanted to play f4 but gukesh is like no i will play f4 and now i am not that worried about you know the expansion but actually g5 at some point maybe knight f6 g5 aisa kuch aa sakta hai ke knight can you g5 right now you think no, ah, no, ye mar raha hai ye mar raha hai okay okay <laughs> so <laughs> blunder uh so then i think of queen f7 but these are all the weak uh, moves which white would really knight, like i find queen f7 is logical maybe rook e d1 now oh knight f6 back yeah knight f6 played played play. okay yes 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 making yes, strong yes. moves ali reza actually making very strong moves here yeah i mean amruta this is his type of position and after rook d4 there is queen c5 coming by the way yeah it's an important decision where you will take this rook harshit because you will yeah. you cannot take it to a wrong square can i go to b rook he goes to d2 perfect exactly. very good move because if as you mentioned if rook d4 then queen c5 irritating pin yeah and irritating. queen e3 then black has a Some nice disco nahi shanti wale ha just wanting to continue but instead of g5 harshit h5 oh wow wow Going nice to, idea yeah so nice idea so rook d4 was one option which he rejected which was fair mm -hmm. but rook d1 was very natural right which he could have gone for yeah he did yeah. not go for no, this no rook d2 very nice and now he wants to go knight e3 and knight d5 amruta trade those knights trade all the pieces shake hands and fight tomorrow again but because... tell me something <laughs> if h5 was so strong in other cases now if h5 is still played You are saying you want it to go knight e three. It is a good move. Yeah, it is. It's a good move, move though. H four, maybe I have g four or what in this in this situation? Can I yes. be aggressive? Oh, bap re, but it looks so dangerous with the pawn here. I don't know. What if f g four? H g four, and now if the knight move, there's knight d five, there's f five. Amruta, this is getting too intense. Yes. What a position we have for the penultimate round of. <laughs> the feeding candidates <laughs> i can't actually today's uh, title electrifying penultimate round seems so apt <laughs> because i did think that gukesh's game if at all it could have gone simple and slow 
would have been a different story yeah. but this one can go either way like literally either way we have to appreciate this about gukesh yeah, uh, harshit in a way uh, sorry we have to appreciate sorry? this about uh, gukesh that he's like what kind of a man he is having no fear and such a he is he behaves like a man only 17 years oh, of yeah. age uh, <laughs> thanks the, for reminding the, uh, the pressure that he is handling right now and the situation that he has put himself in <laughs> to also be in a position where you have a shot at winning the candidates at an age of 17 amruta is unheard of insane like this is completely what let's we are actually i want to we are so analyze fortunate. it let's analyze that because this is not going to be enough we can keep it. like this is that one game you can analyze let's for look five at the hours players. i want to quickly take a look at the players cam i love this view because we they have almost 10 minutes each guys so we are kind of reaching that stage where they will need to make moves every minute totally i am putting this camera and one you know in a moment i'm coming back harshit yeah for sure amruta guys kya hi position hai look at the players both are so intensely focused um we see the flags the indian flag that gukesh is representing and making proud and the french flag that ali reza is playing for also wanting to you know end the tournament on a strong note gukesh quickly had a glance at uh, firuja there you know this psychological things ki how is my opponent looking that's the difference guys in over the board chess you can actually see what your opponent is looking like if he's feeling pressured uh what's his body language that's why uh, gukesh prefers playing over the board chess uh, much more than online chess i actually actually i'm quite curious if firuja will go for something aggressive here like h6 g5 or bolega ki theek hai yaar draw with black against gukesh who's you know in a great form right now very interesting guys but no matter what the result is guys gukesh op yaar kya hi matlab situation mein laya hai the way he is you know representing himself the country everything has just been uh, spectacular very deep thought that they they are both in oh i see you i see you <laughs> you are back i'm back harshit hope it was fine you were left alone over here you handle the chat i it's so i think it's so tense that i'm going to the washroom again and again so I like gukesh tension aa raha hai ye bahut hi intense position hai now ready to analyze harshit bolo what which variation do we start with we don't know where to start and end amruta <laughs> and the possibilities on the board but i think h5 h4 might be something that alisa is considering but i think it's a too slow i okay. think H- your your it feels yeah. because h5 is still thoda computer age because as you said oh, huh. you would love to go h6 g5 in the g5. future yeah so the mm-hmm. move which computer suggests is one of the idea is e3 okay and why is this move such a strong move like what happens for knight e3 is the knight question three knight four kya and then the g3 and d2 are uh, double attack yeah knight e4 is a possibility there is a stronger move here E3 just takes rook. I mean, you can even go rook E8 and put more pressure, yeah. I guess. And then rook E3 uh, is the almost the only move, no? Because if you go king F2 blunder, guys, yeah, yeah, that's 94 check. Guys, so, 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Amruta, he still not made a move. How many moves are left? Please remind us how many. 10 minutes. Then 10 moves. Then it's a. Then eight moves. 10 minutes for eight moves. So almost, you know, one minute, twenty, twenty-five seconds only for every move. No, no, no. no. That uh, Ali Reza has. So if this happens, if Ali Reza gives a pawn, Rook D3, who yeah. has? Ah, oh, Black has not made a move. Woo! Yeah, Black. Gukesh is well. Gukesh's no, time no, no. is down to ten minutes. No, so oh no. Tension me He... Okay. Pra- Firuja is thinking, and Amruta actually, you know, the last time Gukesh was having a great position against Firuja, but in time pressure, he made a mistake. 
but if there is a reversal of what if happened the last time that would be insane anything can happen when the clocks are less than 5 minutes we have already talked about that quite a lot uh, amruta 9 minutes is not a lot of time even to create an attack so like if he wants to calculate this sacrificial ideas then he needs to know what is he getting in return so rook d3 and then it's like a block no uh, harshit like you've given a pawn now what next yeah e3 is a very i mean if he plays e3 that's a very crazy move i mean you're sacrificing a pawn and just playing for compensation based on the pin on the e file and the weak g3 pawn mm. um also actually amruta the ideas in knight and game where black goes like knight e4 knight c3 knight a2 you know those ideas kind of start creeping in your mind uh, when there are, oh, it's only knight and game hmm this one important point but because a3 nine minute okay firuja is about to make a move he goes chief what does he go g5 g5 premature ye kya hai oh knight and he played quickly knight e3 wow gook is so <laughs> alert he expected it he plays the best move he's made the best amruta, move amruta amruta let's 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 take a deep breath because we might see some crazy action and very quickly another move. What's going on, man? G F four. G F four. Okay, he'll quickly take G F four. Don't know. King is like, "Aja, tu samne, aja, dekhta hu tere ko." But, boy, बहुत दूर है तू सामने तो हूँ पर बहुत दूर. Oh my God. Nice. This is a. Uh, this is getting very intense. I don't know how they're. Playing so fast, Amrutam. But, but you know, Harshit, it's a good news because we have a knight as a blockader. I was somehow not very comfortable with this pawn sacrifice, and this f4 is isolated. But this knight is finally having this f5 guy up to g5. The biggest point is that he has eight minutes here for seven moves or six moves basically, hmm. and the position remains to be so critical that every move has a quite high price. and guys now uh, firu is again in the tank which is good news if you are you know rooting for gukesh if you are rooting for firuja it's slightly concerning because time we have always samay samay idhar bhi miss kar rahe hai aur firuja bhi samay ko miss kar raha hai because he doesn't have a lot of samay <laughs> oh my god Yes. Are we back? Yes. One second. One second. I had some important thing to do. One one moment. Very sorry. Yes. Okay. Done. We are back. Done. Done. Let's stick here, Amruta, because if let's not you know let's not get ahead of ourselves, but. Starting to get a little unclear for Firuja and guys, when you are not, you know, having the best tournament like Firuja, it becomes harder to trust yourself in critical situations, Amruta. Because mm. sometimes, you know, like Gukesh, when everything is working in your way, you are just confident. You know, like you know, I, I am good. I am, you know, in critical situations. I will find the best move, no problem. But Firuja will be like, I have to double check my calculation. Maybe if I am missing something. Very important thing you said. Actually, this is true, right? It's very real that a full tournament, a fourteen yeah. round tournament, you've not played in, you've not been in your best shape. At the end of it, you will have some trust issues. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, without making any sagar jokes on the trust issue, <laughs> coming back to chess, <laughs> Amruta. Now, mm. King H two, Rook G one, maybe something like this could be White's idea to you know grab that open file. um and then maybe you know put pressure on the f5 pawn gukesh is so calm just okay. look at gukesh he is like I, you know but... you know harshit i am completely like more fan than what a fan i was of gukesh because to get into something like this he is ambitious he's kept his chances alive like anything so the result could go either way okay and we are not even going to say anything about even if it whatever happens that way but just this Guys, risk taking is... ability and... let's keep our fingers cross let's you know give the good energy and vibes to piruja as he makes queen f7 
um and it's it's Now, getting king slightly as better. you said king h2. simple move king h2. zyada sochna hi nahi hai because yes. white's move as moves are clear king h2 rook yeah, g1 yeah. what is the move queen f7 going for is he going to h5 and saying that okay queen, he, maybe he wants to exchange queen yeah, yes so maybe but, if queen h5 no then that's but a, this end game no No, it's still unpleasant for Black Amruta because the f5 pawn is quite weak. Take, take, yeah, rook f2. Yeah, you're exactly rook g5. Oh yes, yes, directly. yes. Directly. Yes. Okay, look at Gukesh. He's super focused, guys. Huge, huge moment in the match. In my opinion, one of the most, I think, if not the most, like one of the most critical moves that, uh, few moves that Gukesh will play in this tournament, actually. One of This the is... most critical moves which Gukesh will play. Great, great point. Actually, great point. Yeah. Yeah. Could be game changer. Thirty fifth move could be game changer. Not thirty fifth because here King H two, right? You mentioned after that, I so... guess. Yeah, King H two, and now if uh, Piruja goes for this Queen H five, then it can be big trouble. Um, guys, let's all pray and you know give the good energy. if you don't believe in good energy then i think you should think again because you have been with us for the last two weeks and we have been witnessing gukesh perform extremely well so keep the energy flowing for all our champs and uh, you know these guys are there to perform amruta yes and as you said we like it's kind of we have forgotten that gukesh is this 17 years old the way he has played here such a maturity shown in his games it's insane yes 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 and okay. he's thinking amruta very important moment we are expecting the move king to h2 take your king away from you know the g file allow the rook to swing into g1 gukesh knows it he knows you know like okay okay now i see it now it's coming king to h2 rook to g1 it is coming slowly but surely and oh, he played king it. he played it Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Now Firuja is like, ah, oh, this guy Gukesh. Ye to mujhe, I mean, he's not letting me breathe. Ah, uh, he, you see, Firuja is a little unhappy there. Yes, King to H two played, and now it's not easy to make a move with Black because Queen H five, uh, leads into a worse end game. So for King, so Queen H five is something he will reject. King H eight looks yeah, natural yeah. for him. King H eight. Yes. King H8 looks natural. Hey, I think what we need to do is because if you want to play, play, oh wait, what is he playing? He played no. Queen H5. He played Queen H5. Yes, he, no, oh, he no, Knight, knight H5. H5. He played Knight H5. Ah, Knight H5. It seems so like a good move. Yes, it's a good move. He's attacked the F4 pawn and asked how. Piruja, Amruta, let's not, guys. Even if you know most of us like like here are rooting for the Indian players, Piruja, guys, he is one of the best speed chess players. So. like you know let's not forget that he is an incredible incredible player uh carlson called him one of the most talented juniors at some point amruta and uh let's not forget that uh, gukesh is up against a big big player crazy i am tensed but this time is something also a big advantage with gukesh only thing is he should make sure that the time gap is maintained five moves to make yeah. If What the to do now? Should... Let's let's. Yeah. Rook right G now, queen. Is this how are you supporting this? Queen F two. Queen F two is my in instinct because king H eight. Uh, king H eight. Yeah, and I wanted to go knight D five. Am I am I on the right track? Knight D five. You will have to be a little careful about. Maybe rook G one. Yeah. Why to remove that knight? Why to remove that yeah, knight? Yeah. Rook G one. Yeah. Rook G one is rook possible. Rook G one is possible. Definitely possible. Good move. I think quite logical. Even if the engine doesn't, what is the no, engine rook, liking? Engine is liking rook d five, attacking f five. Ah, put more and, pressure and on that pawn. And then you, pawn because of. you don't know whether you want to take this rook to g one or d one. That's what is. It's, okay, it's what's the time situation? Fourteen minutes. Uh, Gukesh still having, you know, enough time to spend on this move. So very smart of him to, you know, spend his time wisely. It might seem tempting to play fast and put uh, Firuja under more pressure, but guys. You have a time advantage for a reason, so that you can utilize it in critical moments like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's going to need that time uh -huh. for sure. 
आई मीन इट्स लाइक माइंड में ऐसे चल रहा है कि यू वॉन्ट टू प्ले फास्ट बट स्टिल यू डोंट हैव द लाइक यू स्टिल कन्फ्यूज राइट वॉट टू डू बट अदरवाइज यू लव दैट अली रेजा should be put under thought maybe he will also try to find such moves which will put some decision making pressure on ali reza even if they are not the super best moves oh how many moves are left five 35 moves are, oh. five moves are have been done five moves are left Please? five moves are left gukesh is like let me you know take a quick sip of water calm things down i know it's a critical position but guys let's relax <laughs> Let's relax. I am will going. Just need to find the best move, and for that I need to be relaxed. Totally yes. Chat um, me to pura. We have six thousand people, six thousand three hundred people watching at almost four a.m. That's the support for Gukesh, and I believe like everywhere else. So there would be like many, many, many thousands. So uh, it's amazing that four o'clock India jag rahi hai. Gukesh is making India stay up. <laughs> jago Bharat, jago because we have. the fiery gukesh having huge chances in this tournament played exemplifyingly strong chess until this point amruta but let's 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 wait let's focus on these three moves because uh, this is the most critical part of the game amruta when you have less time and five moves to make exemplifying i love harshit's vocabulary or <laughs> Oops! Not chat chess moves. I was just going to this one because when it's Gukesh's oh, move, like his expression so intense, it's it's oh, fun. It's fun to see. Look at eyes. Look at the eyes. How they are moving from one point to another. The way, the speed at which the pieces are going from one square to another, and his calculations. Amruta, just see at those eyes. Just think how quickly he's calculating as we are analyzing the moves and. we have none another than sagar bhai you can't hear this sagar bhai you have joined please un- you are muted sagar Hello, bhai yes. sagar bhai you have joined us at the most critical bhai. juncture of game just don't tell mukesh ka result even if it is over because we wanted to be suspense no 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 it's not over movie. not over not Are over guys you? not over huh. not over yes hikaru we just finished an interview with hikaru and he was like you know i don't know what will happen to gukesh's game it is a three result game like we spoke about these things and right now let's look at it guys this let's is look at it. looking very oh. exciting a f4 very pawn is hanging ali reza has a f4 pawn yes queen f2 i think might be something we watch but sagar bhai the biggest thing for firuja to be concerned about is his clock he has less than a minute about a minute to make for his last five moves no, and no, no, yes. four minutes the to position- win Four minutes. Four minutes, but in Amrutha, five five moves to make. Yes, so less than a minute, minute per move. Ah, yeah. That way yes. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, got it. Yeah, and uh, he still has to be quite accurate. Firu, Gukesh has some time. That's good. But Sagar, by this few moves are going to you know basically decide Gukesh's chances in PDA candidates. If he wins today, that is a huge result. No, that Even would with that the would draw, be massive. That would be so massive, massive, massive if he manages massive, to win. But if but he if he draws, then I guess still very good chances. Be... Still, yeah, yeah, still very good chances. But uh, let's see, let's see what he does. I think Queen F two is definitely what we are expecting. Is he considering some crazy move, Amruta? What is he considering? And Queen meanwhile, two, guys, Rukjeevan are the top moves. Yes, Sagar, tell me. I was just saying, like while he's thinking whether to play Rook F1, Queen F2, Pragnananda is actually holding uh, mostly Karuana, which yes. means that yes. uh, Karuana will be half point down in the tournament. Ah, at least yes, actually, F- yes, yes, yes. We that that hey, guys, will be quite guys, a big. I had a question. Can we go ninety five here? But just wait, jumping in. He was saying something, na no, Sagar. Harishit was saying something. Ah, sorry, 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 sorry. Ashish, uh, uh, no, please uh, continue. No, night. No, no, no. So, yeah, we can just say ninety-five. Basically, something we were thinking about. But Sagar by the night on e three, such an amazing blockader of the e pawn and also controlling the important g two square. We kind of want that knight to be on e three so that the rook on f eight is tied down. Rook to g one, rook g five is something that you know we are hoping white is able to achieve to put more pressure on the f five pawn. And less than ten minutes now for Gukesh as well, Sagar Bai. So this is the yeah. most critical point of the game. What, what is Gukesh thinking about? Like Queen F two. Let's say we defend, and then the Queen yeah. moves. I yeah, played it. He played Queen F two. 
played it queen f2 okay great move and great now move. queen c7 no 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 queen c7 is knight d5 right so queen cannot come queen to c7 is knight d5 because knight jumps yeah tempo. so what will what will tempo is very maybe king h8 king h8 or rook g6 maybe getting the rook in yeah like just on the g5 just on the g5 Knight h5, rook g6, rook d5, queen f2 has been played. Amruta, <laughs> this is the live board. If you just put, uh, what, what? if you keep your eye on, no, queen f2 is the live position. Yes. Queen if you f2. take one, yeah, this is the live position. Firuja is thinking less than three minutes on his clock, guys. Four moves to make. Four moves to make. I think, I think this is going to decide everything right here, right now. Four moves to make. If he is not able to find the best moves, Gukesh is going to pounce on that opportunity and after the time control, put more pressure on him. So Firuja has to, has to find the best moves. Yeah. But isn't true, it true. difficult and with, with no, for three Firuja minutes. to find the best moves, uh, to be honest over here? Because his move, one move is natural, which is king go to h8. One move is natural where you bring the rook to g5. But you know, Amrita, even for this natural move, he's thinking so much. And this is the fifth move. He has five moves to make because 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Five moves in less than three minutes, which means which means he has to give like 40 seconds per move. And this can mean that on the 38th move comes a tough decision which Gukesh can give him. And then that can be a big trouble. Yes, yes, yes. Amrita, two minutes now. Sagar by 2 minutes oh, and 30 oh seconds. He's not realizing that he has to make a move. So, Amruta, maybe we can zoom in on his cam very quickly. He played Rook, he played rook, rook G6. G6. Played. So, Rook G6 on the board, guys. Is a good move. And will Gukesh go Rook D5? Ask a decision. How will you defend mm. this? I like that move. Yes. I like actually Rook D5. Right move. Gukesh looks so focused, guys. He's like Queen C7, by the way. Rook d5 what? Queen? Rook d5, queen c7. c7, can I go now? Now that you don't have knight d5. Ah, that, but there is a good move for white. Uh, rook Maybe d5 rook and knight d5. No. Rook what, what? d5 is a very powerful move. Yes. And now mm -hmm. knight d5, knight e7 is a threat. So something no, like this could be a nice trap. Firstly, yes. rook d1 yes, is yes, a threat. Yes. This rook will come yep. in. This is defended. So yeah. Amrita, do Gukesh, you think can put... Uh, this wall. Look at Gukesh's stare to Ali Reza. Yeah. Rook D5. He's so playing. Rook D5. Rook D5. Decision okay, to okay, Ali okay. Reza. Decision. Yes. See, the only and, and the best move here is to go Knight G7. Because if you... Passive. Mm -hmm. That's very passive. Yeah, very difficult to find. Try, but what else? What else will you do? If you try to support with Rook F6... You want Rook G5. Allah bol. No, you, no, you can no. already see. G5 guys, guys, guys. Move. You can already Stop see... Very tense. Don't worry, we have the live board here uh, on the this thing. But I think this is Gukesh is okay. Let's not yeah. talk about the results. Can we zoom in actually? Two minutes, one and a half minute. Let's zoom yeah, in on this. Let's, let's zoom in. Let's zoom Whoa. in and let's let's have the big board also there. Amruta, so, ah, yeah, there's a board. Can we make the board what a little bigger, Amruta? A little bigger. Okay. Thoda, the angles oh, keep analysis changing. Board. That's why. Haan, thoda it's bada, thoda. Bas, bas, bas. Okay, okay. Oh, oh he, he finds that G7. Kya wow. baat hai, bhai. It was forced. Yeah. yeah. But he has one minute. And he's about to make a move quickly. Gukesh, quickly. 38th move. Three moves More pressure on Piruja. Gukesh, Gukesh is actually putting a lot of pressure. He Lost, understands yes. that time is actually very important. And he's played it. Ali Reza down to what? One minute, 10 seconds? Yeah, he'll manage. One minute, 15 seconds now. And the clock is ticking. Oh my goodness. What a game this has been and he has so to, far. Amruta, he has to make three more moves or four? Yes, three. Three, but right? will three moves are manageable here. because. Oh the moves my are... god. But what is the move? Rook T7. He's not happening. played yet. Actually, what he's is the move? Guys. Wait, 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 wait. Let's. What is he peak what pressure. Is he peak pressure. Rook. rook at six. He played. So he plays he the plays best rook on at six. He plays is it the best, the best yes, move. It's, it's a good best move. move. I mean, there are Queen many good moves. Actually, oh, there are many good moves. No, very okay. strong move now. Actually, very powerful. Because if move we go, uh, Arshid Bhai, if we go Rubli yes. seven, there is Queen H five, right? Yes. yes, yes, yes. That's his. That because black H three is hanging. Yep. And if Queen G three, uh, Rook G six. Rook G6. Okay, Amruta, can you go back, on this, can you go back to the live board? The live live board. position. Live board. Let's stay here. Very powerful move. Rook to D6 to exchange Black's most active rook. Wow. 
this would be sure. and bye, 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 bye. this will put pressure and oh, now you want to sure. now yes now look at the position look passive the best Correct. piece in white black scan the rook if you take that bye, rook bye, out bye, of कुछ is intense kit the intense two moves to make two moves to make so this is move 39 40 38 move the 38. next move will be 39th move no but um, so 38 right so make. teen moves hai na teen moves no no 39 and 40 bhai abhi white ka move hai ha this this is 39 two moves remains are only two moves and he has one move two more moves to make And what Rukesh is Rukesh's time? What Rukesh, is Rukesh has six and half, about seven minutes. So he does have quite some time to make, and he's making sure that he finds some tricky idea, Sagar Bhai. Because if he is able to find some trick which forces Firuja to spend his time on it, it is possible that Firuja errs. And in after the time control, Gukesh is basically wanting a stable advantage. Because after the time control, if Gukesh has a stable advantage, guys. he is going to grind it down somehow we have seen him but this is the most important decision rook d6 yeah. is the move is that would give is, is, uh, i mean it's a it's a good move it's the best move here rook d6 also Can another Bukesh move is suppose it. you go try to go queen like a computer says let's say queen g2 because you also have yeah. later these ideas queen g2 sure. queen goes to h5 uh, with the mm. similar idea of rook g6 yeah this you don't like so much in comparison so i think he will finish by knight g4 was not possible because queen takes g4 queen h4 guys how about uh, knight g4 ah queen takes one. g4 yes yes okay but coming yes coming back what quickly did he, play? What he played he played with rook g1 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 rook g1 okay yeah this looked a very natural king move to pin the knight and now he wants to win the f5 pawn yeah f5. king h8 has to be played right king h8 no, queen h5 can be played what He plays queen. Oh, queen rook g six. Oh my god! He is, it, it doesn't look like a mistake, right? Why? No, it's not a mistake. It doesn't look bad at all. Yeah, yeah, it's a no, good move. No, he's, he's defending well. He's defending well. Now he has forty seconds, but the point is, if he goes back rook d one, he will go rook at six again. So this kind of, yeah, I don't know if Piruja has and to make Rukesh, another. Rukesh has one move. I think. Look, he's already ready. Is he nervous? He's, just, he's nervous. No, he's, he's putting. No, his, no, no. He's just. He's just getting ready. Oh, he's come back repeat. and now rook at six. Ah, they repeat, guys. Is just, this okay. going to end in a draw? I mean, I don't. Or is it just so to reach, reach move forty? Just reach move forty, I think. Yeah, just to reach yeah. move forty because now he has to go rook at six. Yeah, he repeats. Yeah, rook okay. Six. Move forty. So either way, oh. we have a draw for oh, reach. Board. Yeah, true. Really But Gukesh went quickly. So I think he went to the washroom. Yeah, like <laughs> both of them. Yeah, he's like, "Are you under so so pressure?" Me, I came back. Yeah, both of them were under so much pressure, and now, <laughs> guys, we are all seven thousand people here under. So okay, much Amrita, then I will also go to the washroom and. Yes, yeah, yeah, I mean, I went two, three times in between today. I even announced it. <laughs> By the way, today I have Harshil here, who has come. Harshil, Har, sorry, Harshil here. Harshil, why? Oh, Harshil is here. Hello. Harshil has come all the way from Boston here to cheer for our wow. players and is helping me. Uh, so Asim was there. Asim is busy today. So Harshil came here. It's been amazing to have so much support. And Harshil just now went and shot uh, Humpy. Humpy and before that. Humpy and Hikaru. He was, you know, taking the moments of them going outside. So. Really nice. Beautiful, wonderful. That is so cool. Really? Yeah, oh, uh, Harsh uh, Harsh Harshil has got a very nice family photo of Hikaru, Atusha, and Sunil Viramantri, the stepfather of Hikaru. Oh, wow. They are all downstairs. So, uh, yeah, amazing, Harshil boy. What a thing! Amazing. So today, Asim is not going to be there, yeah? Asim, Asim, Asim basically uh, told me that he has to make sure that uh, you know for tomorrow he is in good spirits and he had some pending work, so he is just finishing that. 
So but tomorrow he was final day. Will... So he's, he's yes, yes. No, I'm sure he's listening. It. There, Asim, know? bhai, if you are listening to it, please shut it down and spend time with important people in your life. <laughs> <laughs> by the, the live board uh, by the way guys the live board needs to be updated amruta on the right side seems okay. like uh, it's still on the position uh, of night h5 wow harshil bhai harshit bhai uh, mm-hmm. as always coming yeah. back to chess in a very yeah. nice way guys yeah. i asked you know i asked hikaru how does he feel about this draw right now and what if tomorrow gukesh he plays they all draw and they go into the tie breaks and you know what hikaru said he said i'm happy with all the players who are likely to make it to the tie breaks because the guy whom i think is very strong is not going to make it to the tie breaks guess who was he talking about fabiano no but he can be fabiano can ah. be there then he so will talk about gukesh only because yes, he will not consider prague. him as... okay. no prague he said no. prague, prague is the prague. guy who he thinks is the strongest in rapid Wow. So, so he was very happy. He was like the remaining three players I can handle, you know. Like so he didn't say in those words, but it felt that way, you know. So I'll... yeah. <laughs> oh, nice, nice information mm-hmm. there, Sagar. Yeah, yes. no. It's and... actually building up. This tournament is getting Mahal very there? exciting. Like right now, how is everything? Is it tense over there? Is it like, kaisa hai udhar? Everyone, Everyone is tensed. Everyone is tensed. Ah, today they can buy. Outside, by the way, outside, how many people are there? Is 50. At least 50 people outside, guys. Can, yeah, to, can I go can down? In, can I go down and? Uh, dollars yes. They, they can buy yes, they can. They, will... they can, but they want to meet the players and all going out. Can I show what is the mahal outside? Let me totally. just uh, try and yeah. Let but me try and do that. But you won't miss. You won't miss the like if Gukesh repeats here, then that is fine. No, no, no. no that's fine. He, that's he's fine. He'll that's be fine. playing. He'll yeah. be playing. And let me let me show you the mahal. Yes. While you're yeah. on the way, we will be able to talk to you, right? No, no, no. Ah, we won't. I'll be... try. I'll try. Okay, but one second, Sagar. We. No, no. I will need. Amruta, I'll just take a quick break. I will come for back. For sure, for sure. Sagar. No, because I then I can uh, uh, do also with the yeah. earphones yeah. and all. Yeah. Sagar, oh. Sagar. Can you hear me, Sagar? Can you see me, Sagar? Ah, yeah. Amruta, what are you saying? No, before you go very quickly, Rishabh Tripathi yeah. super chat. Sagar Bhai, go to the washroom and lock Ali Reza. <laughs> oh my God, that is so funny. Uh, what have you done, Sagar? Because इधर से उधर कुछ किया है क्या तुमने? Have you lo- uh, logged in from another device? Yes. Ha, then I yes, I will. I will no, shut no, down this know. one. Wait, wait, wait. It won't. Yeah, now I'm fine. Shut down किया? ठीक है वर्टिकल है बट यू कैन कीप इट मे बी हॉरिजोंटल इफ यू आर एबल टू हाँ हाँ बराबर था कन्फ्यूजन गाइज द कन्फ्यूजन वॉज करेक्ट वेटिंग फॉर हिम टू कम मेक अ कम बैक नॉट मेक अ कम बैक टू कम बैक चल रीड योर सुपर चैट्स I'm yeah your camera is on so you can sorry can you say again can you yeah amru can you see the i can see the i can see everything sagar while you are walking do can i read some super chats yeah yes, yes sure so we have canal opinio the whom some yeah i mean it's a long name but he says hello friends from india i'm talking about brazil rooting for guki say hello to my brother derunier from barranquilla colombia he loves you how the games are going amazingly well nemo how are you oh hi 
why why are you not to be seen for so many days here yeah. <laughs> that's true yeah. and i'm enjoying okay, i think friday street i've been watching the candidates from home and like covering them like on their live it's honestly it's so exciting the games have been a little crazy yes and like, who are you rooting for okay so you know i got a new cat mm. my cat i let my cat choose between nepo and hikaru and my cat has predictions on nepo and tanjong to win the candidates but what about guke she didn't have that one no but, uh, but, but, okay okay before before anybody here at axi okay i let my chat vote on the top so i picked five people obviously guke she's on there is like hikaru nepo um gukesh bobby and probably i think on the top five and then the top two winners were hikaru and nepo oh. didn't vote for guke so you can play my chat for that one okay i will i will take it up with them yeah, exactly. i will see you soon there thank you and guys we are going outside now amruta you can make this the full screen if you don't mind yes, i will but uh, so i'll read the super chats later then okay yes please read it later because i'm going out and yeah, we are going to meet go. the fans here yeah. guys we are all on live stream Hello. yes wow Hi. Guys, who are you all waiting for? Waiting for you, man. Okay, <laughs> wonderful. So we have so many people here who are here waiting for Gukesh's game to end. And by the way, it's uh, it will last longer because they just reached fortieth move or maybe fifteen minutes ago they reached. And uh, did you guys meet anyone? Ah, uh, you meet Hikaru. Yeah. a uh, vidit also yeah. wow how was it so many people there yeah and and what is this you have here uh, i have some fan cards i want to get signed like get them signed i have uh, koneru here oh wow and also you have your signature ah you have signs of all the players and then amazing some uh, pictures uh, you got all the photos with it yeah Wow! Wow! At the last second, he was running. Oh, that's amazing! That's picture with Hikaru. You can see this. A lot of pictures of Hampi as well. Beautiful. With Ian, Nepo. Okay, your trip has already successful. Yeah. Yeah. This is brilliant. I was waiting for Amruta. Ah, you're waiting for Amruta. Here she is. Hi. Is she here? Hello. Let me uh, let me turn this around so that you can also. I have Amruta in the frame. <laughs> One second. Sarshit still on That's, the screen. Sarshit is also there. Amruta. Oh. All right. Hi. From Hi. Hi. You have also Harshit here. Hi. Hold on here. Hello. All right. Wow. This is such an atmosphere. One more Sagar. time. It is so cool. Photo. Wow. Okay. That's wonderful. Thank you, sir. Harshit. Thank you. Harshit, bhai. There are a lot of people here, guys. Oh, do you oh. know which GM? Uh, which number of India GM? Are, are, are. <laughs> <laughs> everyone knows Harshit Bhai. You are a big star here. We are waiting oh, for you to everyone. come here. Also, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, hello, hi, Maria. Hi. How are you? Wow. How are you enjoying? We are live, by the way. Yeah, I I know it's always live. <laughs> <laughs> I am enjoying. It's it's, it's wonderful to come and of course seeing Tesh yeah. uh, in the lead is amazing. <laughs> Yes, yeah, let's hope what we'll see what happens, and maybe I'll go to thank you, Maria. I'll go to the fan zone. Uh, ah, yeah. so I will go. This so we have so, so cool. many people. So 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 many people so we go so we walk around the curb here and then we enter the fan zone from here from guys are you able to listen to everything or not yes everything is being uh, huh? uh, could you ask someone to problem ho jaye amruta can you all listen to what was being spoken yes 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 are yes. badhiya bhai Ah, guys, just remember that from here, you all go into the fan zone down here. But if you go straight on from the fan zone, then you go to the shop where, if you buy stuff, then you can enter the fan zone. Look at the fan zone. This is the shop. 
and look at the fan zone here. Voice, थोड़ा break हो रहा है. Maybe the is इधर internet नहीं है शायद से. But I would really. हाँ यहाँ पे internet नहीं रहेगा. आ रहा है. Yeah, now it's fine. Now it's fine. Wow. Yeah. Look at the fan zone. So many people here. And there is. I'll go down. But just to show you the shop. Ah, by you, the way, here there are lot of chess sets. Oh. Lot of chess oh. sets with signs. Like for example, you have chess set with Vishy Anand sign here. Wow. What is the price of that? Is it also an auction? It is three hundred and fifty dollars, which is around twenty five thousand. And here, yeah. here you have again another chess set with Vishy sign. There is chess board. Uh, you have you are ah, yes, sure. But and have, but the most you have to buy only found, from there. Yeah, Amruta, like you have to be there. Amruta, oh. the most interesting thing I found are these player cards because you can buy them, hmm. and I think they're for like one point two dollars, and you can actually can get signs ah. from the players. So beautiful concept there. Hello. I'll come. Yeah, and this is by by the way a small uh, little exhibition here of the candidates. Every candidate. Me, kya ho raha hai? Who one is given here? And then eventually we go downwards to the ground floor. And this is the fan zone entirely. Mm -hmm. So here you can see people playing chess. Following the games. This yeah, is amazing. Ah. Uh, and we have many, many top uh, players here. We have Eric Hansen here. Hello, Eric. How how are things going on? Good. Good. You you've been Brian in charge uh, for the fans for a few days. He's been doing good. And you are doing the commentary. No, I'm not doing. I've had some allergies this week. Ah, yes, I got. I've really bad allergies, so I didn't want to tell you, sir. But things, things how, so, how are you enjoying the candidates in your home city? I, I'm enjoying a lot. I mean, it helps. Tournament is exciting. I, I think that we can set a lot of fighting, fighting games. I still don't know who's going to win the tournament, so I think it's going to set set up future events in Canada. That this has been pretty pretty successful so far. They sold out every day. That means we need a bigger venue next time and another tournament. So it's a it's a good problem to have that more people wanted to come than there were tickets. So Beautiful. definitely looking forward to more events. I hope I can catch you and do an interview with you at some oh, point. Yes, at, at your place. But thank you. I'll just go around. We are on live right now. Yeah. So just showing this, guys. We have uh, the commentary here. That's happening, and we have Grandmaster Aryan Tari, who is the commentator here. Hello, Aryan. How was? How has been today's day? Do Do you think what will happen in Gukesh versus Ali Reza? Do you think it will end in a draw? I really like. I really like. Yeah, oh, you think? So you think Gukesh will press? I definitely will press. Harry is very strong. The potential and the exciting potential is fast. And you can hear us. We can't hear. Very interesting. And your commentary here is fantastic. Yeah, like uh, everyone. We can't hear us. Maybe. Thank you, Aryan. We'll catch you later. Yeah. And guys, here we have so many people. Who are just waiting with the big screen here, so they can follow the analysis here, which Aryan is showing. And overall, the atmosphere and vibe will be epic tomorrow uh, on Sunday. So please come in, please drop by to the fan zone. You can get some things from the shop, and then you can stand outside the main entrance. So all of this is a great, great thing. Amruta, yes. over to you. Amazing. I will come back later. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. Thanks a lot. Okay, time for me to do some zoom adjustment and ज़्यादा uh, time नहीं लगेगा. It's all going to be fine. So give me a moment, Harishit. Yeah. Yes, your time, Amruta. As Gukesh is also taking his time, is down to 19 minutes. He's thinking for about 11 minutes because he has to make a decision: draw करना है या keep on playing. Because he knows that the other game is a draw. So if he draws today, he will go in tomorrow's 
मैच विथ हैविंग हैविंग अप्रोक्सीमेटली द सेम चांसेस एज टुडे और ही कैन यू नो ट्राई टू प्ले एम्बिशियसली विथ अ मूव लाइक रुक डी सिक्स नॉट एन इजी डिसीजन टू मेक अमृता um because yeah, look, uh, uh, one second now i am just there going to the board rook d6 yes. so it's just 40 moves mm-hmm. are over and he has been thinking for last 12 minutes like all this while what yes. sagar was showing us showing us the other stuff gukesh has been thinking yeah. we have not mm-hmm. missed even a single move so uh, rook d6 yeah. yeah looks likely he will go for it अंकल, I mean, I think he is thinking whether कि यार draw तो है मेरे पास draw करूँ या let's still keep on pressuring because Amruta, uh, it's not as if he has a big advantage. The position is around equal. Yeah, and then there is there is. Uh, okay, what what do you think he should do? What is your opinion? I think Amruta risk है तो uh, candidates में chances है. Hey, 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 you said it. Huh? <laughs>
मुकेश का कैमरा दिखा दो अभी बस दोनों का दिखा दो कोई सुन नहीं रहा है बट फिर भी Yeah, I think that the game is shifting towards a draw. Yeah. Also, if you look at his face, you can see that intensity What? has. Wait, no draw. Queen H4. Hello, hello, hello. What? Guys, तुमको क्या लगा इतना दूर draw करने को आए क्या? He's heard you no. guys. He's heard you all. Wow. Queen H4. Queen H4. Four, no what draw. Vibe, what a vibe, Gukesh. मतलब you know I saw him and मुझे लगा कि हरिशित नहीं वो भी relax हो चुका है ना he's going to draw. It's a psychologically big big difference that hmm. this kind of things make. You know when Firuja played rook to g6, he thought that this game is going to a draw and his mindset was already कि ठीक है ये game तो खत्म हो गया है and then suddenly Gukesh is like queen h4. Bhai, I have not repeated yet. We still keep on playing. But then and... he could have. Uh, no, but what you are saying is that should have happened twice, right? Like when he played rook at six. Yeah, or... I think rook at six. Could he play it? No, he didn't. He didn't have a chance because yeah. rook. Yeah. Uh, rook at six was this was one position. Rook at six where rook g mm-hmm. one was played. Okay. So one time, then rook g six, rook g d one, rook at six, rook g yeah. one. Second time, and now for rook g six. If he would have yeah. gone uh, somewhere else, Correct. he didn't have. So right now he changed. Correct. Yes, you are right. Queen like psychologically, Queen big thing. Psychological mm-hmm. pressure right now on Firuja, and he suddenly he has to think again. Wow, it's it's more like that. You know, um, I have one of my favorite movies of my childhood was uh, this Thirty Six uh, Chamber of Shaolin. and uh, the like whenever you feel low like you look at the training that guy has done it is so amazing it is so beautiful yeah. and there one of the one of the dialogue is like this power speed and balance maintaining all three so as of now maybe maybe this is what gukesh is trying to do here and and amruta me as well as a commentator was thinking ki you know the game is khatam hone ke aage hai कल क्या होगा ये क्या होगा वो क्या हो गया कहा जाओ गुकेश इज लाइक रुको 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 गेम इज स्टिल ऑन आई विल फाइट अंटिल द किंग्स आर लेफ्ट ऑन द बोर्ड एंड आई लव दिस फाइटिंग स्पिरिट दैट गुकेश हैज यस नो दिस इज इनसेन द द गट्स लाइक दिस इज सच अ गट्सी डिसीजन सेकंड सेकंड एक सेकंड सेकंड आई नेवर इफ आई एम अगर भाई लेट यू बट वो सब यस I don't even think even he's going to hear it, but let's call him because. Okay, yeah, whatever. Uh, Sagar Bai is we, we in the back. We can't mute him now. Hello, you will have to yeah, mute he's yourself. Muted. Uh, because... He's muted. Yes, yes, yes. I can. He is muted. Yes. Ah, no problem. All good, Amruta. All good. All good. <laughs> I sorry guys sorry i thought i thought i was muted that's why i was talking but then i realized i was not but amruta can always mute me so i was surprised that she did not i can always like mute she... you even when you are not on zoom sagar <laughs> i know i know <laughs> especially when i'm not on zoom <laughs> but uh, amruta yeah. with uh, harshit bhai are you happy with gukesh's decision to continue the game always i mean the fighting spirit sagar bhai i mean, is i mean that's what he is you know very very good at he wants to play a very long game and he has so much energy that he is saying ki i can play 7 hours 8 hours no problem but do you have the energy to compete with uh, you know uh, the pressure i will pose you and you know more than uh, energy i was thinking you know these thoughts come right in our hi- head ki whether we will be able to win the game what if our candidates uh, ka final like world championship is gone away you know it goes away all of these thoughts yeah. make you sometimes paralyze you from actually fighting but yeah. not with gukesh right he is saying that uh, i'll fight it's okay that whatever happens he senses the opportunity because i i mean everyone who was mentioning that gukesh has the most chances before today's round including 
our favorite mr anish giri was that he has white pieces against firuja and why was everyone emphasizing on this is that uh white pieces first of all sagar bhai means a lot in a tournament like this kyunki players yes. are so accurate that they don't give you so many chances when you are playing with the black pieces so gukesh realizes that ki kal i am playing with hikaru who is going to put pressure on me so i better strike today hmm i agree i agree and also the thing is that uh, aryan tari whom we just interview i don't know if you could hear him well could you guys no, hear him no we were t- telling you that we can't hear him at all uh, that's why Oh, I'm sorry. Then what he said was that he thinks Gukesh's position is really good because of the knight on e3, and he thought the pawn on a3 is a weakness and the queen side majority. So he he was oh. feeling that Gukesh should continue. Wow, this is this is the what? most uh, you know a decision which has to be respected like hell. I would say just for the attitude of it. It's uh, yeah. यार ये बंदे के ऐसे पैर छूना है बस कुछ भी हो जाए नहीं नहीं पैर नहीं पैर नहीं छूएंगे पैर क्यों छूएंगे Played Rook G1, King G1 on the board. These two moves have happened. Um, still remains to be quite a complicated position. But I actually think White has a good position. No, his King is safe on F2, mm-hmm. and uh, the pawn on F5 is weak. And also, uh, guys, the thing is, bar may show it equal, but at some point it might drastically change because Ali Reza might not have that many. Uh, Sort of safe moves, so one mistake at any point could change the evaluation. So this uh, equal bar can be very misleading. Definitely, it's unclear. It's not at all equal. It's like bar is like, boy, मेरे को समझ में नहीं आ रहा है मुझसे मत पूछ लो. हाँ, क्योंकि as 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 was mentioned by several people, there are imbalances here. White has a queen side में extra pawn where he can push and create a passer. Black has a central extra pawn which is blocked by the white knight. So and, and F5 is, is a weakness. F5 is a big weakness there, and F4 is also weakness. But <laughs> this is the most so... dangerous pawn. Like if you, everything depends on oh. this pawn. If it is zero, oh, Gukesh came. Just joking, guys. Yeah, he is a good guy. Prank him. Exactly, yeah. man. Seriously. Amrutha, <laughs> how to mute? on the board and mm. prag had equalized if you see it, at least for the bar uh maybe it's still equal mm-hmm. but yeah um change the evaluation something change the evaluation not really maybe no it still remains to be very solid for black and uh, black basically needs to find a plan maybe somehow he wants to go king b7 king a6 and pawn to b5 Mm. That's black Very cool. Good. Black side. Guys, yeah. in such positions, we need a grandmaster, and we are glad that Harshit is here because engine will keep on showing this as slightly better for black. But we need plans, and I think Harshit yeah. has come up with one plan B five. Any other plans, Harshit? Bye. Actually, Amrutha King A seven is more precise because King B seven. I know it's four a.m. in the night, guys, but don't forget. Uh, let's ask. Let's that- ask. Let's ask the chat. King B seven. Mm. What's the yeah. move? One second. Black to play. Suppose I make a random move. Uh, sorry. Oh, and red thing alert on the Gukesh game. Does that mean black? Oh, we going there? Oh, 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 let's go. Let's go. Let's go. King G one. King H eight. Slightly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not chha. like a as much as right now. We have stream shuru hua. To matlab internet hi gaya tha. Stupid it. Ho gaya? Gaya? ठीक है रुक नहीं वो चल रहा है 
Yo guys, there was a big, big, big lag. Very sorry for that. Uh, the internet just went away. But it's back right now. I'm just getting everything in a moment there. So, thanks for being here. Uh, Harshit, are you there? I am always here. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Because I think everything is going on. I'm just getting it uh, in a moment. Sagar is also here. Guys, as 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 long as at and at the same time that amruta is doing that if you look at the live position guys huge improvement for gukesh guys huge improvement he has an advantage of plus 1 right now and guys as soon as we are back we are going to explain that it's going to be a huge massive result if he manages to win and uh, everyone uh, was Queen yes, h6 is the winning move, right? What is the point? Why is it the best? Not the winning, but the best move. What is the what is the reason? Queen h6 prevents black from playing queen to g6. Because now after queen h6, black goes queen g6, Amruta. White will simply trade and go into that endgame. And as uh, we were discussing about the b3, c4 majority, even rook d7 or rook d6, both moves. Uh, basically giving white a big advantage so what happened in oh. when we when it got lagged amruta G1? amruta can we can we get gukesh's video oh yeah of course of course <laughs> i forgot that we have it actually yes yes we need to see him we need to see him one second one he is second. going to be definitely you know be i mean if it was hikaru he would show some expressions with gukesh it's very hard to understand because he always has a very stable uh, emotional emotion on his face. Mm -hmm. uh, he seems very focused, but I think he's sensitive. Oh, I really loved this, Amruta. This scene which you had kept, like full screen video. Isn't there any with yes, full yes, screen? Yeah, Malab, koi, koi border nahi, koi border nahi. Sirf uska chehra. Kuch logo nahi. Eleven, and, eleven and a half minutes left. So he is kind of hmm. getting down on the time situation, but his position has drastically improved after the time control and. We saw this happen to Firuja against Hikaru, where after the time control, he was unable to resist the pressure. Can Gukesh do the same and strike? He's playing, he's, he's playing, looking he's playing, at the queen. queen. It queen is coming. Aage. Aage, aage. Do two, two steps. Two steps ahead of Gukesh. One, let's, go. Two, let's go. Let's go. What is he doing? He's playing, he's playing. Let's go, let's go. Good angle, good angle. Queen at six. Gukesh, come on. Come on, please. Queen at six. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. No, Queen G5. What is queen that? Queen G5. Queen G5. Oh, oh my god, white has black has a very strong idea now. Sagarba. Oh Black wait, let me think. Idea. Let me think. Let me think. Bhai, itna fast nahi chance missed hai. actually, matlab, because this was a pretty important one, right? Okay, Bhoti if you play Queen G6, Queen G6, there is no way. That, that's the same uh, transposition. So Ali Reza has to play something different. Did he play? No, no. no. not but agar bhai, huge opportunity for... Because, uh, look, guys, go. guys. Uh, if he moves the knight on G7, the F5 pawn will fall, right? Okay. So that is the reason why he cannot move the knight. No, that or is can he? Be, be alert. Be alert. Arshid, why? Very what is the move? I can't some find it. Maybe, I'm not even sure, but like some knight e6 and queen f5. Queen f5. G7, Queen E6, Queen B2 check. Oh, he exchanged, he exchanged the queens. Kukish must get no. the advantage, right? Queen E6. Yes, once again the same chance because he missed it because Knight E6 was tactically very oh my important God, that was too hard, no, but it was too tough. Queen F5, yeah. Queen G7. Oh, that was the point. Kupats, Queen Knight in G6, very normal move, but now. This gives G6, if you take the knight, if you take the knight, yeah, once again, if you take the knight, queen G1, check. queen B2, or queen, yes, ah, queen, queen B2, King two? To say. King, King oh, queen B, H2, and checkmate, Sagar by checkmate, queen H2, rook G1, bye, 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 crazy, but as a nahi hua, luckily, 
he has played queen g6 for the and now suddenly sagar bhai you g takes he takes he takes he takes guys man let's go man why firo guki op guki op now do guki absolute monster guki monster yes because because now as we said a3 b7 both pawns are weak yeah. and white's queen side majority is much stronger than black's pawns right also the king helps yes. here whereas this king is much useless than this king matlab ye jo raja hai na raja jo commentary kar raha hai wo badhiya hai but but firuja will of course realize right that he is now in big trouble yeah i'm surprised he made that decision so quickly sagar bhai because if you yeah. look at the position it looks like black is in severe trouble rook d6 as amruta was mentioning and then knight from e3 can now jump to d5 as well amruta rook Achha. d6 now yeah uh, bhai harshit bhai rook d6 is it necessary i was just wondering if can we play rook a5 to take the a3 pawn is that bad because that looks I... the most human way Rook a5, Sagar ah, bhai looks, whoa. but you want to not take your rook to pass. Rook on a3 is very passive. In these positions, hmm. very important, very important to have activity and centralization. Achha, Material. Hai, aap, is, if you, bhai Harshit bhai, if you play rook d6 and I play king h7, defending that pawn, yes. fir to aapko Here you will have to move to the side, right? Knight h5, knight e6, where you are, your pawn is getting attacked. Yes. Iske ah, liye it's a little bit next. difficult because if you go here, the knight jumping here with Uh, I don't know if you take on a3. G5 now, will come. G5. Huh? No, you will have to be very G5. accurate, very tough to play this exact sequence. Mm. Where you will get it. You have to ah, king g7, king h6. ये वाला idea. So what's up? Rook d6. Rook d6. Let's go. Okay. King h. Let's go. Will he get some knight h5? No, knight h5. Knight h5. Knight h5. Knight takes f5 is a possibility. By the way, boys. भाई 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 क्या खेल रहा है क्या खेल रहा है भाई there's a problem here knight f4 maybe hmm knight f5 knight f4 two lane main ठीक है not knight f5 but you but the knight better, better something but better still white has to be accurate actually we cannot be knight g2 so happy knight g2 it's like no 95 95 only move 95 Knight D5. Knight D5, Amruta. Knight D5. Very okay. It's very easy, okay. no? Very you supporting this. Fine. Very easy. Very But G5. Uh, G5. G5. I want to blubber. get it rolling. G5. Hello, yar. Oh, rook at six. Hi, kya kar raha hai? Sorry, guys. And Knight uh, D5's threat, Amruta, is Knight to E7. Ah, you're attacking double attack. Okay. Double attack is coming, guys. <laughs> Gukesh has managed to get something out of a position where we thought draw is a good result from him. Now Firoja mm. is thinking, "Yar, draw kar leta tha. Kaise to opening mein? So it would have been better." The pressure Gukesh is putting on his opponents with every move, like the every second I was talking about in an F1 race, is really paying off. And also, Gukesh is such a monster, right? Like, I mean, he's not getting stressed out by the tournament situation. He's just playing the position, guys. There's so much to learn from this young boy, just 17 years old. The way he conducts himself, the way he's fighting, just oh, too good. Oh, and by the way, guys, uh, it might be it might be a case that Prague has allowed this king a6 and pawn to b5 break, and it looks slightly unpleasant for Prague right now and. Can we see that game? Can we see that yeah. game? Amruta very good. Wanna just see? Why Amruta? This is scary. Karuana, छोड़ेगा नहीं. Karuana is doing this idea which you said. Harshit is on the board. B five is on the yeah. board. Yep. And B five means uh, Amruta. Can what is the live board? King Rook F one B five right? Ah. Mm. Uh, yep. And Prag is thinking. Yeah. Yes, because now if the black rook manages to invade on B two, then it's going to be. Uh, Quite unpleasant to defend with black. Yeah, also, the a a pass pawn, so not easy at all because bishop takes c five. Uh, white black not even will take the a four. Okay. He will take the c four pawn. Oh, this is also possible. a good one. Okay. Um, and d c four then invade rook b two. Wow, I so guess this... Prag thought that Garuana might not play this pawn break because the c five pawn was hanging, but actually. Mm. It's it is playable and it's a great move. So maybe Prague under big big problems, no? Yeah. And how, I'm not even he... joking, Sagar. 
Hmm. Everyone was asking me at the Saint Louis tournament, whom will I think is going to win? Whom will I think is going to win? I was like, Gukesh is going to win. It is scripted. हमको सब पता है, Gukesh is the champion. It's scripted तो नहीं है भाई. <laughs> I mean, I mean, <laughs> like, I mean, in terms of, I mean, scripted in the it's, way of. It's written, uh, my, उसके उसके नसीब में लिखा है. My, yes. Right. Right. It's, Sometimes you know, like everything is working. Like for example, in that movie Chuck the India, you just knew, like it, in like the way the things are going, it's like something, uh, like you know, something above human power is in Gukesh's mind right now. Yes, it feels that way. At least right now, his chances look great. But guys, even if he wins today, his work is not done because then he yeah. will have half a point lead, and then Hikaru yeah. Nakamura will come. All out at him with white pieces yeah. because for them for Hikaru draw won't work. He has to beat, which will yes. mean that tomorrow will be a massive game. But okay, step by step. First, let's finish this game. Yes. Amruta, what is your feeling? Do you think that there is a very high chance that Ukesh will win? Yeah, I've always said that Indian will win and then. Hey, yeah, yeah, finally, finally, second from. In the beginning, I have said, and now only Gukesh can win. So, usme koi doubt hi nahi hai. Gukesh. But it's insane. Full, I mean, full confidence. I mean, my my saying is, Sagar Bhai, he winning or not? Okay, we still will. Of course, last two days very exciting for us to watch, and we will follow. But even to be in this situation, yar Sagar Bhai, where he is like about to be the sole leader of the last round, guys, we are thinking, yes. aage yes. kya hoga? Ye kya hoga? Yes. In the present, this situation to have. A Plus one advantage going into the final round. Yes, insane, insane. I really, you know, I always pinch myself and I say to myself, "Wow, am I really witnessing history being yeah. made here right in front of my eyes?" Sagar, yeah. Meer, who Bagela says, Amrita always predicted. You can check clips. Me check can see. Hmm. Guys, check out the clips channel. Getting very active. In fact, so many videos have like viral views yeah, on the clips channels, and it's been uh, managed by Mihir, who is there in the chat. So thank you, Mihir. Great work. In fact, uh, mm-hmm. even Hans Neeman follows clips channel, no? <laughs> yes. Hans Neeman might be watching this. Hello, Hans. <laughs> no, he might be commentating somewhere. Oh, but. Oh. I the internet just went no. I got a little bit like, "What happened?" I didn't understand. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. Even Gukesh's position got equal after he before he got the advantage. So, thoda was upper niche. Hote rehta hai. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I have Prag. Like... If Prag loses this, then uh, it becomes even more. Uh, what to say? It, it will not, then if be. If Gukesh wins, it won't become complex anyway. No, no, no. It will be complex. Why? I will tell you. Why? Because if if Prag loses, Karuana and Nepo and Nakamura will have same points, which is eight, and Gukesh will move to eight and half. Correct. So tomorrow, Nakamura, Gukesh, Nepo, Karuana. Bo- now, 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 consider consider Gukesh wins against Nakamura. Game tournament over. Gukesh is the champion. Okay. Yeah. But if Nakamura draws Gukesh. And if any one of Nepo or Karuana win, then we have tie break between Gukesh and that player. So it's really like Karuana winning really opens up new things. Ah, uh, so tomorrow then Nepo versus Karuana will become do or die. Yeah. yeah. That will become do. Anyway, it's a it's a do and do or die for Karuana anyway. So tomorrow. Brilliant fighting chess on our cards, but I I do hope even if Gukesh wins or draws, it'll be something like tomorrow will be fun. But आज जीत सकते हैं। अरे guys, draw भी कुछ नहीं guys, ये जीतेगा ही यार। ऐसा कैसा draw है? We have to. Ali Reza is definitely looks under pressure, no? He looks under pressure. He's visibly shaking his head. Doesn't like his position anymore, Sagar Bhai and Gukesh. Have you noticed? Whenever he has a good position, he starts walking. Have you noticed it? Like he starts, yes. like you know. <laughs> so Gukesh. Right is... now we are not able to see Gukesh, but I think he might be. Walk... No, he's sitting. He's. Be uska hath dikha okay. udar. <laughs> Hand of God. Yeah. By the way, yesterday when I was trying to put a title to my vlog when Gukesh won, Ashit Bhai, I remembered your words, "Godly Gukesh," and then I put that title. <laughs> 
it is absolutely godly what we are witnessing uh, sagar bhai rook to d6 knight to d5 i mean it's not even about the moves it's just you know like you it's like the moves are flowing everything is flowing for uh, gukesh okay harshit bhai i'm going to play a devil's advocate here and i'm going to make you find good defensive moves for black like if you were black here what would you do what would you expect is the best chance you have here i would personally uh, not play g6 to g5 which looks tempting let's let's ask the chat because you know should we take fg5 should we let it be should we play king g3 can we ask the chat amrut after g5 yes, let's make the move or king g3 guys yes. that's the question what's the best fg3 no. or other move or if there No, 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 no. There's no other move, boy. Ashish, boy. Let's play G5, no, Amruta. No, if board pe aaya to ho gaya na. Whether FG5 okay, or King okay. G3 is the question to the chat. And while the chat is thinking, guys, it's a slightly tough question, not because very tough, very tough. Not. It's not easy to find because it's like a deep calculation. No, three. They have to see four, five moves deep. Yes. And in, by the way, one thing is clear. Like today, we really had this having Gukesh on screen was so amazing to see him to get a feeling of how he is feeling a little bit at least. His expressions, देखने को आली रेज़ा सब कुछ तो बहुत मज़ा आया guys. It's really really good and thanks big thanks to Fide. Do check yes. out their shop for sure. Yes, thank you. Yeah, the so big shout out to Fide that they have. Done this, and if you guys want to support, then just go to shop. dot fide. dot com and get yourself something that would be amazing. Yes. What's the move? Chat has suggested. Let's see how many for F takes. Uh... Oops, updating. Hi, me, Amrita. But in the but I think in the chat I will check I will check maybe lot of people have given the answer in the chat let me see. अरे यार अभी आ रहा है सागर just had to refresh. Yes, look at six guys. Well done, well done, well done. King G three वाले हैं लो King G three वाले थे हर्षित आरंब. अरे नमिता जी Namita Krishnan ji has sent a super chat of twenty dollars and says, "For all your efforts, Amruta Sagar and Harshit Gupti for the win." Hey, thank you, thank you, Namita. Thank you a lot. What a nice checkmate. Six is Shahmat. But we have Rook to E eight. What is Rook to E eight, boys? Rook to E eight. What happens to takes? Wow. Uh, firstly, you don't feel like taking, no, because it feels scary to give this. No, 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 no. Ninety five is there. Eight ninety five. Oh yeah, you always have ninety five. Rukesh is also shocked. Hey, I know what he wants to do. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, what? B five? Yeah. Ah, ninety five. Ah, I was thinking B five, but B five. Mari, they get na, yar. Shit, right? Oh, Rukji six, Rukji eight, ninety five, then B five. Ah, Rukji eight. Hello, hello. Rukji eight, ninety five, B five. But how does it matter, Ruk? Uh, let's say, Aki. What's a lot of questions. Firstly, can oh. I go king e3? Yeah, I have a tricky idea. Can I go knight yeah. e7? Will you give me a check on d2, Amrutha? <laughs> no, I would never <laughs> do that. <laughs> Good try. King e7. Yeah, king e7. King to e1 after rook to d2 check, Amrutha. I just to finish yeah. that variation. And if rook takes a2, I it seems like you won a pawn, but rook at six again. This concept of checkmate exists, and uh, nice uh, black country, black country. Knight on g seven is a big traitor. <laughs> um, so rook d six, rook eight. I think uh, he's calculating between rook g six and is there any other move? No, trade. Oh. So I think. Rook G six is going to be played. Rook G six will happen or ninety five. Sachin Ranade says Gukesh nerves also reminds us of Tendulkar in Pakistan at the age of sixteen. Cool. देखा था क्या match when Sachin was sixteen? Man, I think when Sachin was sixteen, I was minus sixteen. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, Rook G six played. Rook G six played. He took it. Okay, at this point, if uh, you know Nap, Nepo, Naka, they are uh, watching the game. Does it affect yeah. them like right now at this moment? 
चैंपियन बिकॉज ऑफ दिस दिस नॉट वन पॉइंट डिफरेंस राइट राइट Huh. But but in a huge but way, sure she was. Are you sure she won because it seems like the position was equal, Sagar Bai. I'm I'm also very surprised. She's smiling and interviews are happening and all of it. So let me just confirm once. But I yeah, I think it's a draw. I'm, I don't know. Yeah, how can you win? It's a draw thing. Okay, we'll come back to it. I'll give you information. But I think, I think it's a draw. But okay. Yeah, because Lady Tingi will not miss that position. I believe. टूर्नाटो 96 yes. what is the point of 96 can i not can i just not go knight d5 and defend yeah. everything that does seem like the no, oh i know arshad bhai maybe he wants to go e3 check e3 check king takes e3 knight f8 king e3 to gaya yeah hmm. yeah that's what i thought ha wapas dal do Yeah, knight takes e3. Nee, what is the move? Knight takes e3. Okay. Yes. Let me see if it is back if... over here. The camera. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe I just have to switch the scene sometimes. Okay. So knight d knight e3 go next knight f4. Knight f4 go rook at six check and uh, next move I take the pawn on f5. I am putta. King g7. Ah, with the check. So king g8. Now you will take on f5, but now rook e2 is there. No, you can't. Hmm. hmm. No, the rook e2, king f3, and now the knight is hanging, and the rook is hanging. So you so cannot do that. Start with king f3, attacking this. The knight will go here as it. it no, no, no. You can, you can take the pawn first as well, right? That knight takes f5 okay. because if rook e2, king f3. If rook e2, king f3, but what if knight d3 check? Just king f3. And now, if knight c one, you are not worried. I am worried, but I think there should be some way. Um, yeah, only there way. No, but Ali Reza has gone into tricky mode. Yeah, he's yes. basically banking on that eight a three pawn to create counterplay by giving up yeah. many pawns. That is his plan. Actually, if I actually take knight, what you want, yeah, instead of knight d five, knight two, knight takes f five is what our uh, bar was recommending. Yeah, correct. It was knight takes f four. It said rook to f6, and apparently white has a plus three advantage. Correct. But this was tough, Harshit, because now it's you have to find this move. Let's say it's not tactical, because the point is knight takes h3. There is some insane king g3 or something like that. I don't even know knight g3. Maybe king e3. Very hard to play king yeah, e3. Yeah. No, this is not human. But what what Gokesh played is human, very nice. human. Knight d5, yeah. and now Ali Reza is not making his move, right? He's still thinking. But no, e3 is for sure. Nine minutes. We are already down to six, seven minutes versus nine minutes. So if e3 check. But but remember, remember here there is an increment of thirty seconds. It's Correct. not just uh, straight finish. Correct. By the way, guys, we have uh, some amazing super chats. Dinesh Nambisan, thank you for your contribution. We have Manu Bachu Jagannath who says Sagar Amruta Harshit. Thank you so much for the wonderful commentary. If Gukesh wins today, can you please, 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 please,
मैग्नस कार्लसन हांस मीमन एंड अनिश गिरी टू स्ट्रीम अरे बाय बाय वी कैन ट्राई अनिश गिरी एंड हांस मीमन मैग्नस कार्लसन वी डोंट नो अमृता सेज Amazing coverage of the prestigious candidates tournament, guys. Great timing for me to follow in Vancouver. Good case for the win. You know, Amrita, we had uh, someone was interviewing Hikaru, and he said that if there is one city that resonates with my heart in Canada, it is Vancouver. So yeah. Wow. Okay, wow. let's get back to chess. So, so Arshid, by this time, I did your job. Yes. <laughs> I'm, and I'm, uh, you sorry you started with all the super chats okay how you have the access agar no 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 i just agar said, read which one every lock in the in the room <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay baad mein dekhenge guys let's first think about what ali reza might be thinking yeah. instead of e3 nee, is there e3 any the other move no 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 wo soch raha hai amrita is thinking so let's But think if there is the any other option thing. Suppose we finish this line na once, like knight okay. a three, knight f four. Now rook h six check is important because let's say if you don't give a check, natural. And you play rook b six, rook b six, rook b six or rook f six. Suppose rook b six, then knight h three check, and Ali Reza oh. will get some opportunity to draw. But rook h six check, king g seven is not possible. That is the reason rook h six check. We can reject this variation, and now we go back. What what else? I was thinking maybe we can quickly quickly zoom in on the players in this situation with them having yes. less than yes. ten. Yes. Great each. suggestion. And I, they are I, both. I, I, uh, Ali yes, Reza I is no. I just feel like so tense right now because yar hat mein hai game par nikal sakta hai. You know this is the tricky thing about chess. You are winning. And then it's the most difficult to win. Most difficult. Am Amrutha, if White just gets one more move, King e3, it's resign time for Black. One move mil gaya na King e3, zero counter play for Black. Game khatam. So Black has this only one chance now to play Knight d4 or e3 check. Only two moves. No, if another e3... suggestion is King at seven in the chat. So what if King yeah. at seven? Possible, but no? again Knight. Just yeah, Knight g1. And no, then Knight f6 check is, is coming. Mistake. Mistake, mistake. Now rook d8, and now b5 is happening. So if you will go rook d1 to stop b5, then the king comes in. Once this king activates, I think it is a good compensation. Wow. Okay, let's say I could not even six imagine. Six Less than six minutes left. Let's come back to the live position, Amruta. He's still thinking, and he has. Hi, Ali. Hi. Hmm. How much are you thinking? Amruta, can we get the clocks somehow here on the screen? And this, this, uh, yeah, yeah, you will keep on telling us the time. I will, I will just update, guys. Black has five minutes and thirty seconds remaining, and hmm. Gokesh has seven minutes remaining. But as Sagar mentioned, they have the thirty second increment after every move they make. So less of a stressful time situation than uh, the one before forty moves. Okay, got it, got it, guys. By the way, Yash Mittal ji, thank you so much for your super chat. Says I would like to take you and your team out for dinner in Toronto. You deserve the absolute world, boss. Thank you, Yash. If it is possible, we will try to make it happen after the event. For now, you know, everyone's just like, "Bye, Gokesh, acha ho jaye, bas aur." Jao abhi abhi, bas get ready. <laughs> Less than five minutes left, guys. Guki ko positive. Energy send karna. He is going to do something miraculous today. I feel it. Ali Reza pe kya pressure dal hai na for like like unbelievable. And Ali Reza is one of the most like tricky GMs out there. And look at Gukesh, guys, guys. If you are in your life lacking focus, just look at Gukesh's focus bus and get inspired. Too good. It's like a snake, mm -hmm. anaconda, Sagar Bhai. Slowly, slowly, yeah. slowly, nah. control of the position, and then you know Ali Reza is already feeling kind of pressured. He knows that you know he has to somehow escape now. He goes ninety four, ninety four on the board. Oh, he didn't play e three. <laughs> oh, is it a big mistake? He didn't like it. Guys, what about king e three? King e three is bad or what? 
I mean, firstly, I'm okay. very happy that whichever move happens, and then you know, you are not in a situation where you have to make the only move. That's a little bit of a safe space here. So, so you so, think there are many good moves for white? Yeah, with e3, it was a little bit uh, tricky. But uh, what will you play? King e3, suppose. That's what you said. It's a mistake. Because and now knight e4, what to do? Why, if we play king e3 now, knight c2 check. Yeah. Knight c2 check. King moves. No, king d2. This is dangerous. E3. King, e2. king d2. E3. King, king d2. E3. Yeah. Uh, e3. King king d2. E3. King d2. E3. King d2. E3 and king c2 don't take because e2 and then suddenly black is queening. Yeah. But so this is good. Amruta. Hmm. Amruta. Yes. In, in a, knight d4, mm -hmm. there is a very powerful move. Okay. Rook. To b6, attacking the b pawn and then trying to advance our c pawn. c4, c5, c6. Push it, push it. <laughs> push karo, khush raho. I like this more, Harishit. Rook b6 because you can't defend from here. If you go... Rook b8, it's passive. I go c5. I go c5 maybe. Yeah. You are not worried about rook d8 again. Rook d8, I mean, maybe I am, but I mean, I'm very happy with my chances. But it, maybe king e3 is better. Or what? Instead of C, King E three. I uh, King E three also possible. Knight C two check. I'm king D two just. It. Now if King D two, but again Knight D four. Yeah. I, I, you know what? He, what computer says? Here, like you don't even have to care uh -huh. about anything. Just start pushing your pawns. B so four. Yeah. C five. Yeah. Okay. 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 Let's come back to the. Position Gukesh has about five minutes left it's now. Like Gukesh and Gukesh can move. Gukesh. What is the move, guys? Okay, Rook B6 Harshit found and it Rook was B6. a really good move. But tell me, is this okay. natural Rook H6 check? To no, 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 no. Because now King G and you don't want to invite the king. Maybe maybe it's a possibility because Rook H6, you invite the king up and then you attack on the B pawn so pawn. that it and falls with a check. Yeah, but anyway, he's not going to give the pawn because if you give the pawn, it's over. So okay, 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 okay. Okay, Rook B6. Yeah, Rook B6. 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 Rook but yeah. but guys, now to defend the b7 pawn only rook b8, right? Because rook e7 is yeah. controlled by the knight. Only so rook b8. In... Anything else, Arshad, you think of uh, which is tricky or something? I was, somehow was thinking if I can bring my rook to like the second file, but I don't see a way because the g file is protected by the king on f2 and the d5 knight. Ah. Uh, Suppose e3 ke labi. Suppose. E3. E3, knight E3. Now, knight E3. Now. Why, Amrutha, I said, Dete Majaya, suppose. Rookie 4, you have king. Uh, Amrutha is like, let me give more pawns because it's not my game. <laughs> no, no, no. Rookie 2, the whole thing was oh, about this pawn. It's a good point. King G3. Sagar, why? Rook takes A2. Rook yeah. takes B7. Hmm. Let's say. Let's say you make are the are move. Are 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 it's possible, but Amrutha, if you make a move like Rook D2, let's say. Rook B2, no? Why Rook D? Rook B2 is. B2. Are, just for example. Ah, okay, not on B2. Knight F6. Knight F6, and the king is checkmated Ooh. on H7. Wow. Bye bye. But we are, uh, let's not get lost in analysis because Firuja has less than three minutes on the clock, guys. And Kukesh has a huge advantage on the position. Also on the time, he has managed to have more than three minutes on the clock. Sagar Bhai, please do not spoil the party. If Kukesh has won, let us enjoy every moment of it. Because it seems as if that's where we are going. Uh, only tell us if it yes. has gone into a draw. We get some time. No, no, he's not yet here. He's not yet here. Maybe Harshit, nobody will yes. let Gukesh reach till this point. I think all the fans would be, you know, stopping him, taking photos. By the way, guys, Harshil, Harshil, who is here with me, has just interviewed Vaishali and also going to shoot moments with her because she's really a star. She has beaten the player who was in the lead, second position. Wow. Le Tingye. 
and this is wow. how it finished the game king f7 oh, double question oh no g5 queen up it's okay another big oh my god she just Italy. blundering two moves two big blunders oh wow king pawn oh my god king pawn end game mein chala gaya ye and then the it's like this pawn holds this okay 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 amruta back yeah. to back yes. to the main game. back to back to back to back to left Yeah. Oh, King D3. Oh, E2. 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 Oh my God. Oh. Knight F6. Man, Harsh, your idea. If E4. this happens, epic. King D3. King D4. Rook E4. Check. King C5. Whoa. And oh my God. Yeah, it was like if if this happens on the board, thoda risky because you know four minutes he has to calculate all of this. My guys. Otherwise, just guys, play simple chess. My feeling is. I will tell you why my what my feeling is. I feel Gukesh might not find this because if he would have found by now, he would be here. He's still not here. Means he's not. अरे ऐसा ऐसा ऐसे don't. देखो पूरा कुछ reveal नहीं कर रहा हूँ but I feel it feel it. Okay. So then what? So let's let's talk about the other possibility. Can he do ninety three? Is that a move? Amruta ninety three back. That looks nice. decent move i would call it a decent yeah, move Lose i like this move. very practical yeah it is a practical move yes. very practical going to the rook and game actually that's maybe the maybe the only two moves or what because if you go king e2 then again a check yeah knight check you might even want need to calculate with rook g8 so knight c2 yes. there it's such a complex end game for 3 minutes thinking, and thinking, one oh my god we will he find it will he find it is there a possibility that he finds rook Rook takes b7, e3, king e2, king d3. This line that we just saw, Amruta. Because if he plays rook b7, the game is over. That is for sure. Okay, so let's say Harshit. Right now, we he starts with a forcing calculation. No, rook b7. Yes. Ye ko forcing hai. Then he sees e3 check forcing. King e2 forcing. King e2 forcing. Knight four check forced. King d3 forced. E2 forced. And yeah, he he will so try to think. This is the threat. He can't stop it. Yes. So he's going to think of this move now. Instead of e one check, is there anything uh, e one queen? I think it's you possible make... to find. This has yes, to be yes, possible yes. to find. Yes, yes, yes. I can find it. Yes. If I can find it. Gukesh I think Sagar can, can find it. it. I don't have I pressure. I think I, I just feel the pressure might be too much yes. to find. It's not easy. Not easy. And let's not forget they are under five minutes, and we have the. Uh, we have the luxury of the engine evaluation, so we know that there is a win, which Gukesh doesn't. So let's not uh, let's not get ahead of ourselves because he's down to less than three minutes. He's thinking, he's thinking. Look at those eyes. He's he's. I think he might find it. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go. He took. Okay, I'll be so back. Oh my God! He took. He is taken. He found. I will be back. God. No, sir. Is this go. going to? मोस्ट फैसिनेटिंग मूव राइट नाउ विद दिस आइडिया दैट इवन विथ ऑल द प्रेशर विथ टू मिनिट्स ऑन द क्लॉक He has found it. It was a mainly wow, difficult, what a... but with the pressure, it was very difficult. Oh my God, guys! Yeah, मतलब unbelievable. I was saying, यार कुछ तो magic होने वाला है अमृता. What a game! I mean, what a calculation. E three king e two. Everything is forced, and look, Firuja is shaking his head. He knows that यार Gukesh has absolutely like you know out calculated me and. Pressured me so much that he forced me to commit a mistake. And Amruta, I am just yeah, oh, rookie six plays. played, but rookie what six. is rookie six? Ninety three back or rookie seven is also possible. Yeah, both both good both moves are very nice. Rook yeah, rookie seven looks so good. Like pure tension is done yes. on e five. <laughs> what uh, a 
performance amruta 93 is the safest bet in my opinion 93 is the safest simple move but what a performance so far has he played 93 he's still making sure no. to calculate everything he's thinking uh he's th- guys what a game jaw dropping game perfect perfect jaw dropping is the perfect description of this game rookie 6 and i uh, just making sure amrut i think rookie 7 looks like the move but e3 no maybe knight like e3 is more i would say more because uh, like you, you would like to exchange the rooks or the knights knight knight knights ek bar chale gaye to the c pawn is the clear path to victory knight e3 uh-huh. for sure amruta okay very practical move okay then okay should also go knight e3 mostly let's say better wo to he is at alag alag hi ambition level alag level only okay. <laughs> can't imagine that decision that one decision of not drawing uh, wow amruta you see i mean what a player what a player i am short of words describing how he has played today and how he has conducted himself but i think the game is not over at least for us people who are still watching it in a lag so let's still try to figure out uh, what could have happened i think knight e3 could be a move that looks quite practical knight e3 do you want to stay yeah he played rook he rook moves rook e7 he played rook e7 he's gone rook e7 and if e3 e3 king e2 then where just... e2 knight d4 check king, king d3 kya e2 yeah. e2? rook e6 rook takes e6 ah knight takes is king e2 ggs <laughs> what a game i don't know if he'll play on more let's just see rookie 7 knight e7 knight b4 c5 is the problem amruta quickly just show that knight b4 c5 b4 c5 c5 knight a2 c6 knight b4 c7 rook h6 played okay let's come back to this rook h6 um and just c5 now should be should be resignation c5 just a rook h3 yeah yeah c5 yeah just a few, they're going through the motion right now just making moves um guys gukesh op gukesh ftw gukesh for world champion <laughs> gukesh for world champion ho ja yaar but uh, even if he uh, like tomorrow c5 played knight d4 played c5 knight d4 d4 and now what now what resignation incoming 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 but not yet gukesh ftw says himang just going king e3 i think king e3 very safe king f king g2 okay rook g6 check maybe quick check he is going to give Yeah, rook g6, but I think it's all good, all under control. Few more moves probably, Amruta, but I think I think Gukesh has got this one home, Amruta. I have a feeling. Yes, yes, I have for a sure. Feeling. Big fat panda, also big super <laughs> chat two seven five seven. That's Gukesh's rating there. Gukesh hashtag Gukesh FTW next world champion in the making. Fingers crossed. Rook h6 repeats. again, please. No, he repeats. Repeating I think once, some 30 seconds. very professional, very professional. Gained some extra time on the clock, and now maybe just time to be slightly more accurate to put the finishing touch. Um, B four seems like a candidate move to do that. Uh, just advancing the pawns. Yes, good move. B four is a good move. Um, guys, Still but F T W is 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 one I like. the new one fcw <laughs> gukesh for world champion <laughs> i like that fcw is nice i like that and future world champion for and future both oh, so let's oh that's so cool that is super cool okay just getting a look look at six it's still thinking still thinking let's see how he manages to finish the game amruta but uh, harshit when nepo and yes. nakamura drew their game when gukesh in the opening was you know slightly in unpleasant position and for a, 
he kept making some moves some of, then he kept finding some little accuracies you can say and then finally yeah. the, we thought okay draw ho raha hai yaar can't even uh, yeah. still see it's not thinking it in that he decided to play from that point and uh, it has reached till this point in the penultimate round kya hi kya bole he plays before kya hi accuracy amruta it's like you know he it's i was talking about this psychological factor of you know viruja thinking that the game is about to be mm. over you know Big like one. yes and you think that you are so close to something but he, and then suddenly you are snatched away from that opportunity gukesh showing exemplary fighting spirit today rook takes h3 king g2 very quickly played by him and uh, i think it's uh, the game is the game has effectively been decided because rook to h6 amruta let's try to find the finishing moves rook to h6 rook d3 no uh, maybe uh, rook d3 knight f6 is finish ah yeah if you move away from the h5 it's done so yes. rook h6 so rook h6. and maybe i'm suspecting uh, just some move like rook b7 or something perhaps yes uh, and just go b5 c6 next seems just push the connected pawns Perfect. guys push the connected pawns and then the king on h8 is really badly placed so e yeah. g2 this might be the last moment shanky fans this is the moment guys go, go, can you be. feel it can you feel this moment wow what a thing to witness for us wow and firuja is scratching his face he knows you know something has gone wrong amruta what are we witnessing today has not yet sunk in my brain right now rook rook b sun played so quick he is so quick gukesh is just in ultra sharp mode amruta ultra sharp i can't believe like the amount of accuracy for the complex position for the complex pressured situation considering the whole sphere he is ultimate i mean he would really deserve to be the candidate champion yeah with this, this Guys, game he is representing himself and through himself a billion supporters that he has behind him amruta we are all part of that and we are so happy to have so many people supporting that watching so late in the night amruta what a moment to witness for everyone here yeah now it's not even a night uh, harshit it's morning 5:30 am i'm morning, sure many people that... have woken up <laughs> while drinking the hot tea they are going to get some hot news breaking news chai or gukesh king g8 and i think b5 c6 is going to be amruta the end the end the finale Bye. the ending touch the final paint on the canvas is being made by gukesh in this amazing game that he has played i think rook i think b6 is a very natural move b6 rook c7 and b7 push karo khush raho hopefully uh this will be the last rook c7 i oh, rook c7 not because b6 is hanging so first b6 then rook c7 yes correct pehle b6 and then rook c7 is there a difference yeah. like you can also go c6 or uh... c6 allows knight takes c6 no need to allow that ah yes no counter play you want to give at all no chance no chance b6 rook c7 and dheere dheere se dheere dheere as you explained about the thing where the cycle of draw was going to happen and then ali reza was a mindset like he was prepared for it and yeah. sudden twist it's like guys something is going sudden on twist. uh very coolly calmly you're going to about to board a flight flight ja raha hai and then just before that Abruta, some... let's just wait the last yes. few moves yes. let's just let's just watch him in silence and appreciate the beauty of the painting that he has created in the form of today's game <laughs> lovely that's a He goes B. What? क्या कहला? Wow, B6. wow. B six. This is what you had mentioned. Yes. And now rook c seven, b seven coming. मजा आया कि नहीं यार chat. मजा आया कि नहीं. Too good. Clock please. नहीं guys इतना छोटे board पे नहीं हो सकता है clock. 
king f2 rook h very quickly uh, rook g6 king f2 rook h6 played and i think probably rook c7 is going to be the next move gukesh gave a sigh there amrut he knows it gukesh gave a sigh of relief he knows that it's so close i have it in my hand now so we don't even need the board it's like this feeling intense feeling wahi wahi le lo andar usi mein maza hai ek you know you do all this supporting guys you root for him you watch this exciting game you listen to us guys trying to understand those players and finally the fruit that gukesh might bring today in the form of a victory amruta super lost for words yeah Played rook d7, I think, or what was it? Yeah, rook c7. Yes. Okay, let's let's watch. Let's watch. I think guys is about to resign. Let's look at this final moment, guys. Amruta, are you ready? Are you ready for the? We saw the first handshake. We are about to see the second handshake between the players, which will be a decisive win for Gukesh. it's about to happen amruta i can feel it firuja knows that he is lost and the b pawn is going to promote sometimes you just sit there and you are waiting for you know the thing like for your brain to uh, contemplate whatever just happened so much action in the last few hours amruta it's been quite insane the action packed game that we have witnessed totally i think maybe he resigns right now who knows last moment guys about to happen is i think this is might be the move b7 is unstoppable um and firoj firuja might throw in the towel at this exact move just one funny thing amruta if rook h2 check don't go king e3 don't go king e3 because then knight c2 is checkmate okay but king g3 yes of course oh yes that was the final trick firuja had up his sleeve No checkmate for you. Ah, <laughs> uh, but he had to be alert, yeah. That was important. Alert. You see, very tricky. I mean, many people would just go king e three very quickly, and then suddenly knight c two checks, and oops. Yeah, he stopped, guys. Gukesh has won the game. Gukesh is the sole leader of the FIDE candidates. Look at that. guy look at that guy oh my goodness so calm so composed after an emphatic victory amruta wow oh my god okay i am uh, i'm just chat ka kya chal raha hai kya ho gaya yaar how you feeling harshit kya ho gaya ye <laughs> leading the tournament and look he's again is making sure that he he respects the game of chess always has a ritual of uh, you know respecting the board before and after the game but today it's our day to respect him as a player amruta kya hi kya hi performance wow i i mean this has been such an epitome of inspiration uh, harshit like you cannot guys, inspire guys, more than this It's guys so... guys guys what Yes, exactly. Oh, what happened? Oh, my God, Sagar Bhai! Yeah, even the guy behind us is like, yes, what a game! This was so happy. Everyone is so happy. Everyone is so happy. Oh I can God. show you, by the way, Gukesh. Do you want to see Gukesh? Yes, He's here. Can yes, I'll just show. Yeah, we won't disturb him, of course, because it's the full tournament. Uh, you know, he has a different style. Yes, one more round, guys. We won't disturb, but I will just show. Support him. Yes. I'll just show you. here. happy about this result but one more game one more game correct no no uske baad we can yeah. we can like force him to give as many interviews as possible and also ja isne kya kar diya maybe we go here the man the myth the Chat legend is going crazy so many the man with the legend gukesh it's so people are so like you know wanting to take a look at him there he is amruta there wait, he is wait. giving an interview ah, there soul leader before What? the last round is crazy yeah 
<laughs> and Amrutha, he's so he wins such an amazing game, and then I look at his interview, and he's like, "Yes, today was quite a good game." Uh, but he knows, he knows Amrutha that the tournament is not over yet, so he's composed. As Kobe Bryant once said in his interview, "Is the job done yet?" No. Mm. So I'm still focused. So the job is not wow. done yet, Amrutha. One more game. one more game and then he can be as happy as he wants to be par abhi to focus thoda chahiye par guys gukesh op what a superb game yaar today and you know uh, harshit last game with ali reza he was he it was a game where we never thought he can lose and today we never yes. thought initially that he, this is going to go into a winning moment but that's yeah. how it kind of turned into yes sagar we saw him it was very nice to have yes. a- i can i can tell you the mood in the place is like everyone's very excited like not just us but everyone because everyone yeah, really yes. feels like you know when bukesh wins it's special like he is 17 right yeah. his father is here around and i could sense you know he is just keeping his calm because tomorrow is such a crucial day no one smile even bukesh for that matter i asked him only one question in the press conference i i don't do his interviews right because i'll do it after the tournament so i asked him did you ever think that you could repeat in that move 40 you know like the, what was mm-hmm. going through your mind and he was like i'm completely better why should i repeat and i said but the engine was saying it's equal and he said what equal i can't believe it this is news to me so you know for for gukesh i think he was always thinking is better yeah just I like how aryan tari was thinking right ki yes. better hi hai yeah. position oh practically it looked very good and actually we have one more game going which unfortunately looks bad for prag but very good for karuana no. who see guys 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 isn't that isn't that position reached equality no it changed in the time pressure karwana oh, has managed yeah. to put pressure on and on prag and uh, karwana has shown why he is world number 2 sagar bhai because seems like he is going to have winning chances what happened something happened and every, everyone's running going behind, behind gukesh, gukesh it seems actually <laughs> उंड and we will of course interact maza aane wala hai this is a very special interaction which we are going to have also sagar will join i guess and unbelievable this is insane unbelievable absolutely unbelievable amruta uh, it seems like uh, karwana is managing to win his game if you want to quickly just just have a that, quick uh, look at this uh, guys and once again we'll talk to you but gukesh's camera is there we have it all done still we can have it because you know it just feels good that they yeah. both are playing on that board it just feels good yeah. to have that so let let it just be there even without the guys over there so uh, this yeah. is the position for prag currently he was in trouble but it's so complex i mean just at a, if you try to look at it craziness is happening here yeah? uh can hmm <laughs> So if I was played last move by Pranandha with thirty seconds, should I mean yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I yes, just play here and <laughs> hard to say. I mean, he's he has like thirty seconds on his clock, but it seems like uh, Fabi has kind of managed to yeah, yeah, improve his position a lot. He played with two seconds. Actually, Prag has played with oh, two seconds. No, so we'll not go into much details right now into this Harshit. But uh, yeah. the fact that Karuana is right now beating Pragnananda and moving to eight points, so Gukesh will be on yeah. eight and half. Uh, then we yeah. will have just to quickly bring the standings over here for the guys to see. We'll have Gukesh on eight and half, Naka on eight, Nepo on eight, and Fabi on eight. So. If Gukesh draws and Fabi and Nepo draw, then he is the clear cut champion, which yeah, yep. looks right now like a normal thing. But it's going to be not easy. Naka with the white pieces will try to exert a lot of pressure. Karuana sure. would want to win the event. Like he's like, I don't care yeah, with whom I'm playing. Job has not 
not at all been finished yet gukesh does need to hold uh, yes tomorrow's game against hikaru to guarantee himself a playoff so still still a lot of fight remaining in tomorrow's game amruta this position looks to be very difficult for prak to defend but with that amazing victory of gukesh i will take a leave from you it has been absolute pleasure yes. and uh, you know amazing it, uh, fun to commentate and watch these games with you guys thanks a lot as also for cheering for uh, gukesh guys and harshit op bhi ek bar ho jaye some insane calculations there so many moves he was suggesting and they were actually happening on the board so we got the real kind of a feel there harshit 5 6 hours you were here so thank you so much for spending this time Perfect. with us and you yeah. come tomorrow with all the energy <laughs> for sure for sure i'm looking forward to join you again tomorrow until then see you and let's meet tomorrow perfect Bye-bye. perfect guys that was harshit for us harshit op ho jaye ek bar now it's the chat and me where is sagar is he going to tell us all the exciting news there he's i'm sure he was running behind gukesh and i'm sure right now so many people were waiting outside so i believe kya mahol rahega na like i don't even know if gukesh will be able to enter that bus that van over there it would be so crazy but maybe he still needs to be focused so we'll come back to it but kya chal raha hai chat mein what is the atmosphere in the chat alfren jos super chats for the first time says gg fantastic gukesh Thank you, Alphons. Then we had Big Fat Panda giving a big super chat. We also had Manu Bachu. I think Sagar did read it. Thank you for all these big super chats. Vijaya Nirmal says Gukesh Op. Thank you, Vijaya, for that. And Dhaka J says Vaishali. Yes, Vaishali winning the fourth game in a row is a rare thing. Extremely rare. It's already very rare to win three games back to back. तो फोर्थ तो अलग ही है एंड इमेजिन इफ टुमारो शी विन्स द गेम टुमारो अगेन इफ शी विन्स शी विल बी व्हाट वुड बी हर रैंकिंग राइट नाउ फाइव एंड हाफ सिक्स एंड हाफ शी इज ऑन सिक्स एंड हाफ एंड शी विल गो ऑन सेवन एंड हाफ स्टिल इन द टॉप फोर और समथिंग आई बिलीव वुड बी टू गुड टू गुड वैशाली ओपी इन द चैट सच में मजा आ गया इस साहिल बोल रहा है मजा आ गया थैंक यू हर्षित भाई मिहिर से मजा आ गया मिहिर लॉट्स ऑफ क्लिप्स लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू हमजा से देर आर सो स्लिम चांसेस ऑफ टाई ब्रेक्स नॉट है एवरी वन टूमोरो विल पुश फॉर अ विन या हाउ मच आर द चांसेस ऑफ कोर्स वी इफ आई आस्क यू वेदर यू वॉन्ट द टाई ब्रिक्स और नॉन नाउ एवरी वन गॉन से नो वी डोंट वॉन्ट टाई ब्रिक्स वी वॉन्ट गुकेश टू विन इट इज जस्ट स्ट्रेट फॉरवर्ड एंड आई थिंक ये ऑल्सो वाइल वी आर कैलकुलेटिंग एवरी थिंग दिस वॉज द बेस्ट केस सिनारियो फॉर अस वेर दिस विल द गेम विल एंड इन ड्रॉ ना नेपो ना का काइंड ऑफ वी एक्सपेक्टेड दिस वी थॉट दैट गुकेश विल विन बट never knew that it's going to be so difficult and so intense the way it happened today plus also so much ex- so much more exciting with all that happened uh, then we will tomorrow i think karuana versus nepo will get intense i am, i do think that so it may not be so easy may not be so easy but gukesh with the black pieces when he is in a must draw situation he's not in a must win situation but he's definitely going to play a little more solid because practically he knows that the result on the other board also is going to be very difficult i would be insane if he still goes for something so rash with nakamura fir to pagal ho jayenge yaar gukesh kuch bhi kar sakta hai like if today he had he had decided to go on playing then he can do anything Pragt tried a lock today. Yeah, that is definitely a bit sad because um, he he got such a beautiful fortress. He played well to have that kind of an understanding. There's no plan, but somewhere he did miss, and it's being a long game with Karuana. 
Katkam Anurag Super Chat. Samrita, I don't know if you remember. I told you on my first Super Chat that this time it is going to an, to an Indian winning the candidate. Simply amazing. Katkam, thank you so much. Um, I may not exactly remember because this tournament has been very long and it feels like every day feels like a memory being erased in some way. But I definitely believe that if you are saying that, you would have said that for sure. Himang says, tomorrow Berlin from Gukesh. Super solid. We trust in Gaevsky. <laughs> yeah, tie break score is the, wouldn't matter here because same point skill it doesn't matter. But even if you would see the tie break score, Gukesh had the highest one. Alex says, it's just unbelievable how good the last two rounds pairings are. When a tumagar dilse kuch chao get a puri ja kaya kayan nat kayo? I'm sorry, completely blank, completely lost. Sagar knows that dialogue. Sometimes he says this puri ja kayo? Jannat, puri jannat se. I'm sorry, kayo is there. A dialogue kaya batao, kayanat, kayanat. Puri jaida, me jaida te bol reality. Tell me the dialogue now, Baba. Hasso mat bus. Samaj gaya kainat, but what's the dialogue? Dialogue batao, guys. <laughs> Bure dialogue ki wat laga di. Chalta hai thoda. Oh, GM Harishit Raja ko nikal di ho. Are there is... Because even when Sagar will come... Yes. Dialogue. If you wish for something, the entire universe conspires to make it happen. Acha English me. Ah, we Hindi me likha hua hai. Puri kaina tumhe usse milane ki koshish mein lag jati hai. Correct. Exactly. That's the whole point. So the main point is Gukesh's pairings. Right now we might feel that they are the best. But finally everyone's played against each other. And uh, just really some ulta pulta there. But the way Gukesh. Gukesh actually we should not uh, forget about that one game. Because you know that day when Vidit beat Nakamura. That game was so epic with that Bishop G4 that in that same round, Gukesh was playing Pragnananda. And Prag with some amazing opening preparation and all of that. And Gukesh with the black pieces had to be really on his toes. He was in trouble a few times in the game. It was highly complex game. But that game, beating Prag was a very, very crucial uh, round for him. So that one was one. Where else? Of course, today is something amazing. And not to lose. You will see that he was not losing much. So, that really mattered. Very much mattered. And we are having more super chats. Random dude says, leading candidates at 17 in such a strong field. Incredible. Absolutely agree. Shubhra Singh, thank you. First time you are super chatting. Gukesh for the win. And if Gukesh, if at all, you know, if this happens, then Magnus is going to rethink. But, you know, Magnus in freestyle chess, Gukesh was the one who was selected to play that tournament. So, it was by Magnus. So, for sure, he knows that. He knows that. Um, Aman said, just by watching candidates, I improved to 1600. I can believe because, you know, it's not just candidates. If you, you, some, you can consider it like a crash course of chess improvement as well. There's so much to learn with their ideas, with their decisions, with their psychology. Every, every sphere of it with their energy level, stamina, 
सब कुछ ही ले लो तुम इन दैट सेंस हाउ दे हैंडल ऑफ द बोर्ड स्टाफ ऑन द बोर्ड स्टाफ सो दिस वन इज लाइक अ क्रैश कोर्स इट्स लाइक दैट वन मंथ नॉट इवन वन मंथ बट दैट ट्वेंटी डेज वर्थ इट इफ यू आर सीरियस इफ यू सीरियसली वॉन्टेड टू इम्प्रूव चेस देन वॉच सम टोर्नामेंट वेर यू वॉच इट सो इंटेंसली फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट मोमेंट that you understand deeper things about the analysis about chess until the last day it's a great training really great training yeah i'm ready aa gaye wapas kaisa hai how is it yeah it's uh, a mixed emotion because we yeah. lost Oh uh, yeah, your voice little lower. Yeah, can you hear me now? The camera is fine. Yeah. Okay. Can you speak? Be lost. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay. And uh, okay, sure. But I feel the tournament is far from over because. Now tomorrow Hikaru will go all out against Bukesh to win, correct? Because Hikaru is white. If Bukesh draws, then Depo or Karwana, whoever wins, catches him, and we have tie break. So it is far from over. Correct, but even if Depo and Kar Karwana want to catch him, uh, Bukesh is a very fast runner. No, if Bukesh wins, everything is done. Like he no, becomes no the champion. No, no, no. Need to win because the just the pairing, the Karwana Nepo both such solid players. It's hard to beat each other. Telling you, it's really hard. It won't no, go in. No, but they will go all out. Who is going to tomorrow? They, hmm? Karwana is right. He will go all out. Yes, of course he will go all out. But Nepo is no. Nepo has been playing really solid chess. So I don't think with the black pieces Nepu will land up in any trouble. Okay, that's my prediction that it won't go in tie breaks. Maybe not about tie breaks much, but that's that's more of like a feeling. But anyway, even if it goes like Gukesh has to win. ठीक है बट अभी के लिए अभी के लिए कैसा है सागर अभी के लिए बाहर लाइक वही वाज ही एबल टू गो इनटू द वैन लाइक हाउ वाज इट आफ्टर ही वेंट आउट ऑफ द हॉल Uh, okay, I will just uh, get back to you on this, and I will respond. One minute, okay? Got it. You mute yourself. Okay. 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 Okay.
या वट डू दिस एच फोर यू डोंट वॉन्ट टाई ब्रेक्स इट्स लाइक भाई बस करो ये टेंशन हमसे नहीं हो रहा है इट्स मोर लाइक दैट आई गेट इट आई गेट इट इट्स लाइक सोने दो अभी जल्दी सो रहे हैं हम लोग दैट काइंड ऑफ अ थिंग या मे बी मे बी दैट काइंड ऑफ अ थिंग ये है ना अभी भी अच्छा सो वाई इज द स्टैंडिंग्स ऑन दैट वी वुड लव टू सी दैट आई डोंट नो वेयर हैज दिस कम फ्रॉम या स्टैंडिंग्स लेट मी जस्ट रिमूव दिस एंड लेट मी जस्ट हैव दिस एंड दिस इज द वी गोइंग टू वर्ड इज द एंड मोमेंट्स ऑफ प्रग वर्सेस करुआना क्वीन जी ए चेक क्वीन ए टू लेट्स हैव अ लुक एट दिस बिकॉज One second, queen a two. Yeah, the main problem is if you go here. Yeah, anyway, you can take it. The reason is, yeah, the result is updated. King, because you can anyway take this. That's the point. So that has happened. These were the final moves, and Prag lost his game. Karuana beats Pragnananda. That's a massive result, and that's really, really amazing. What Karuana could do today, but because Prag was solid over there, he had this fortress. Very, uh, a little sad for Prag for sure, losing this game. In fact, in the last few rounds, it has been a little tough for him. But nevertheless. i'm sure uh, prag is a kind of person one good thing about him is that firstly his recovery is amazing and secondly his attitude is simply superb for chess so he's never much focused on results that is something to learn from him and uh, what we what we are seeing here i'm sure that this was this okay, couldn't have worked out for everybody here in the same tournament but um, for sure he will strike back tomorrow with whom is he playing just to check the pairings we have nijat versus prag and prag is black so he will try to you know beat nijat today and vidit is playing with ali reza vidit is black Karuana playing with Nepo and Hikaru with Gukesh. In women's, by the way, Katerina Lano playing with Vaishali, Le Tingji playing with Hampi, and Anna is playing with Tan Zongi. So if Anna beats Tan Zongi and Le Tingji, but uh, Hampi is also very strong. So it's mostly Tan Zongi practically we should be the winner, but we can only wait until tomorrow. And Gorya Goryachkina versus Nurgil. So these were the pairings uh, today. Also, guys. a big 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 thanks because we could really have the camera and all the fun over there thanks to fide so do check their shop out and use this code chessbase because it was very kind of them to you know value the indian emotions which we have and to support us really amazing of them to do that so maybe you can just try to visit the website and here we had the rankings before the round but we will check the current leader board very soon it's a uh, 6 o'clock in the morning we started at 11:45 yesterday so it's been more than it's been 6 hours 15 minutes i'm extremely hungry so i'm going to have a great breakfast very very soon can't can't uh, it was something which we were uh, hoping predicting and all that but still when it has happened actually literally when it has happened it always takes a bit of time to you know sink in but uh, ye to aaj ki baat hai what we will do when the last day will be over tabhi to crazy ho jayega yaar crazy himang se apan to sone ja rahe hai very soon Yes, Imang. Always, ah, uh, nah, yeah, he's also shared the shop link. So thanks for that. Itachi says, in future we will see Prag versus Guke just like Kasparov versus Karpov. I agree with you, actually. 
Aryan says, if we think Nepo Fabi will end in a draw, Guki versus Hikaru is equivalent to an Armageddon. <laughs> so many people today uh, today i can't believe what it would be on internet in general not just on chessbiz india but i believe everywhere it would have been going so crazy for gukesh that this guy will be very focused he would know nothing about what's happening there online he's just completely going to be focused for tomorrow it's so one game at a time and a good thing was that yesterday was a rest day so for these guys candidates as it, i was wondering why do they have rest days between two after two rounds like towards the end of it so this is the reason if we try to understand the reason is so clear that it is so exhausting super exhausting and candidates tournament when whenever there is a qualifier there is always a different kind of pressure so with all of that with all of that intense level of pressure Towards the end, you feel more exhausted and that's why every two rounds at the end of it, there was a uh, rest day. So first it started with four rounds and a rest day. Then it was three rounds and a rest day. Another three rounds and a rest day. Then two rounds and a rest day. And then we have these again two rounds. And tomorrow, after tomorrow, we will know that if they will have to play tie break with all that mental exertion. It would be that they have to bring super reserve energy. I mean, it's pura wo rehta hai na. Idhar se, udhar se. Muh likhna zaruri hota hai. Yes, it's compulsory to write. Shri Ram says, watch the match live. How are you guys able to stay up? You feel the energy which you get from, uh, you know, something exciting happening. Do you get the energy? Because I remember there have been moments when it has been also tough and still many of you guys were awake. Uh, how were you able to do then as well? You were, like one day was, I think, one of the toughest day for us, which was where Prague also lost and Vidit also lost. That one. This says night shift. Arvind says we don't have a life. This is our normal schedule. Sai says some of us are not watching from India. But still, I mean, six hours is a pretty huge time. Uh, of course, side by side you will do things. But in in that also, the inten whatever you will be doing, you won't be able to intensely focus. Anyway, intense focus they used to say for chess practice only that the maximum you can practice is six hours. It's like the super max because the intense six hours is also so huge. It's never easy to do that. So Gukesh, calm, emotional. What is Gukesh's live rating is a good question. I think we should definitely check that. Sneha says, Amrita, hum log na thoda th so so jate hai. <laughs> hum log na thoda so so jate hai. Are, thanks, KK. Gukesh is India number one in live ratings. Okay, let's let's uh, see the live ratings. Let me quickly pull that out for you guys. Wait a second. Wait a moment. It's refreshing. Ooh, so we have D. Gukesh becoming India number six. Uh, sorry, what India? World number six. And he has gained 19.8 points. A massive 19.8 with 2762. Who can do that? Ali Reza has lo lost many points, 22. But he's also a fighter. He generally makes a comeback at some point. Um, then we have Nepo also gaining good amount of points, 11 points. We were looking at Nakamura if he can reach 2800. But today after draw is on 2795. 
and Gukesh two seven six two point eight. I think he has crossed his highest trading. Maybe it was two seven six one. If I'm not wrong, uh, please correct me if I'm wrong. And then we have Ding Ding on seventh, Arjun on eighth. Prag also has lost a few points, very few though. So that's fine. And tomorrow he still can beat Nijat and then recover. So it can be a decent tournament there if you look at the rating perspective. Karuana has gained three points. Nakamura has gained six points. So Karuana has gone to two eight zero six. Otherwise, a tough tournament would have brought him down to twenty seven hundred. But he's just showing there. It's very difficult to maintain such a rating of twenty eight hundred and above. So it's amazing what Karuana has managed to do, be being twenty eight hundred steady, very solidly steady. But yeah, Gukesh two seven six two, and I don't know after candidates if he has any important tournament because otherwise it would be a published rating on um, tomorrow is the last round, and he's playing with Hikaru Nakamura. Even if it goes into tie breaks, it would be rapid and blitz rating. It won't be the classical rating. so an important round for rating perspective i believe because it might be the published rating then on first may ah kevri says today some i read in my chess stream as well that's so cool watching from poland Royal uh, says just woke up to watch Gukesh one. Harshit says Gukesh bhai made the night worth being awake. Gukesh bhai, arey ha. Rohan says heard you visited Gida Gidansk. Come again soon. Oh, you are in Gidansk. That's cool. Uh, such a lovely place. Arka says woke up five minutes prior to Gukesh when I think God wanted me to witness the moment. Yes, Arka, you might have seen the you know a thriller movie, a super hit movie, the last part of it. But please go and watch the full movie. It was something you cannot miss. Free Peed says three of our boys are playing. We have to stay awake. Like that. Ajay asks, "I'm in to Toronto downtown. How to get ticket for tomorrow?" Ajay, if I did share a secret that if you buy um, from Fide Shop over there, worth hundred Canadian dollars, then you will get some entry at I think some place exactly. You, it, he said it in the stream, but uh, maybe if the chat heard it properly. <laughs> With the, I don't want to give any wrong details. Not that I don't hear what Sagar speaks, guys. Don't uh, even try to go there. Rooting for Gukesh from Brazil, he will win this. Says Glover. So, wow, so many fans from Brazil. Yeah, for Gukesh. What is the quality? That what is that one quality which you really love about Gukesh? What is that one quality which you really love about Gukesh? Okay, I've muted the sound, but this might be worth to see because this is Gukesh over here. If you see some nice, very nice shots when he had come to uh, visit Chesbiz India office here to record. a uh, video course it was back last year uh, on 16th march here come and a very nice thing about him was he was here for uh, this recording and there was this moment where uh, it was a first day at children's chess home where sagar goes and uh, you know teaches chess whenever he is here in mumbai and um, gukesh said i also would like to come though he need not have come at all like he had a simul i think immediately uh, so it was going to be tiring mumbai uh, mumbai heat of course but really amazing of him he came there he enjoyed so
Shazwinder, please create amazing reel of final countdown of Guke so we can reshare and we can get our non-chess friend onto watching final tomorrow. Great idea. Anais is watching from California. Best time spent on Saturday of afternoon. Cute Rabbit says, sometimes chess gets more exciting than most of the physical games if the commentary is good. Oh, physical games also. Pawan says, I live in Poland for almost two years, watching from Frankfurt, Germany. Absolute thriller. What is the quality about Gukesh? He's calm as cucumber. Sharp mind at just age 17. Handling now nerves in tough situations. Humble. His calmness. The, he's the winner. His calm and chill nature. Okay, controlling nerves. I think controlling nerves and uh, this one definitely is something so, uh, so much impactful on us. Like we look at how Vidit meditates and you know, in the beginning how he is able to be calm in many of the situations or how he has changed himself completely. I can say for, for Gukesh, how he is able to keep his nerves in today was the max pressure. Yaar. Ye agar, if he could handle today, then tomorrow is no pressure for him. Because I think today was somehow the way today pressure was playing a role. I think it it won't play in that way tomorrow. What are you going to eat for breakfast? Upma. I am going to eat upma. Rahul says, for last two rounds, I've been watching the entire game. It has completely messed my messed up my sleep routine, but it's worth it. Will you invite Gukesh to CBI Chess Club Mumbai if he wins? Gukesh, of course. I mean, Gukesh, if he wins, he will have a lot of more tournaments and all. But we were anyway, in Prague when we met, we were talking about, we want to invite Gukesh, we want to invite Prague. So, but these guys have a very packed schedule. So... Rakshit is watching from bedroom in Bangalore. Rakshit, thoda ghar se bahar nikal. <laughs> oh, Abhishek is watching from North Carolina. Wow, that's cool. You remember Magesh Chandran had come in between. He joined us for commentary and he's from North Carolina. I hope so. Now I'm thinking, am I mixing it up with California? <laughs> Also the fighting spirit, winner mentality. Kyur says, Kabi. When is the world championship match with Ding? I think it would be in some six months or something around that time. Jeremy says in interview afterwards, he was so calm and peaceful, inspiring. Jeremy says, after Nodirbek became the world number 5, Gukesh was like, not too fast now. Was like, not too fast now. Got it. Himang says, watching from my work desk in Bharampur, West Bengal. Are Himang. Himang, so ja, abhi. Master. Siddharth is watching from Boston. Ask Sagar to visit Boston on the way back. But that is a US visa. I, he doesn't have a US, uh, US visa. Vadodra, Gurjad, Gujarat, Kemcho. <laughs> I'm watching from Pune. Are Devansh. Nice. Kerala. Kerala is a place I really love. Very much love. Washington. Dublin. The Ninja Singh, there's a Dublin square in uh, Phoenix here. Where we had a death match. And we had two death matches. We had uh, even one Gukesh versus Arjun. That was in Hyderabad. Vidit versus Anish. Umkar says watching from Goa. Year for vacation but I've already ruined my sleep schedule. But totally worth it. We'll spend full Sunday sleeping. Goa ja ke raat mein commentary aur din mein sona. Wah. Umkar. Kis ke saath gaye ho? Maar dalegi. Standings, I think I showed 
both the standings in between in but i'll still watching from texas i will will look at all the standings one more time guys sagar will join us as like a ritual towards the end he joins us uh one question i wanted to ask you guys that was this layout okay like do you really need the four live games because we it's a little bit of a struggle with the space with the zoom camera and all but do you really need that or two would be enough or it's good to have all the live games let me know ah, i have an idea for standings these are the men's standings here wait i will show you the current standings watch here we have the current standings gukesh on 8 and 1/2 karwana hikaru and nepo on 8 points prag on 6 Vidit on five and a half, Firuza on four and a half, and Nijat on three and a half. That is the men's standings. Eight and a half out of thirteen. We were expecting a winner to be around nine and a half out of thirteen, but uh, maybe it could be even nine out of thirteen. It's a tough, tough tournament. Going to the women's rankings to show you the leaderboard. We have Tan Zongyi on eight and a half. Late Ng on seven and half. So if Tan draws tomorrow, she is a clear cut winner. Just wins the candidates. Goryachki now on six and half. Humpy on six and half. Lano on six and half. Vaishali on six and half. So like too many on six and half. Then we have Anna and Nurgul on five each. So Vaishali, who was on two and half points at the lowest bottom there. just tried back in the last four rounds and showed some amazing fighting spirit there so 6 and 1/2 by vaishali these are the leaderboard and these are the standings guys so i hope that also this was the last position of gukesh which which was a resignation from ali reza after king g7 so just let's have that on the board today worth it okay bahut kuch chal raha hai chat mein hi rohan we might meet sagar and vidit on 23rd okay i have uh, i don't know but uh, it's good to get some information saran says watching from san francisco perfect time for me round starts 11:30 am and finishes at 4:30 are kya baat hai board live chess very small in size two leader board is okay for tomorrow kal ke liye do live board is okay okay only two that's a great uh, great suggestion we will go for only two watching from texas usa watching from london watching from saudi क्या ही गाइस तुम लोग कहाँ कहाँ हो ना लाइक हाउ इन अ वे जस्ट वॉचिंग दीज गेम्स इज कनेक्टिंग कनेक्टिंग अस इट्स सो अमेजिंग जय से आई वॉज अ प्रोफेसर देर नॉट एनी मोर ओ वेर दिस इज हिस्टोरिक this is definitely historic dl sendaru oof aur kya chal raha hai ek minute ruko globber super chatted vaishali truly unlocked her chess in these matches i completely agree with you globber rooting for gukesh from brazil he will win that's what he says shubhra thank you again he is saying thanks for the streams you and sagar are working so hard everyone you know watching stream is also hard work <laughs> guessing moves is also hard work there giving good energy positive uh, things also a very nice thing it's all uh, it all works together random do you say is leading candidates at 17 in such a strong field incredible guys what did you have what had you done oh by the way abhijit says gukesh wore rf shirt federerisk perfect finish was he wearing roger federer wow that's so cool by the way at 17 what were you guys doing 
when you guys were seventeen. He Aksh says it was amazing meeting Sagar Bhai today. That's so cool. Stephens is watching from New Orleans. I have become a fan of Harshit Raja today, for sure. He's such a beautiful addition to the commentary here. Mayur says Sagar Sade might convince Vidit Prag and Guki for a meet up on twenty third. We'll meet either at the park again or airport. और नाइगरा फॉल्स मे बी यू कैन ऑल मीट एट नाइगरा फॉल्स एक बस ले लो इट्स लाइक ट्रैवल बस एंड देन ऑल द चेस फैंस दे गो टू नाइगरा फॉल्स क्या ही मजा आएगा अर्थलिंग से स्टडिंग फॉर बोर्ड्स वेन यू आर इन सेवेंटीन सेवेंटीन एट सेवेंटीन विक्रम सेज आई एम सेवेंटीन ओके ओके विक्रम क्रिस्टोर सेज आई वॉज हैविंग अ कोविड ब्रेक एंड इलेवेंथ एग्जाम कैंसल एट सेवेंटीन नाइस दैट्स अ गुड वन अमृता डोंट डोंट आस्क दैट क्वेश्चन शिखर सेज डू यू थिंक मेडिटेशन इज प्लेड अ रोल इन गुकेश विद इट्स परफॉर्मेंस इन रिसेंट इयर्स meditation of course uh, helps everyone what because basic point of meditation is uh, bringing your focus staying calm you know there are so many researches where uh, so many times when we are driving uh, if let's say you have had some argument if some things are not going well if you are stressed then the way you drive it really matters the decisions you take you overtaking and all of that and many of the accidents have happened when something early previously uh, the in the mindset of that person and that's why even uh, in fact i think it's important for pilots uh, and all while we were recently trying to understand when we had gone to prague where they had this flight uh, stimulator what was it called something and uh, yeah it does matter a lot so similarly decision making yeah chess is about decision making and how can you make good decision how can you make good decisions if your mind is into something else if there is a subconscious so anything which is troubling you so that way these player is the kind of focus they are able to keep not just during the game but at every other point uh, during the full event before the event it is insane it is so insane it is such a high level of discipline in a way maybe uh, something which can be compared to i believe um, i don't know if it is right way but something in air force or you know how how it is so disciplined that way for the mind it may not be about strict about the timings and all but in terms of your mindset to be able to working on it you require high discipline and high focus so that is why one of the thing when we always say to people that you know learning chess is great it doesn't matter like uh, whether you play go for it as a career or not simply because the kind of discipline it brings in your life uh, it's really good and nowadays to in with all these things bahut hi needed with all the technology and all the uh, addiction of the phone and all very much needed I am currently seventeen and watching Gukesh creating history. <laughs> that's a, that's a good one. That's a good one. Anyone wants to do a watch party in Seattle? Oh, that's such a cool idea! Watch party. I feel next candidates will have seven players from from India," says Devansh. Next, I'm not sure. It may not be as easy. I think Uzbekistan definitely another strong country. USA. Rakshit says Sunday morning ko mummy ko panch baje utha diya khushi me. Ah, Sunday hai? Kya baat hai? Nice. तो तो फिर वेरी नाइस संडे को सो मेनी पीपल सैटरडे मेनी पीपल कुड वॉच मे बी बिकॉज टूडे संडे बट आई थिंक ऑन संडे मंडे मॉर्निंग मंडे ब्लूज रहता है तो आई डोंट नो 
वेर इज सागर भाई वेटिंग फॉर हिम यस वी आर ऑल वेटिंग फॉर सागर एंड वी वुड लव टू वेट फॉर सागर एंड गेट मोर वी वुड लव टू इफ इफ ही गोज आउट साइड देयर एंड शोज सम मोर थिंग्स वुड बी नाइस आई एम श्योर ही नोज दैट अच्छा वन सेकेंड बाय आई वॉन्टेड टू शो यू समथिंग I have shown you this. Maybe not. Let me just quickly. Nice thumbnail. Gukesh leading the <laughs> the pack over here. Then we have. So we guys, you must check this out because we have launched some amazing chess sets over here on Chess Biz India shop. They're very cool. This little one, ten inches one, is very cute. And then this one is chess pa chess set. Behind we have the chess pa there, motivating, saying well played. So that's something you check it out. And coming back here, oof, we have Gukesh there once again on the screen. Tickets for tie breaks will go live in case we get there. Please confirm with Sagar Bai. I don't know about tie breaks. I don't think he will know because tie breaks. Anyway, we we don't even know whether it will go in tie breaks. So tomorrow we will get to more information, which I be, I believe. No four way tie break is impossible. I believe because if four people who are on top right now are playing against each other, then what is the probability? If one of them wins, uh, Nepo or Karuana. Even if they draw, and if Gukesh draws, he is ahead of them. He is the sole champion. If Gukesh wins, he is the sole champion. If uh, ah okay, if Hikaru beats uh, Gukesh, no, if Hikaru beats Gukesh, then also one per. So even if it is a tie break, it will be three three player tie break or two player tie break. But four player is impossible now. Here's the thing: if Hikaru draws, yes, he's out. So if for Hikaru, it's a do or die situation. That's why he's going to play. Like it will be not a draw. Like Hikaru will definitely not agree to a draw. He'll try to play till the end. Three way tie break? No, even two play two uh, player tie break is possible. If Gukesh wins, ah no, okay, it's not possible, yeah. If let's say Gukesh draws, nah, it's possible. If Gukesh draws, and if Nepo or Karuana win, then it's a two player tie break, no. अच्छा कैमरा गुकेश का चला गया है और राइट देर कैमरा इज गॉन मे बी वी कैन जस्ट हैव द ओप्स ओके दैट्स ऑल्सो कूल मे बी वी कैन हैव अ थम नील यूर सो दैट सागर शाह किधर है तू वेटिंग फॉर यू आई वोट कम आज मैं थक गई सागर सो मेनी इमोशंस मजा आ गया आई टायर्ड बट आई एम वेरी हैप्पी
where's the standings i should have the standings actually these are the old ones okay never mind खाली तो नहीं दिखेगा फिर दिस इज फाइन सागर जी हेलो कॉल सागर वेर कैन आई फाइंड एन ऑनलाइन ट्यूटर फॉर माई सिक्स ईयर ओल्ड नीस वेर डू यू लिव I just wait for the pros call behind you to decide that it's now time to sleep. What Tulika? You can hear that. Are you serious? Hello, Amrita. Hey, worth it. Hi. Always waiting for you. It's always worth it. How are you? Great, Sagar. Wonderful. How are you? Must be a tiring, yeah, I'm good. Tiring day, for sure. Kind of, but also very much uh, excited. Also at the same time, you can say focused, uh, feeling a bit like it's too early to be happy. Uh, so it's just it's just this feeling that today Mukesh played well, and he's in the lead, but. it changes not much from my perspective apart from the fact that he has an edge which is that two results are fine for him uh, a draw is fine for him because it goes to the tie break for sure for him for sure uh, while if he had drawn today then he he was unsure at it so in a way he is definitely having the edge but on the flip side He meets Nakamura, who is very, very inspired tomorrow to win, because he knows only one result is going to work for him. At the same time, Nepo and Fabi also know only one result is going to work for them, which is to win. So then we come to this situation where three top players are coming with this intention to win uh, against this little seventeen-year-old boy. Seventeen-year-old <laughs> boy. I like how you put that. Uh, and it is a little bit uh, stressful you know in a sense like um, you know i was there around uh, vikesh's father and i saw him uh, like super focused not smiling at all like just because work is to be done today when vikesh went out from the building he entered directly into the van he did not interact with any fans and i could see from the faces of the fans that none of them were unhappy with this because they were all like okay gopi we don't need your autograph today you just go and rest today you know tomorrow is your game so i really like that no one actually was like it was generally before when some player goes away they're like oh, i needed him i needed a sign why couldn't he give me but today everyone was like oh we understand you have to go you know so they left that way uh and so i'm i'm in this uh really uh overwhelming situation amruta but in the end we all have to learn from mukesh how not to get overwhelmed and to focus and to get the job done no i think uh, today with in gukesh's game one of the most inspiring things was his decision to go on playing where he could have gone for a draw i think that was the epitome of inspiration because it's like what what else can inspire you more like isse jyada inspiration kya ho sakta hai yaar because you are in a state of pressure you can lose like because it's it's still there are complexities there is a night so on the board no, the only thing no so i think this one sagar this decision changes a lot of things in terms of whatever also happens but the attitude which he has shown on the board uh, nothing beats that yeah that's one of one story on its own Yes, 
and uh, Gukesh is winning on demand two games back to back in such high pressure is <laughs> insane, right? Crazy how it is, and that too when you are looking at him, like he is, uh, he is so much there in that pressure. I can't believe it, Sagar. At seventeen years of age, what maturity you have to um, not feel this pressure to have such kind of mental strength. Uh, in yeah. Your- I think we are on the verge of things changing massively, right? In the world of chess, if this if Gukesh wins, because it means that then we have a 17-year-old who is a challenger and so on. Um, because imagine Nakamura, Fabiano, or... Uh, yeah, that would not like shake, it won't shake the world. But if Gukesh... And you know, by the way, the it's very interesting that when in 2013, Magnus qualified... He was on the same score as Gukesh, eight and a half points out of thirteen, and the pairing was Gukesh, uh, sorry, Magnus versus Swidler, and uh, Kramnik versus Ivanchu, and both of them were on eight and a half. Kramnik and Carlson. Carlson lost to Swidler, so Kramnik, if he drew, he would have, uh, he would have won the won the candidates and challenged Anand. There would be have been another Kramnik Anand. But he lost to Ivanchuk. And so Magnus became the challenger. And you could, there is a beautiful photo, by the way, Amruta, of Magnus. Uh, after winning the candidates 2013, I really need you to send it to you and you should show it to the stream right now because that photo has made such a deep impression on me. It's uh, actually taken by a very... Well known photograph. Uh, maybe I don't know well known, but Morten Rake. Uh, can I send it to you on WhatsApp? Mm. Yeah. So you can take this out. This is the photo. Do you get it? Yes. And maybe you can show it on stream because uh it's it's basically magnus saying i won but i'm exhausted you know <laughs> because when you lose the final round and when the everything is in the hands of someone else and then ivanchuk beats kramnik and then they both have the same score and magnus wins on better tie break it's already a huge huge thing there was no there was no playoffs it was like who scores more wins so magnus had scored five wins while kramnik had scored uh, four four so in that way and uh, yeah it was it was massive and by the way we have our friend joining in hello bye <laughs> yeah mute or mute hello Hello, bye. Congratulations. Hi, congrats, 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 bye. <laughs> Today was such a massive day, right? Mental day, mental day, bro. You know, at 5 in the morning, we had like 15k, you guys had some 6k, 21k watching live for chess at 5 in the morning, why? Yeah, crazy. It blowing up, man. Chess is really blowing up. Yes. It was massive and also the fact that here, I will tell you one thing which I see is a little bit unusual in the media is that when Gukesh won, everyone was happy. Like I have never seen like, you know, because everyone's from different countries and they have their favorites. Some have Karuana, some have Nakamura. But with Gukesh, I was like, yes, let's go. And everyone came and started congratulating me and other Indians. So, you know, there's this sort of feeling that we need Gukesh to win because it's like a change of guard, right? If Gukesh wins the candidates, it's like a new generation has come forward. Because if Nepo, Hikaru or Fabi win, Why it's Nepo still the current. Nepo is still the current. Either Hikaru or either Gukesh is the current. It's fun. Dil is saying that Hikaru is the current. Sorry, Dil is saying that Gukesh is the current. And the current is the current. Okay? So, what is Dil saying? What is Dil saying? दोनों में से दोनों जीत सकते पता है ना आपको 
क्योंकि उसने प्रज्ञा नंदा को हरा दिया तो फैबी नेपो और हिकारो का सेम पॉइंट्स है आठ अच्छा पॉइंट्स हाँ आठ है ना उनके ऊपर हाँ फाइव जी सकता है नौ पे आ सकता है नौ पे आ सकता है ना वो तो हाँ नौ और गुकेश का कल ड्रॉ होता है समझो भाई गुकेश जीतेगा भाई कल भाई कल बहुत टफ है जीतना हिकारो के साथ ब्लैक से लास्ट कौन जीता था हिकारो गुकेश में ड्रॉ हुई थी हाँ ड्रॉ हुई थी कल वाइट्स है भाई हिकारो यार नहीं बहुत टफ है आज हिकारो हाँ मैं तो बोला आज गुकेश शुड कॉल विद विद फॉर सेकेंड कर रहा है सेकंड नहीं थोड़ा डिस्कशन करना चाहिए कि भाई कैसे हरा है? क्या है सच में सच में सच में बिग बिग सुपर चैट बाय जॉय दत्त कल नाउ आई कैन प्रॉक्सी लगा के खेल सकता है क्या कल विद वाज बीइंग मेड दिस इज अ प्योर मोमेंट ऑफ जॉय सच अ सेंस ऑफ सेटिस्फैक्शन सागर एंड अमृता मोस्ट ऑफ सच एड्रेनलिन एंड डोपामाइन इंट्रोड्यूसिंग स्पोर्टिंग मोमेंट्स ऑफ माय लाइफ आई हैव शेयर्ड विद यू ऑन स्ट्रीम थैंक्स फॉर एवरीथिंग Man, the thing is, the thing is, everyone is so invested in this because they know these people also well, and you know, I say it feels like our own. So that's our festival, boy. Our community's ka ye sabse ha. bada festival hai, you know. Ah, exactly. exactly. Everything has led to this. This is the dream of yes. the community this that the we dream. have an Indian world champion of chess, boy. This is the dream. And by the way, uh, Samay, boy. I have to Amrutha. I have shared a picture with you. Can you show it on stream? Maybe somebody. I also shared it with somebody, but I just want to share it here. Uh, this is something which yeah. not this. I have shared one more picture, Amrutha. By the way, like Samai, me this picture. Twenty years. Do you know this picture, Samai? It's basically Magnus after the winning twenty thirteen candidates because he was on eight ten or thirteen. भाई वो वाला जो खड़ा है नहीं वो ऐसे है वो Magnus. अरे हाँ वो है ना पीछे आ. And the thing is, Magnus was on same score as Hikaru. By the way, today this was the meetup we did in a park here in Canada before the round. जो मैं आपको बोला ना मैं निकल रहा हूँ. वो गंगरेज कौन है वो गोरा टोपी लगा के लाल. कहाँ? हाँ. Left में Santa Claus. भाई बहुत सारे एक दो foreigner भी थे. अरे वाह. Foreigner भी थे. अगर. हाँ देखे देखे foreigner भी थे. एक Mexico से आए थे. एक कोई और country से. Sorry, what happened? Wow. So so yeah, pe they all came and we we talked about chess. We talked about ah, uh, kya chal raha hai life me, wagera. I mean, the bahut acha meet up hua aise. So samay bhai, many people missed you. Everyone was talking. Also, when you come to Canada, where you have such a huge community waiting here. Bro, I feel so like loved and honored. You know, ek ek saal nikalenge tour karenge, sirf community se milke aayenge, bhai events karenge. It's amazing. And the thing is, एक जन वड़ा पाव लेके आया रोज आपके लिए कुछ खाने को लेके आता है आपको एसोसिएट करना कितना आसान है वाला क्या? ये देखो वड़ा पाव <laughs> और एक जन लेके आया बादाम का हलवा क्या बात है बनाया हुआ वो भी और एक जन लेके आया थेपले वो भी स्वीट आज तो आपका क्रेजी दिन है भाई खाना रात को दिन में पूनम पांडे सब मिल गया भाई आपको तो आज <laughs> तूने देखा क्या अमृता वो स्ट्रीम भाई वो स्ट्रीम पे पूनम पांडे आए थे और सागर जितना एक्साइटेड था ना आज इतना कभी नहीं कोई भी गेस्ट आता ना <laughs> कसम से मैं बता रहा हूँ तू मैं देखो इसमें एक्साइटेड नहीं कर रहा हूँ एक मोमेंट था जब चैट में आया अमृता रेड अमृता रेड क्योंकि सागर इतना ब्लश कर रहा था मैंने बोला उसने पूछा कौन है अमृता तो मैंने बोला अमृता है सागर की फ्रेंड है अमृता तो सागर ने उसपे मेरे को टोका भी नहीं ये भी नहीं बोला की मेरी वाइफ है उसने बस बोला जान दो जान दो मम्मी की कसम ये पार्ट हुआ है कि मैंने बोला अमृता फ्रेंड है <laughs> मैं आपने चेंज किया भाई 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 आपने आपने चेंज किया किया बताता हूं। आपने बोला अम्रुता रेड, अम्रुता रेड। तो तुम आपने बोला थैंक यू अमृता तो पूजा पांडे ने बोला थैंक यू अमृता उसने ऐसे नहीं पूछा अमृता कौन है मैंने बोला आपने फिर आपने फिर शारापन करने के लिए बोला अमृता इज हिस्स फ्रेंड ठीक है तो आप उस पर बोल सकते ना कि नो शीज माई वाइफ तो शीज माई फ्रेंड आपने कुछ गलत नहीं बोला था भाई कुछ नहीं इसने कुछ भी नहीं किया पूरा पॉज लिया उधर ऐसा भी नहीं कि मैंने इमीडिएटली नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस बोला हो उधर तीन सेकंड का पॉज है सागर शाह कैमरा को देख रहा है आंख वाख मार रहा है ऐसे कर रहा है फिर बोल रहा है कि ओके फिर मैंने मतलब और जो खुश था हर मूव पे ना वो मूव उतना अच्छा भी नहीं खेल रही था बोल रहा ओ माई गॉड बेस्ट मूव वाओ सच में तू जाके देख ले स्ट्रीम चाहिए तो नहीं नहीं मतलब इतना एक्साइट कभी नहीं हुआ है वो और वो वाइफ का मोमेंट खास कर तो, 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 भाई वो कली चेस सीखे थे 
अमृता रेड इसलिए आ रहा था क्योंकि वो कुछ ज्यादा ही खुश हो रहे थे तो चैट याद दिला रहे थे की भाई आपकी बीवी है अमृता रेड कर रहे थे चैट तो मैंने बोला हाँ चैट आते हुए हेल्प कर रहे थे जब मैंने बोला सागर से अमृता उसकी फ्रेंड है तो सागर ने बिल्कुल भी मेरे को टोका नहीं उधर क्यों नहीं टोका अमृता तू मुझे बता समय कितना नाटक कर रहा है बोल के कि इसकी फ्रेंड है वो डायरेक्टली बोल सकता है इसकी बीवी है करेक्ट उसको क्या नहीं तो, पता है कि समय तो को? टेस्ट ले रहा था ना अपने मजे ले रहा है एंड आई डेंट वांट टू मेक पूनम पांडे फील अनकंफर्टेबल ठीक है सो आई केप क्वाइट माय मेन एम इन दिस एंटायर थिंग वाज दैट शी शुड फील कंफर्टेबल एंड शी शुड कंटिन्यू प्लेइंग चेस इन हर लाइफ शी हैज डन मेनी लाइव स्ट्रीम्स वेयर यू नो दीस गाइस आर वाचिंग सो शी इज कंफर्टेबल भाई तो ऐसा कुछ नहीं भाई उसको मैंने आपको बोला कि भाई 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 की वाइफ है मैं थिंग इज आई वाज वेरी कीन दैट इफ शी लाइक्स चेस शी शुड कंटिन्यू प्लेइंग इन हर लाइफ आप तो इस तरह से आए थे कि नहीं होने से क्या रिलेशन था तो वो समझ भी नहीं आ रहा अभी तक हां वो ही मुझे मजाक के लिए देना ये लोग मजाक कर रहे जैसे अभी तू मुझे बता उनका ना इन एनी अदर स्ट्रीम विल समय एनीवे टेल यू टेल दैट अमृता इज योर फ्रेंड it's it's it feels bad for that person where you are making fun of her so i kept quiet i was like theek hai shant rehte hai let's not convince kar diya hai samay let's not nahi let's not to to dekhna to baad mein dekhna stream dekha nahi hai maine kuch bhi main sirf stream shuru kiya to mujhe aaya justice for amrita justice for amrita bahut der tak tha to main bola kya hua hai kyunki mere ko zero idea hai main to soi pone 7 baje pagal jaise soi thi main So, अभी मेरे को आज ऐसा सब पता चल रहा है सागर सो so, प्रूफ तो है वहां पे देखना तो पड़ेगा क्या हो गया है करके सवाल तो पूछेंगे हम आपसे माय ओनली एम अलोंग विद समय सी व्हाट समय डज इज दैट ही ब्रिंग्स न्यू पीपल इनटू चेस करेक्ट इट ही वर्क्स एक्सट्रीमली हार्ड टू गेट दीज पीपल आई आई कैन ओनली इमेजिन हाउ ही मस्ट हैव गॉटन पूनम पांडे टू कम बिकॉज़ शी इज ऑफ कोर्स बिजी एंड सो नाउ माय ओनली एम इज to make sure that they have a good time and they are comfortable and never want to make people feel that they came into a chess stream and went back with bad energy that is very important bhale wo fir dhruv rathi ho unam pande ho ya fir wo jo mallika sharma wale ajju bhai ho ya koi bhi ho aise so remember na matlab ajju bhai ke sath bhi we had certain things which happened we all were quiet shant the But so, I thought did not know in that moment, na. I, I don't. I will not be quiet. But in that moment, I also so didn't know. No, I was very yeah, excited. Ki, why, why? This is a state level player. Badiya khel raha hai. So that went off. But the end thing is that we always want new people to spread the sport. But this moment which happened, where you said Amruta raid, Amruta raid. Yes, lighter rope, boy. मुझे ही करने से कर लिया है आपने तो मतलब बताओ मुझे ये सच है कि नहीं करके जो मैं बेचता तो अमृता बेचता मैं तेरे को चैट तो कैरोसिन ही डालेगी ना अमृता तुझे तो पता है क्या सच है क्या मेरे को मैं लिंक भेजता हूँ तो बाद में देखना भाई पर भाई बात तो ये है कि डेट्स तो करता रहेगा अमृता सागर सबके साथ पर ये कैंडिडेट जो है भाई इसके अंदर गुकेश का अब सीरियस चांस हो गया भाई कल हिकारो भाई ये कौन है आपके पीछे भाई मीडिया रूम मतलब अच्छा अच्छा तो भाई कल क्या लगता है ऑनेस्टली क्या लगता है कल क्या होगा मुझे ऐसे लगता है कल हिकारू और गुकेश का ड्रॉ होगा और फैबी और नेपो में से कोई जीत के टाइम ब्रेक में जाएगा और फिर 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 पता नहीं यार ऐसा मत पूछो कि फाइनल रिजल्ट क्या होगा पर मुझे ऐसे फीलिंग आ रहा है कि फाइनल रिजल्ट उसमें कोई डाउट नहीं है भाई दो साल और रुकना पड़ेगा भाई अगर नहीं हुआ इस बार तो रुकेंगे भाई रुकना ऐसा थोड़ी ना भाई मैं क्या बोलता हूँ मैं क्या बोलता हूँ पता है think about it the way i thought when i did my visa and i said i am going to canada my only hope was ki indian should play well so that we all are interested i never thought that when you have a nepo hikaru fabi that any indian can win it because it's very tough candidates theek okay? hai so i was like sab acha khelenge we will enjoy that is the best 13 round tak we enjoyed nahi hui to enjoyment ke upar ka upar ho gaya matlab leader कल भी मजा आएगा बहुत 
भाई रात के पांच बजे तक लोग अपना स्लीप साइकिल सब छोड़ के क्लासिकल मैच देख रहे हैं ब्रो दे हैव वर्क टुमारो बट दे आर सैक्रिफाइसिंग इट फॉर द मैच एंड यू नो इट्स लाइक चेस्ट फीवर इज राइजिंग अगेन ऐसा फील हो रहा है ब्रो यस्टरडे आई वाज स्ट्रीमिंग एट 4 इन द मॉर्निंग जस्ट रैंडम कैजुअल चेस यू नो हाउ मेनी पीपल आर वाचिंग 11000 पीपल ब्रो भाई आप तो किल ही कर रात के 4 बजे भाई चार बजे के बीच में तुमको हमेशा आता था ना वाचिंग पहले 4 बजे देखते थे 3 चार हजार लोग ही देखते थे आई फील आई फील समय हैज ये टूर्नामेंट के पहले ही ही केम बैक एंड स्टार्टेड स्ट्रीमिंग एंड डिड ऑल द कोलैब्स एंड ऑल एंड दैट हैज रियली रेज द इंटरेस्ट people are going crazy bro like of course like i was absent for 2 years so chess base india has done their uh, lot of work bro you guys have really killed it by matlab it's a dream we are seeing right now community is active players are playing the best chess sagar shah ka finally divorce ho raha hai like it's <laughs> literally like you know the dream come true <laughs> and amruta i felt it's like a divorce hoga i would i thought and i thought that divorce hoga because i would meet someone in canada but problem to wahi hai same mere life mein samay rahe na problem in your life samay rahe na i mean next collab already mai lock kar le sagar se are you be where kon hai kon hai kitni bataunga mai abhi batana malika sherawat no chance no chance you know amruta today i had like how how uh, intense was my day like i woke up i did all of the work jo bhi editing then there was this uh, stream then i had an interview with someone who's producing one of the most amazing documentaries on chess matlab ye documentary ka jo set unhone banaya tha na mera interview ke liye wo sirf mere interview ke liye unhone itne sare camera laaye the char aur pura setup it was like 10000 dollars नहीं मैं दे रहा था मेरा खुद का सो so, वो तुम्हारा इंटरव्यू हाँ, दे रहे थे ओ हाँ, 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 तो वो मैंने किया फिर मैं गया यहाँ पे मीटअप पे वहां सौ से ज्यादा लोग आए थे एंड देन व्हेन वी सेड वी विल वॉक डेढ़ किलोमीटर था ठीक है फ्रॉम द पार्क टू द वेन्यू पचास लोग चल के आए पूरा डेढ़ किलोमीटर मैं सच बोल रहा हूँ ऐसे प्रोसेशन जैसा था एंड यू नो ऐसे सब साथ में चल रहे थे रास्ते पे वो क्वीन स्ट्रीट पे भाई भाई हाँ बोलो बोलो फिर फिर यहाँ पे आए ना नीचे तो जगह बहुत कम है ना वेन्यू के तो सब लोग ने ऐसे दो लाइन बनाए ठीक है और जो प्लेयर आ रहे हैं ना सब लोग लाइक वो जो फुटबॉलर्स को करते हैं ना वो ऐसे जा रहे हैं सब तो ये सब शूट किया है पर लगाता हूँ अभी एपिक है एपिक अगर ये होता है ना पांच सौ लोग आएंगे भाई अगर गुकेश जीत गया ना भाई ये जब आएगा वापस वो सागर भाई हाँ आपको पता रहेगा कब आ रहा है कौन सी फ्लाइट से आ रहा है वो हाँ वो एक दिन पहले आ रहा है मेरे से तो आप मेरे को सारे फ्लाइट डिटेल्स सब भेजना मैं एयरपोर्ट पर बंदे जमा करके प्रॉपर बोल रही हूँ ताकि जैसे जहाँ भी जाएगा भाई वो भाई जाएगा भाई पूरा तमिलनाडु गवर्नमेंट भी करेंगे ना वो भाई सब पहुंच जाएंगे भाई कम्युनिटी लेके गवर्नमेंट लेके सब पहुंच जाएंगे माला वाला डालेंगे उसको हाथी पे बिठा के ले जाएंगे अमृत तुम भी जाना चेन्नई चलेगी ना चेन्नई चलेगी ना भाई चेन्नई नहीं पता तू जा रहा है ना मैं तो जाऊंगा भाई हाँ, मैं तो जाऊंगा ओह माय गॉड सचिन बोला वीजा अरे 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 सचिन 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 भाई भाई छोड़ दो अभी आप देख लो कल घर से भाई उसने उसको भी आना है लिखने को समय डिवोर्स गैम्बिट ये एक लाइन के लिए उसने चार दिया देख चार सौ रूपए सुबह सुबह वही तो मैं बोल रहा हूँ भाई अमृता ऑलरेडी आ रही तेरे पास मतलब मेरे पास ज्यादा कुछ नहीं है भाई भाई सागर भाई उसने भी कहा था ना हिकार लेवी भी आएगा अगर हिकारू गया तो ओ हाँ हाँ हिकारू जीतेगा तो लेवी आएगा करेक्ट बट गुकेश के लिए नहीं आएगा भाई लेवी और लेवी बेचारा हो उसको किधर तो जाना है क्रैमनिक वर्सेज जॉसपेम मैच के लिए जाना है उसको जॉसपेम कौन है भाई भाई वो होजे मार्टिन है जो होजे मार्टिन है कौन है आपको नहीं पता इतना बड़ा ये हुआ था क्रैमनिक अलेज्ड हिम ऑफ चीटिंग 
तो एक जन ने बोला हम पैसे डाल रहे हैं ओवर द बोर्ड मैच कर रहे क्रैमनी को भाई ये कहा था आपने यहाँ इस बंदे का यार किसका <laughs> कौन <laughs> भाई उनका करके क्या मतलब है <laughs> भाई मजा आएगा भाई लोग तो देखेंगे भाई <laughs> वो नहीं करते भाई उनको ही ऑलरेडी बहुत बड़े गेम आ रहे हो सर्कल जैसा बन गया था सब बोल रहे थे फिर एक दो बच्चे खेलने लगे चेस तो बोले सागर भाई आप कॉमेंट्री करो तो मैं बच्चों के गेम में उनके सामने सब लोग ऐसे खड़े रह के देख रहे थे गेम एंड देन Finally, it started snowing. तो हम अंदर गए और आसिम हेड ब्रॉड कॉफी फॉर एवरी वन डोनट सब ऐसे था तो आसिम डेड रियली लॉर्ड ऑफ वर्क तो इसके लिए दैट वॉज अमेजिंग एंड बस ऐसी यू नो इट वॉज नॉट नो प्लान देर वॉज नथिंग जस्ट मीटिंग एंड आई फेल्ड एवरी वन कूड कनेक्ट विथ ईच अदर वो भी एक बड़ी बात होती है ना कि ये सबको एक चेस कनेक्ट कर रहा है बट अब एक दूसरे के साथ कनेक्ट होके क्या पता क्या होगा लाइक यू नो दे मे ऑल्सो फाइंड सम फ्रेंड सम न्यू आइडियाज ऐसे Yeah. ये तो मैं आपसे ही सीखा है भाई ये सब कम्युनिटी बिल्डिंग ये हो सब सो इट इज समथिंग व्हिच इट वाज एपिक एंड लॉट ऑफ पीपल सेड वी वी केम इनटू दिस स्पोर्ट बिकॉज़ ऑफ समय सो आई थिंक दे ऑल मेनी ऑफ देम हैव एंटर्ड इट हियर बट देन द प्लेयर्स हैव परफॉर्म्ड एंड एवरीथिंग सो दे हैव स्टक अराउंड यू नो लाइक आई से इट वाज इट वाज अमेजिंग समय वी लेफ्ट आल्सो बिकॉज़ ऑफ समय ओनली <laughs> मैं चार साल से रीडिंग 1700 कर रहा हूं भाई अभी तक भाई ऐसा कोई रहेगा जो बोलेगा कि मैं वो दिन जो स्ट्रीम हुई थी समय और पूनम पांडे और यशराज जी उसके वजह से मैं चेस में आया और फिर कोई तो रहेगा कोई तो रहेगा कोई तो रहेगा ना कोई तो, रहे रहे ना, कोई तो आज तुम्हें क्यों चाहिए और फिर ऐसे कोई तो रहेगा मुझे लगता है उल्टा रहेगा कोई हमारे चेस स्ट्रीम की वजह से पूनम पांडे देख रहा होगा आज रात को कि घोड़ा तो रोज खिलाता हूं Bye bye bye. <laughs> Guys, I wanted to show you something. Look at this. Arey, let's go, bye. Look at this. How many votes we got today? Thirty-one thousand votes. That's mental, bye. Oh, that's Thirty-one mental. Thirty-one thousand and seventy-three percent voted. Gukesh wins all hearts. And सही था ना ये. You know when when I, जब भाई समय भाई when I asked Gukesh कि 40th मुंह पे repetition हुआ तब आप draw करने का सोच रहे थे क्या ऐसे ही press conference में एक सवाल पूछ लिया मैंने तो वो बोलते हैं क्या draw क्यों तो मैं बोला I'm computer was showing equal बोला वो I can't believe मतलब उसको लगा वो जीती रहा था oh ऐसा था उसका mindset वो वो देखा था Queen G6 miss किया था उसने Queen G6 था उसके पास एकदम ही strong जब उसने वो Queen D कुछ तो खेला था और खेला क्वीन जी फाइव खेला था तब नाइनटी सिक्स और क्वीन जी सेवन और फिर जी जी फाइव में एंटर हो रहे थे वही ना नहीं क्वीन क्वीन जी सिक्स सीधा खेल सकता था ऐसा कुछ तो बहुत अजीब सी लाइन क्वीन एट सिक्स क्वीन एट सिक्स क्वीन एट सिक्स क्वीन एट सिक्स यस हाँ 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 वो उसने मिस किया बट उसने क्वीन जी फाइव खेला तो उसने क्वीन जी सिक्स खेल भाई लेकिन मजा आ गया भाई अली रिजा ने ना अच्छा दे दिया अपने गिफ्ट लास्ट में समय जो रनिंग आउट टाइम ऑफ लॉग रनिंग आउट सेकंड्स वाव भाई इक्वल भाई मतलब तू 1200 वो रहता है ना पूरा रीचिंग 1600 रीचिंग 1200 वैसे वाला तो रीचिंग व्हेन यू रीच 1200 तुझे लगता है अरे क्या ही हो गया मैं मैग्नेट तो इसमें जोक का है लेकिन ये तो वो है ना <laughs> जोक नहीं <laughs> ये जोक नहीं अच्छा ठीक है ये कैसा है एवरीवनस लाइक एवरीवन लाइफ इज लाइक अ चेस गेम मे मेक सेंस व्हाई आई एम करेंटली वर्किंग इन माय 17th कंपनी आई कीप रिजाइनिंग बाय द वे एक जन ने मेरे लिए क्या लाया पता है ये देखो अगर रुक रे बाबा तू बीच में बहुत बड़बड़ बड़बड़ करता रहता है रुक थोड़ा कमन ढोकला इन द प्रेस इन द प्रेस रूम आई हैव अ बड़ा पाव ठीक है आई हैव 
आई हैव अ खमन ढोकला एंड आई हैव बादाम का हलवा तो मेरा पूरा डिनर विद फुल स्टार्टर मिडल कोर्स एंड डेजर्ट है और मैं इधर आराम से बैठ के काम कर सकता डोंट हैव टू थिंक अबाउट गोइंग फॉर डिनर भाई क्रेजी है भाई का नहीं तो नींद लग जाएगी गुकेश का गेम पहले एनालिसिस का कर लिंक आया तो भेजना वो लेकिन खाना भी कम्युनिटी दे रही है पैसा भी कम्युनिटी दे रही है कल को रोटी कपड़ा मकान में वहीं से आएगा भाई जब फाइव स्टार होटल भी कम्युनिटी बुक करेगी फीडर भी करेगा कभी तो करेगा फिर ये देख हां व्हेन आई व्हेन आई केम हियर आल्सो रहने का सम गाय हेड हेल्प मी अरे बेस्ट भाई भारी भाई कैसा है देख मुझे तो फन लगा ये फनी है ना मुझे लगा कास्टलिंग वो कास्टलिंग करना चाहिए था ओपन <laughs> ये मुझे बेस्ट लगा वाइट पीसेस सेलिब्रेटिंग पार्टी आफ्टर डिफीटिंग ब्लैक किंग डिड यू ड्रिंक एट द पार्टी नो प्रूव मी बाय वॉकिंग अ स्ट्रेट लाइन ब्र इट्स अ नाइट एक्चुअली समय पैनल में है ये जो कांटेस्ट के बड़ी उस वो जिस तरह से उसको हंसने को आया वो अलग रहेगा ना बिकॉज़ वो तो सुपर एक्स वो तो ग्रैंड मास्टर है इसमें तो हाँ तो ये अच्छा नहीं था इफ ही स्माइल्स और लाफ्स देन ये क्यूट ये क्यूट जोक ऐसे मतलब है ना ऐसे फोर्थ के बच्चे को सुनाओ मजा आएगा उसके वाले इट्स नाइस क्यूट क्यूट जोक कि भाई घोड़ा नहीं चल सकता स्ट्रेट तो घोड़ा से ड्रंक वैसे ये बहुत पुराना मीम है वैसे चेस का एक अच्छा जिसमें वैसे पुलिस पकड़ के रखती है दो घोड़ों को बोलती है बताओ स्ट्रेट लाइन में चलो और नहीं तो वैसे देखते हैं वो हां पता नहीं था व्हाट विल हैपन इफ अल्कोहलिक पीपल प्ले चेस दे विल प्ले स्कॉच गैम्बिट ये अच्छा था ठीक है भाई तेरी कसम कैसे खाओ बिशप तो सैक करना ही पड़ेगा ना क्योंकि उसने तीन मर जाएगा तू अच्छा मर मर जाएगा तू मर जाएगा मर जाएगा तू नॉट बैड मैं अपना रोश में कितना मस्त जोक्स है भाई वो याद है वो विदित भाई कुछ इलीगल किया है कभी किंग से किंग को चेक दिया है अपना वो बहुत पुराना रोश था भाई वो याद है वो पुणे में मैं आया था मेरा पूरा दिन कह रहा था आपको सुनाया सब लोग ने बोला भाई चेंज करना पड़ेगा नहीं तो कल जूते पड़ेंगे <laughs> भाई करते हैं और एक रोस्ट करते हैं भाई मजा आएगा नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट क्या है नेक्स्ट अभी इधर थोड़ा नहीं है पर दिखा सकते हो रुक 1 सेकंड कैसे है तेरे हिसाब से सब जो जोक्स ट्राई कर रहे हैं लोग अच्छा है एवरीवन इज ट्राइंग अच्छा था क्या मतलब तुम्हारे हिसाब से कंसीडर स्टैंडअप के लिए बहुत ही मैं अच्छा अच्छा है क्यूट जोक्स है भाई क्यूट जोक्स है क्या वाह समय ने ऐसे बोला फिर तो बढ़िया है सागर नहीं तुमको देखना है और बाय द वे गाइस आई हां भाई एक चीज अपना रह गया ना एक लास्ट बात करने को कि वैशाली ने चार विन किया ऑन ऑन अ रो इन अ रो फोर आउट ऑफ फोर दैट्स एपिक बट लाइक स्टैंडिंग्स में वेयर शी इज नाउ um i think she is on third place no let me check no 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 fourth or fifth fifth ah fifth fifth place hai, but but she is she is joint joint on third, third place yes. fourth place humpy bhi hai so if tomorrow vaishali wins she might reach second place you know joint second yeah third which is amazing because she was on the last place yeah yeah exactly it's a, and she was on the last place with one and half points difference और उसके बाद फोर विनिंग फोर इज डिफिकल्ट आल्सो वी सॉ निजात इन द इट्स नॉट इजी टू मेक दैट कम बैक सो ठीक है या देखते हैं कल मिलते हैं सब सागर सागर भाई कोर्स बनाते हैं भाई जब आप फ्री होगे तो हां भाई मैंने आपको तो मेक सोच लिया है चीजें कैसे बनाना है मैं बस वो नहीं सोच पा रहा हूं शुड आई अपलोड ऑन माय मेन चैनल और शुड आई क्रिएट अ न्यू चैनल कॉल्ड बीएम समय भाई एक समय बीएम समय प्लीज करो मैं बोल रहा हूं क्योंकि चेस इज ग्रोइंग ना और वो जो समय रहा है ना चैनल है ना हाँ. वहाँ पे आप स्ट्रीमिंग करो और जो कंटेंट जो आप रिकॉर्डेड कर रहे हो ना वो बीएम समय रायना पे सब आया देखो जैसा कुछ कुछ बहुत मजेदार मैच हो परसों एक इंडिया पाकिस्तान का चेस मैच हुआ उसमें बहुत मजा आया मेरे को अजीब सा मतलब बहुत मस्त गेम खेला फन खेला 
अब वो अलग से क्लिप करके डाल सकता हूं आई थिंक यू नो ऐसे मैं वही मैं बोल रहा हूं ना अपने मेन चैनल को आपका कॉमेडी का रखो एंड लाइव स्ट्रीमिंग ठीक है हां और बीएम समय रहने को फुल चेस कर दो ना कर सकते हैं कर सकते हैं आपको फिर आपको कुछ टेंशन ही नहीं है उधर फिर कितने भी आप डाल सकते हो चेस के कर सकता हूं हां करेक्ट है करेक्ट एनीथिंग दैट स्टॉप्स यू फ्रॉम एक्सप्रेसिंग योरसेल्फ दैट शुडंट हैपन दैट्स आई सॉ यू इन पूनम पांडे स्ट्रीम यू नो Why did you ask her whether she enjoyed or not? Yeah, she messaged. She said she had a lot of fun, and the hosts were very good, especially that bald guy. She said, <laughs> bald guy. Yeah, yeah. She said I can show you her message. Dikha, 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 dikha. This dikha, dikha, boy. Instagram. Oh, he is. Look, look, look! How excited I am, Sakshi. Look, look, look! Show, 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 show. Dikha, 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 dikha. Dikha, भाई कुछ तो कर रहा है भाई टाइप कर रहा है <laughs> आवाज नहीं आ रहा है म्यूट हो गया भाई भाई म्यूट हो गया भाई कुछ भी सुनाई नहीं दे रहा है कुछ तो भाई कर रहा है नहीं आवाज नहीं आ रहा है हां अभी सुनाई नहीं दे रहा मैंने कहा देखो कितना एक्साइटेड हो रहा है सागर से देखा पहले दिखाओ ना भाई मैसेज देखा कितना डेस्परेट हो रहा है सागर से देखने के लिए मैसेज अमृता तो देखा है इसको ऐसे कभी ये तो आज मैं क्या ही बोलूं अभी मैंने तो क्या क्या सुना है सागर के बारे में कि कानों पे विश्वास नहीं हो रहा है सागर विश्वास नाम की कोई भाई अमृता तो आज से गुकेश की जीत गुकेश जीत जीता है उसकी खुशी में सो जा खाली फोकट ये इसके वाले में मत पड़ <laughs> मत पड़ मतलब मैं कैसे भाई सोचो भाई सोचो सोचो केश जीता है सब खुश है ये कॉल के बाद अमृता मुझे कॉल करती है और बोलती है क्या किया रे तूने क्या किया और हमारा झगड़ा होता है आप कॉट एंड फोर के बाय द वे देख मेरे भेज रहा है सागर भाई आपको क्या मैसेज उसका तुम दोनों को अभी मैं एंड कर रही हूं तुम लोग बाद में बड़बड़ कर लो मेरा ताकत गॉन है मैं खत्म कर रही हूं स्ट्रीम गाइस सुपर चैट दिए यस सोनी बोलता इट वुड बी वेरी स्ट्रेंज इवन इफ ऑल फोर प्लेयर्स ड्रॉ देन वर्ल्ड चैंपियनशिप विल बी बिटवीन प्लेयर्स ऑफ टू मोस्ट पॉपुलेटेड नेशंस लोल अरे मजा आएगा भाई भाई आई एम टेलिंग यू लुक लुक भाई 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 ए शो इफ गुकेश विंस इफ गुकेश म्यूट यू आर म्यूटेड यू आर म्यूटेड You can see their faces. No, you guys are muted. Bye. I'm so, talking about Gukesh. No, I'm, I'm muting you. Sagar, I want please, to mute. Please. <laughs> okay, me. Both are muted. Guys, Sachin says, "Some I never laughs at jokes from others. I tried two times in his USA tour when he gives audience a chance." Karab jokes na tu ne, bhai. I laugh. Woman snacks dalta kar kar acha joke. Wo joke dala tha usne mere ko hansi aayi us pe ki bhai Amruta, which wife always knows where her husband is? अच्छा <laughs> Actually, what happens after we die? We don't know where the people go. So, ये भी question कि that person knows very certainly कि कहाँ है husband is also a very tough thing. नहीं right? भाई, she just knows is up there. ठीक है. Hmm. I laughed at Jayesh's joke. That was a good joke. The samosa joke. Ah, भाई वो तो बहुत basic था. Samosa वाला बहुत सही था. Samosa वाला. अच्छा लगा नहीं भाई. I am eagerly waiting for today's vlog. Bolta hai joy. If you keep a separate subscription mm. fee for today's vlog, we'll be bid the highest for it. Aisa bol raha hai. Aaj bhai bhai bhai. And Sagar bhai, please see plan for something for tomorrow as well. We make this Sunday super awesome for Indian chess. Gukesh for the win. Abhishek Patel came from Montreal to Toronto for the final round. Bol raha hai Abhishek Patel. Kya baat? Guys, I will. I will try. I will try. I will try. Dekho, I'm. I will try my best. If. Gukesh wins tomorrow, ठीक है? Mm-hmm. Then twenty second closing ceremony, and there is nothing on that day. So I will try to ask him and request him and his family that let's do a meet up before the closing ceremony in the same park, and then everyone can come and just cheer for him, and then he goes to closing ceremony. Thus, me to I can come. I will ask him. ठीक है? So this is a good plan. But अगर समझो tie break होता है, then there is very little time. Then maybe it won't happen. 
Okay. Okay, guys. I got it. Sagar is going to try his best. It's amazing. Akash Mandage, 2,501 rupees. Thank you. Raj Rajpurkar, Ritwik Tomar, Krish Pahilani, Mia Khalifa, Rohit Deshmukh, Shubham Vishen, Anirudh Bhutani. Thank you, all of you. Hey, I'm independent. Daniel Sati. What are you doing? I don't know. 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 I वैसे भी भाई आपको बड़ा इंफॉर्मेशन है सायद भाई सब कुछ भाई मैं सच बोल रहा हूं आपसे मेरे को सच में नाउ आई सी निकलेश एंड आई एम लाइक आई सवालो आई सवालो तो मुझे कुछ नहीं पता था भाई कुछ नहीं <laughs> यही यही सेम उसके साथ हो रहा है जो मेरे साथ आई होप ऐसा ही हो उसके साथ भी जैसा आपके साथ हुआ भाई इवन वी आर मिलियनर भाई निखिलेश भाई ने तो पूरा टूर्नामेंट एक रजिस्टर करवा दिया आज सर्कुलर निकाल दिया एंड ही हैज ऑलरेडी वो ये क्या है बाय 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 ये बस से मुकेश अपने ऑफिस में आया था तब का कोर्स का है गए आई थिंक दिस इज मेन मेन वी वॉक डाउन द स्ट्रीट यू ब्लेंड इन विद द क्राउड एक्सेलेंस के लिए मुकेशन एक्सेलेंस ये विद्यालय स्टेशन यू अ सेकंड ग्लांस एंड यू आर जस्ट ऐसे दिखाया था कि ही इज when he walks amongst the public but when you step up to the plate like, something know, no shifts in the air stops in everything a spark inside you ignites so it can be become as a khada hai it's not on the fair chal raha hai koi nahi usko bula raha hai unleash your inner but passion let your true yeah. potential yeah. take yeah. flight yeah. that that sab uska jeevan se nikle hai to ye fir abhi और इन दैट मोमेंट यू आर नॉट जस्ट अ कॉमन फेस ये इधर ही खेलते हैं आप पता है यू आर अ फ्यूज वॉरियर अ मास्टर ऑफ योर आई वुड गेट वाज मैं मोड़ वाला था आई वो वीडियो फ्रॉम रियाक्शन ठीक है वो जीत इधर हो गया तो भाई उसमें रियाक्ट करेंगे इतना गुस्सा आया हूं अमृता भाई देखना क्या क्या हम उतना ही जॉब बड़बड़ कर रही थी उसमें भाई मेरे को एकदम क्या हुआ था अभी करेंगे ना रिएक्ट हम तीन ही करेंगे रिएक्ट हां उसमें मेरे बड़बड़ की उसमें मैं इसके इसके साथ आ रही थी तो मैं उसमें वैसे ही टाइम पास कर रही थी पूरा मैं रोस्ट कर रही भाई अगर मैं वो गेम जीत जाता ना यार अमृता यार भाई भाई मिलियन मिलियन होते हैं वो व्यूज तेरे को ही आता है एड रेवेन्यू पर तू थोड़ा तू थोड़ा जीतता था वो वैसे भी मेरी बड़बड़ नहीं रहती थी तो भी थोड़ी ना तू जीतता था कुछ भी वो भी सही है तेरे को जीतने देता था क्या है चांस तेरे को हराया ना मैंने परसों भूल गई वापस आ मैं तो 7 बजे की सब बातें याद भी नहीं है रे मेरे को खेलना वापस खेलना है एग्जाम से पहले ये देख 